Hello, good morning. Happy Monday. I hope you're all doing good. Ollie, please. Ollie, please. Hello. Oh my gosh. Mm -mm. Ollie, that's my toast. How dare you? Has anyone told you today that I'm glad we've been friends for 53 months, meow? 53 months. No. Well, guess what? I'm glad we've been friends for 53 months, meow. Three who would have thought we'd be where we are today. Best friends with three YouTube channels. <laughs> three. Awesome. God. Today I'm interested in what you have to say with your insight and give you the space to say it. Thank you. So this is me providing that space. But before you dump your wisdoms, I want to say that I was looking up synonyms for happy and I found kit in a hoop. So yeah. Not it censoring it because it says cock a hoop. I forgot that was enabled. I guess it doesn't need to be enabled anymore. <laughs> oh my god. Kitten a hoop. Sorry. It's now kitten a hoop. Gosh, Lion. How dare you say that? Offensive word. Lord have mercy. Light, thank you so much for the 53 months in the tier three. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing support for so long. I know it's wild. We've been on so much over, I don't, how many years is that? I don't even know. I can't math. That's too many months. You know, I feel like we're getting to the point where like, I love you. you know, those people who refer to their like four year old in months, that's what is happening to me. And it's breaking my brain. It's breaking my brain. And I wish it would just say three years and X months or whatever it is because I can't keep up and I can't handle it anymore. Okay. Cause it could just like roll over. Oh my gosh. Anyways. Um, thank you for the 53 months light. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing support. Four and a half. Gosh, almost four and a half. That's wild. That's absolutely wild. Next month is officially four and a half years. Jeez. Uh, goodness gracious. 
That's so much. Um, but good morning. I hope you're all doing good. Let me scroll up. Hold on. Um, Highlight and Gash and Xenox and Tiffany. Hello. And Monk and Sunny and uh, Panda. Hello. Good morning. BC. Hi. How you doing? Uh, Shinsu. Hello. Jamal. Hello. Welcome in. Nala, I hope you have good lurkies and stuff, by the way, doing your, uh, doing your work. And Tings. Nia. Hi. Krug. Hi. Miss Mirica. Hello. Welcome in. Good morning. Um, Rayanne, hello. Hi, hi. Cat girl, welcome as well. I hope you're doing good. Uh, me, 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 Magsy, hello. Good morning, good morning. Lexa, hi. Good morning. Hope you're doing good. You never know who might donate a few bits for some investors. That is true, Monk. Yeah. That's true, that's true. Hello? Hello? Thank you so much for continuing your gifty sub. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing and wonderful support. I really appreciate you. That was super kind. Hey, 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 all I know. I hope I you're doing good. Welcome you. in. <clears throat> um, I hate that so much. If the kid is a year, kid is a year old, say one year, not 12 months. Yeah. Gosh. Gosh, for what are you doing? Ollie, stop. Stop, 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 stop. stop. Don't try to, no. Don't eat my mouse cable. Gash, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Hey, I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Thank you for being so sweet and wonderful. I appreciate you so much. Gashifer, listen, I need a full name for him because Gash is not threatening enough. Like when I get mad at Oliver, I call him Oliver, you know? Like I need a full name for Gash. Or am I gonna say Gash out? No, I don't like that. So it's Gashifer now. <laughs> it's gash for now okay um so thanks um but gosh thank you so much for the five <laughs> thank you so much for the five gifted subs i appreciate you so much thank you thank you for being so sweet and wonderful and welcoming five friendos into the sub fam with all like cute emos and um and um stop and no ads <laughs> I'm fighting Ollie, who's trying. He's trying to fight. Oggy -oggy. He's trying to eat my mouse Sorry, cable. I don't have much to give to Xy Love. So I'm like constantly trying to like stop him from pawing and eating at my mouse cable. Anyways, um, Panda, thank you for the hundred bitties. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Thank you for being so sweet. I appreciate you. No, you're perfect. I adore you. I just appreciate you being here and spending your time here. Um, I'm 65, but I'm surviving. I hope you're having a good morning. You got this, Lexa. I'm so proud of you. You're doing amazing. How was my weekend? It was good, Ryan. How was yours? Did you have any do anything fun? Parents who say this is my 360 month son. Yeah, I can't keep up. I cannot keep up with that. No way. No way, no way. Hi, Nia. I hope you're doing good. Ollie's doing tech work. Well, if he wants a snack, okay, they'll get snacks. Don't worry. They'll get it. Feels more baddie than I deserve. Listen, uh, you deserve it. You absolutely deserve that. Moonflower, hi! I hope you're doing good. Hope you're all well. I hope you're well. Welcome in. Good morning. Happy Monday. <clears throat> Gashifer can pick up the extra. <laughs> what? Gash free, gash linear, gashium, gashium. I don't like gashium. Mm -mm. Not that though. <laughs> But all right, I guess very lazy. Forced myself to learn how to use OBS. <gasps> Ooh, I'm proud of you. That's a big step, bestie. You're going to crush it. You got this. You're doing amazing. I had a very lazy weekend as well, which is always nice. And, 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 and actually, I need to update the, uh, I need to update the, um, YouTube commands because Light and I did something over the weekend and we officially made a VOD channel on YouTube, um, which has all of our Disney Dramat Valley VODs from like February up there now. That way that they can be archived actually forever. Um, Cause Twitch only keeps them for like two months or something like that. And then after that, they're gone forever. So we have all of like it. If unpacking playthrough isn't there suing, well, it's gone bestie, I'm sorry. <laughs> It's already all over my recommended, <laughs> as it should be, as it should be. That's funny, though. Um, so let me actually update the commands, the YouTube commands. 
Um, so we have here are God, I have three YouTube channels. It's wild. So we have gaming channel, movie commentary channel, and then we have what emoji should I use for the VOD channel? Maybe that's just this Ooh, a camera. Camera's kind of cute. Yeah. The movie clicky thingy. Oh gosh, what's that called? What's that called? Oh wait, what? Yes, hi. That would make sense for the React channel though. That is true. What is that thing called? Clipboard. Is it really? No. That's like like that's like the Wait, is it? It's called Clapperboard. That's what it's called. Close, close, close. Clapperboard. <clears throat> A clapperboard, yeah. So VOD channel, I don't know. Maybe I could do like a, I guess I could just do like a person. I don't know. That makes it feel vloggy. It's not a vlog channel. <laughs> Hi, MB. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello. Hi, Spoonie. I hope you're doing absolutely amazing. <clears throat> me on the YouTube algorithm. Do not cite the deep magic to me, which I was there when it was written. <laughs> Gosh, you're sweet. I started watching one VOD earlier today. Did you, Beastie? Y'all are so sweet. I'm, um, it always just amazes me that y'all even like watch VODs. But since people are watching them, that's why we're doing it. Fourth channel next week is a vlog channel. Stop it. No. No. We are not having more than three YouTube channels. I swear I will lose my mind. Goodness gracious. Hi, Mermaid. How you doing? Welcome in. What if I make it like a little... Ooh, what if I do this? What if I do like a little um film reel? real like the little you know or like a, a video like a little cassette oh which one the film or the cassette which one is inherently cuter I don't know I'll put them both in there for now and I'll let you decide <laughs> here let's see how it looks in chat uh, oh, well, not the film thing because it's broken. <laughs> cool. So the other one. So the cassette. Nice. Dope. That makes the decision easier. Um, cool. It's in there now. I fixed it. Wait, what is this? When did you make this command, Light? What is this? <laughs> what is this? Hello? I typed in YT to find YouTube. What is that command? Lord have mercy. Um, Hold on. I have to edit both YouTube commands. <laughs> I don't even know half the commands we have. This is why people are like... People come in and are like, oh, they try to do like exclamation point commands. And I'm like, bestie, that's not going to work because we have so many commands. If I did an exclamation point command list, it'd be wild. I feel like we have like 70. I don't even know anymore. We have so much because they just get created on a whim and then we use them like one off, which is fine. It's just like I have so many. I could not do a commands command. I'd have to do a commands command to a Google Doc that has all the things and then it would just be confusing. It's fine. Anyways. List of commands would fill the entire chat. Truly, though, it'd be like three different, four different messages from the heckin' bot. One and a half hours, thanks for asking. Oh, you're welcome, you're welcome. I'm glad. Listen, it's not that, that's that's pretty far, so. Um, after my wife was sent to jail, she started screaming and swearing and getting aggressive, so the rest of my family agreed to never play Monopoly with her ever again. Omni. I hate Monopoly. Hate Monopoly, honestly. <clears throat> Don't like it. But hi, Omni. Hope you're doing good. I'm good, thanks. I have to be honest. Your pets being in the background is making my day. Oh, Spoonie. Good. I'm glad they're helping. I meant to put next month, but next week, I guess. Oh, great. So we're doing it in a week, not a month. Fantastic. 
I'm sick. I had to miss school today and then I have uh, to dance for two hours later. I'm sorry, Sunny. I hope you feel better. That's poopy. Live and breathe for Vaughn since I can't make Friday streams. That's fair, Magsy. That makes sense. That makes sense. Well, now they're on um, They're on YouTube. We just need to make the... They're all uploaded out of order, okay? But they won't be from now on because from now on, we'll probably do it like a little bit more consistently because it's super easy to do. It's just like one button on our end. So they're uploaded out of order. But when we make the playlists and stuff, I decided at this moment in time that I'm going to do playlists by month. I don't know if eventually we'll do playlists by game, but for now I'm doing playlists by month so it's easier to find them. Um, but when we put them in a playlist, they'll be like in the right order because they're not in upload order and it's stressing me out, but it's fine. I can't change anything about that. So um, how dare you tell me about this cat game? My life is over. Oh, are you playing it? Are you playing it, Gash? You're welcome. You're welcome. Should be noted that the out of order is not our fault. Yeah, no, we definitely like exported them in order, but then YouTube did not. I don't know why. It's really odd. Um, we get to follow 60 for six to seven hours a day while working on the vlog channel. Perfect. The vlog channel is just going to be the VOD channel, but like from a different point of view. Perfect. Fantastic. I'm just going to wear a GoPro on my forehead every time I stream. And then the vlog channel is just going to be the VOD channel, but point of view GoPro. <laughs> Easy peasy. Simple. <laughs> Go pro on your pets. Perfect. Even better. Even better. I plan to start using that one and then forgot it existed in the next stream. Nice. Nice. I almost forgot. Oh, yeah. Do your spicy checks. Do your chaos checks or daddy checks. All your checks, besties. He has girls night again tonight. Gosh, she has a lot of girls tonight. I'm jealous, honestly. When is Kay going to invite me to girls night? Asking for a friend. Spent almost all day yesterday in my room playing video games and I feel like it was well needed. Good. Well, I'm glad you did that for yourself, Beastie. It sounds like it was. Should we know that our order is not our fault? Yeah. Vlog camera and bad audio. Perfect. Something to know. This stream is super cozy and I love it. Spoonie, you're so sweet. I'm glad you enjoy your time here. Thank you for being here and choosing to spend your time with us. I really appreciate you so much. Let's see. Am I spicy today? I'm not spicy. Am I chaotic today? Not really. I'm like half chaotic. <gasps> I'm having a bad day. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, this is not my Monday. I have no daddy vibes. I'm not spicy and I'm barely even chaotic. What is happening? Who am I? Why did you get 33% on both of them? You got 33% on daddy and 33% on chaos. What is happening? Seventy-eight chaos. Lex is chaotic. Beastie is spicy. Why? Gash is not daddy. One third daddy and one third chaos. The logic says the last of me is spicy. <laughs> the last third. Twenty-nine percent. Two percent spicy today. Daddy was seventy-three and chaos was ninety-two. Chaotic day for you. Okay. All right. So no spice or daddy. No, but chaos. But a little bit of chaos. <laughs> Oh, 69% chaos, Dan. Incredible. Incredible, bestie. You're winning. I still need to make something that like pops up on it. Um, I want to make something that reacts to like 69% chaos and 69% spicy and 69% daddy and stuff. So, um, case girl nights say otherwise on the daddy thing. They are constantly yelling upstairs, daddy, we need you. I remember you telling me this and I think it's so funny. I think it is hilarious that her and all of her friends refer to you as daddy on their, uh, girls night it's the best as they should truly <laughs> iconic bestie truly living the dream <clears throat> someone hit 69 me the o cat from puss and boots oh not that so uh, not that but true oh <laughs> it ruins my gaming well that heckin sucks deal with it Ruins your gaming. Wow. Imagine. <laughs> oh, I need to eat my heckin' toast. I got toast today again. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. I watched Post and Boost last night. Last Wish on Saturday with my family. Loved it. Did you? It's so good. I really love that movie. We're going to watch it this weekend for um, 
we're going to watch it this weekend for, um, excuse me. This freaking butthole. Hold on. Sorry. Reese had the audacity to comment on uh, my pictures on Twitter today and say, imagine existing and being this beautiful every day. And I'm like, excuse me, ma'am. Hold on. We're going to have a problem. <laughs> hold on. Coming from you, the audacity. Like, excuse me. Anyways. Sorry, I had to get into a love war with my waifu. <laughs> also, yeah, that's my waifu. I love her so much. Reese is so sweet and wonderful and amazing and also chaotic. Love her with my entire soul. Well, you are beautiful inside and out. I know, but she is gorgeous. I know, but like she is gorgeous. So the audacity of her to come at me like that. When she constantly by panics me. <laughs> like, hello? The frick? Expecting her to pop up in here and say, no, you. I will have a war with her. I will have a war with her. These pictures are beautiful. Reese wasn't like, thanks. You're sweet. I appreciate you so much. <gasps> Panda, you're in Discord. Let's go. Let's go, bestie. If you have issues verifying, let me know. If anyone wants to join Discord, you're obviously more than welcome to do that. I need to eat my hiking toast. Hello. <gasps> Hi, Lils. How are you? How you doing? Sorry, I had to tell Kate that I love them and I miss them. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I've just verified. It says to wait 10 minutes before I can chat. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Cool. I just want to make sure. I like to ask people um, every now and then because um, um, the verification bot thingy is like really stinky and hasn't been working right recently. So um, I don't mind giving the verification role, you know, as long as y'all have read through everything and agreed to everything and all that stuff. So. I don't mind manually giving it out since it's being gross and not working right. <gasps> Lil, thank you so much for continuing your gifty sub. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for being so sweet and wonderful and supportive. I adore you. How is the kibby? How are you? How's things? I'll let you know if there's any issues. Yeah, let me know. Let me know. Well, welcome into Discord. We're glad to have you. We have many, many channels. If you're confused about anything that goes for anybody, let me know. Um, I try to have a lot of resources that help you navigate Discord because I know how overwhelming it can be. Um, but yeah, if anyone has any questions regarding anything, let me know. Let me know. I got you. Um, what else I was going to say? This weekend, hopefully. I didn't do it this weekend. I forgot. Um, this weekend, maybe I'll try to figure out if I can do like a different verification bot or something. I don't know. Um, I don't know, Rayanne. I haven't decided yet or not. Um, I haven't decided yet or not. Like, theoretically, I could. Um, theoretically, I could do that. But I don't know if I want to or not in Vegas. I also don't know who I would go with. So I haven't like, I don't know. I haven't decided. I still have a while. It's still in October. Last time when I went to TwitchCon, I didn't decide I was going to TwitchCon until like the month before. So... <laughs> I'm confused at how you're so beautiful. Well, no, you beastie. So kitten is cute and sweet and baby and I love her. I saw her beans in Discord and I wanted to sob. I wanted to heckin' sob. She's so baby, so angel. Um, If we would like to post pictures, photos of our valley or our pets, do we need to let you know first? No, you're good. You're absolutely perfect. As long as you put them in the right channels, like Xenox said. If you don't know where something goes, if you go under the help I'm new category and click channel guide, you can find all the channels that exist there. Just click the one with the name that corresponds to what you're trying to post. And you can actually click on the channels in there and it will directly like navigate you to that. Um, And then you can just post it. 
So, yeah, you're good. You're good. <clears throat> um, are we going to continue the Disney fixation until it's the other king? Really? He says, no, no, Dan. Um, actually, pretty soon we're going to be switching to Breath of the Wild. Probably in the first month of the first week of April, because I'm almost done decorating in Disney anyways. I only have one more biome to decorate. So once we finish that, honestly, we might do like Disney dailies in the morning of streams or something and then like do Breath of the Wild. But yeah, we're going to be swapping to Breath of the Wild soon. Um, cause I'm almost done with everything that I can do in Disney. And if I start Breath of the Wild the first week of April, the, um, the Disney update is probably going to be mid April. So timing wise, that will probably work out. I don't know. We'll see, but yeah, no, not, not much longer, unfortunately, cause I really don't have anything to do other than decorate and I'm almost done. Hi, Flappy. Welcome in. Uh, I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. I love how organized your Discord is. It's so nice. Thank you. I appreciate you. I put a lot of time and effort into it. Me, I want to meet you. Yeah, I would love to go to TwitchCon. I just have to figure out like who um, I'm going to stay with and all that, you know? You know, you know. Doing lots of baby tummy kisses because she already, uh, she literally has been eating a little too well. Oh, Tommy kiss is adorable. Met the boy's cat over the second time yesterday and she let me love on her and pet her for a good 20 minutes. <gasps> she was purring up a storm, so I feel very comfy that we'll get along great. Oh, she sounds adorable. She sounds absolutely wonderful. You're gonna love her so much. I need onions and Goofy doesn't have any. Oh, that's rude. <gasps> her seroma has gone down. Let's go, Lils. That's amazing news. Uh, um, What about the game you got a code for? I don't know, Xenox. I need to figure out when I'm gonna schedule it in. I don't have a time frame on that one, um, but I know I want to get Zelda done, and I know I want to get um, the Disney update done, so we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Hi, Chelsea. Welcome in. Hello, hello. No, I haven't done all the Dreamlight tasks right yet, but I'm not going to stress about trying to get all that done because I have time to do that, so... Would I be able to post photos for my valley? Yes, I need to. I've been procrastinating on it. People have asked me to do that and I just keep forgetting to do it. I need to. I need to. I need to. I need to. I need to go through my valley and like actually just sit down and take pictures of everything and post it in Discord or anywhere, somewhere, just so it's logged. Um, yeah. Laura Lee, hi. Laura Lily, hi. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hi, Laura Lee. I hope you're doing absolutely amazing. Michaela, hello, good morning. She's a sassy baby, so I'm surprised she likes me so much, but I can't wait. Well, listen, she's sassy, but also loving. It's like Mira, she's the same. Hi, short Zelda, yeah. How long does a Zelda run take you usually? I don't know, Krug, because um, I usually only play on master mode. I haven't played on normal mode in a long time, but I plan on playing on normal mode this time because I want to try to do the Master Sword Trials. <sighs> So we're going to be doing all the DLC and we're going to be doing the Master Sword Trials. So I don't know how long a Zelda run is going to take me. Um, it also depends on like what I want to do. Like, do I want to get, do I just want to do Divine Beast and then do Ganon and then do DLC and then do the Master Sword Trials? Or do I want to at least do enough shrines to get enough inventory spaces so that uh, I can have like all these extra weapons? Probably. Um, yeah. So I'm probably going to have to grind enough shrines to get 436, whatever the heck the number is of Korok Seed or... Grind those to get this master sword and then do 436 ish Korok seeds. Um, so, shrines like 400 Koroks, all the beasts, Ganon, the DLC, and the master sword trials. New Tears of the Kingdom gameplay revealed tomorrow. I saw that. I'm so sad it's so early. It's seven o'clock in the morning for me. You have to I'm going to be in bed, but we can watch it in the, the morning. That we love with all our hardos. But we can absolutely watch in the morning. Frezzo, hi. Good morning. I hope you're doing good. Hi, Cobra. Welcome in. I've got a kidney under the blanket. I have her and my brother on my chest. I've been thoroughly catted by law. Oh, what little angels. What sweet little angels, Cobra. Also, hi. I finally got my speakers to work. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Nice, Michaela. I hope you're doing good. I managed to finish my star chart yesterday. Did you, Frezzo? Oh, I'm proud of you. You're doing amazing. What is it? What is it? Do tell. If I finish uh, with my DDLV, I'm probably going to try out Stardew. I've never played Stardew. Stardew is really fun, Ryan. It is really fun. I will say, um, do keep in mind that Stardew is a game where do not feel bad about having a guide open while you're playing it because it's very overwhelming or can be. Um, and having the wiki open is like almost recommended. So don't feel bad if you need to like look at stuff on the wiki because it's pretty much like guaranteed that you're going to have to do that. 
Um, so just keep that in mind. But it's a really fun game. Um, speaking of DLV, I need to clean my valley, but hubby will be packing it soon to take on a trip. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. On a trip? Those trials are brutal. They are, yeah. Uh-huh. But I can't do the Master Sword trials on Master Mode because they're just way too... They're too complex for me, so... Um, because it requires like an entirely different strat, so... But I would love to do the Master... I would love to do the Master Sword trials again in general because I've done them like four times in the past. I just haven't done them in a long time. I think tonight will be the only chance I have. Good luck. You got this. Um, let me give him snackies. I don't even know where Ollie is. But he's somewhere. Are we going to watch it? Never mind. He answered. <laughs> you always answer that as I'm asking. <laughs> You're doing great. My mom's doggo just noticed me looking right at him while he was looking up at my breakfast. Needless to say, he took off. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. You embarrassed. What if you set alarms for 6.30 a.m.? I will go back to sleep until 7.30. Not happening. <laughs> Hi, Cerulean. I adore you. I hope you're doing good. We love a good wiki like Stardew. Yeah, true. So anyway, for no particular reason, we're starting Breath of the Wild tomorrow yet. No, we have to finish my... Uh, we have to finish Disney Dreamlight Valley. We have to finish decorating because I'm very, 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 I have this bad reputation of like decorating everything 90% and then never finishing it. And I'm not doing that again. <sighs> not doing it again. No, you're good. You're good, Chelsea. You don't have to. Start decorating my plaza. It's inspired by yours. I'm sure it looks so good, Sunny. You wake up so early. How? Because I'm not a morning person and it takes me literally from 7 30 to like 8 30 to even mentally be awake enough to go stand in front of my mirror and then start doing my makeup from 8 30 to like 9 30 9 45 and then at 9 45 I take selfies and then I take pictures and I take my meds and then I post everywhere and then I sit down and I stream <laughs> it takes me from 7 30 to 10 to even like be awake if she waited any later she'd also never go pee that is also true that's true i have to wake up at 7 30 and like jump out of bed and go into the bathroom pee wash my face brush my teeth put um my toner and serums on and get out because if i don't do it exactly at 7 30 i will not be able to get into the bathroom until like nine <sighs> hey but hi welcome in i hope you're doing good I photographed families for my job. Did a cake smash session yesterday where um, baby smashes and eat cake. She was one year old, picked up the cake and walked off with it. <laughs> Me, mood, honestly, iconic. Um, one quick question for big streamers like yourself. Where do you go to get cute follower follower sound alerts? Um, Mainly, Ryan, I just find like YouTube clips of the sound that I'm looking for. I try to think of something in my head of something that I might want and then I find it on YouTube and then I um, uh, I will like record it via like uh, Audacity and then put it in as an alert or something like that. <clears throat> Sounds about ADHD. Yeah, right, Frezzo. <gasps> Frezzo, by the way, how is um, how's how's meant? Are they going good? Is it a good experience for you? I got stressed decorating because everyone else's biomes are so cute. I'm sure yours look amazing though, Ryan. With a doggo, I'm going to have to do that in the apartment. I'm horrified. I don't know how I'm going to get up so early. You got this. Honestly, the first couple of times, Lexa are going to be really jarring, but you'll get it. You'll transition into it. It'll be super easy peasy. Easy, easy peasy. I've got an interview today in about an hour. You're going to do you're going to do absolutely amazing, Kovar. You're going to do amazing, incredible, and wonderful, and you're going to crush it, and I'm so proud of you. You got this. Hi, Kelly. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Uh, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. I think it'll also help having the boy around and not me having to wait for him to get home so late. Yeah, probably. Fair, fair, fair. Hi, white lighter. Welcome in. I'm honestly not feeling like they're having much, if any, effect so far. Oh, no. Do they have you on a low dose? May I reply to that question to you, please? Wait, which question? Yeah. Yes, probably. What question? <laughs> Which one, Spoonie? But yeah, probably. The only place I like is my aerial area on the beach. Well, I'm sure it's beautiful. 
The question about sound alerts. Oh yeah, absolutely, Spoonie, for sure. Yeah, less urban exciting thing for sure. I got a win in Fort Dort. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Finally getting my ADHD meds increased. Hope it helps. Yeah, maybe it's an increased thing for us. Oh, possibly. But nice, uh, nice panda. I really do hope it helps. You got this. I hope it works for you. Yeah, I think I probably need a higher dose, but um, I'll hopefully talk to a nurse this week. Talk with them about it then. But yeah, I started on the lowest dose. Okay, that makes sense then. Yeah, that makes sense. They usually start you really, really low and then just, like slowly increase you um, depending on like how much you, uh, you know, how much you need it because everyone is obviously different. So um, just express it to them and then they'll handle it accordingly. Anyway, edit time, lurk, have fun. Good luck. Uh, good luck, good luck. Discovered uh, voicey and it's been awesome for finding cute sounds. Oh, what is that? I don't even know what that is. Uh, I don't even know what that is. That's so exciting. I hope it works for you. White lady, you're so sweet. I mean, work, work time. I don't edit here at my actual big boy job. No, never. Yeah, you would never do that. Absolutely not. What? Hello? <laughs> what nor 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 yeah there's that and there's also like um what is it called there's like sound no it's called like soundboard or something like that oh my instance is a good one too but <clears throat> Do -do -do. also has gifts and sound gifts oh okay okay mm -mm. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. Goggles are at Valley and I cannot take them off. They're too cute. Adorable. Adorable. Yeah, it's an ADHD thing, Krug. So it's not um something that needs time to uh well, depending on I don't know exactly how Ritalin is, but I know with like my ADHD medicine, it's not something that has to like sit sink in. It's something that just like instantly goes. Um, so do, 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 do. Whereas SSRIs, you need to like let it sit and like actually do it for like a month or whatever. <clears throat> or like two weeks. To see a difference. Good <clears throat> grief, I feel for you. Listen, whatever helps. Whatever helps. So yeah, I would just express it with your um your uh doctor and let them know because yeah it probably is just very uh likely that you just need to be updosed that's probably what it is <clears throat> i love you ran you're so sweet i adore you i adore you so much funnily enough um i also don't feel like uh the cetraline is having much of an effect oh no I take 100 uh, milligrams from my SSRI daily and another SSI daily for 150. Really? Huh? You don't feel like it's having an effect? Oh, that's stinky. What the heck is going on? Ten uh, milligrams flex for is enough for me. Yeah. That's what I'm on right now, but yeah, obviously everyone's different and has different needs and stuff, but also I don't know, like, I mean, it could also depend on the, um, the SSRI and stuff like that, you know what I mean? Like the potency and whatever, all of that, so there's a lot of things that go into it. <clears throat> I used to take Zoloft and I felt the same way too, so I asked to get off it. Oh, that's stinky. That sucks though. I hate that. Takes Lexa. Yes, hi. <laughs> Hello? Yar? I hate that. Medication, like trying to find things that work for you is so heckin' rough. Um, I don't know what creamer you use, but there's a friend's coffee creamer and it's chocolate, hazelnut, and mocha, and it's magical. Ooh, that sounds really good. Chocolate, hazelnut, mocha. That does sound really yummy. Um, I use just like French vanilla and then one is like Irish cream or something like that or Italian cream or something. I forget what it's called. Um, but chocolate hazelnut mocha sounds delicious. I need to find something to calm my anxiety. If I told her down, it sucks. You got this, Rayanne. I wish you the best of luck. 
I wanted to suggest it to you if you do not like coffee intense flavors. Yeah, no, that sounds good. I have to try it. I'll have to try it and uh, test it out. Mmm. CBD, Rayanne, is different. CBD does not make you... CBD and THC are different. Um, yeah. THC is the part that would make you high. CBD does not. So, if you're nervous about it, CBD is perfect. Perfect for you. It's not going to do anything to... Um, your, like, awareness... <clears throat> THC is the high component, but CBD is not psychoactive. I'm not too high. Exactly. Exactly. It's more uh, the component for pain. Mm -hmm. CBD for pain is really good. Also, yeah, Um, I don't know for you personally, Rayanne, but I do have a CBD line of uh, Advanced GG. They have a CBD line of it. Um, and the CBD definitely helps for my anxiety has like a temporary relief for it. So um, I don't know specifically, again, I can't speak on the bipolar part, but I also get badly back pain. Will CBD help with that too? Yeah, they have like CBD creams and stuff like that that you can put on your um, on the area that is uh, hurting and that will help. So yeah, there's a lot. CBD is perfect for you. It has a lot of different benefits that you can use. And again, there's no concern. You're not gonna get a high off of it or anything like that. Um, so you're good. Nicole, hi. Hello. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. My dog has tried me on different antidepressants. Currently on um, Esloprim, it works mostly. I've been starting to learn about my ADHD and want to get evaluated for it. I'm proud of you, Spoonie. Whatever you decide to do, I'm super proud of you. Um, big long meeting time. I love you, Tix and Chat. I love you, Cerulean. Good luck. Good luck, good luck, good luck. I hope it goes well. Not huge into coffee, being super flavored. It's delicious. Every time I find it, I buy like two at a time. I'm going to have to try it, Miss America. Y'all are selling me on it. Could you send me the link? Um, there's... I don't think Advanced GG has had chill in stock in a while, but, um... There's a lot of different things that you can get. Let me see. I know they were having issues with, like, um... It's just green. That's also, yeah, they haven't had it in stock for a bit, unfortunately. But um, you can get like, I'm sure there's other different things out there that exist as form in form of like drinks and stuff. Or um, I know there's like topical things where you can um, put it in like a lotion or whatever. <clears throat> absolutely make sure it is CBD only though, if you're concerned about being high, the CBD should um, absolutely not make you out of it enough to feel higher not be sober yeah it won't it shouldn't it definitely won't hi nova welcome in uh, i hope you're doing good i had a pretty immobilizing back injury a year ago and cbd was the only thing that helped the pain yeah it's it can be very very helpful for a lot of people but also like nova said not everyone it's not going to work for um everybody you know but yeah <clears throat> selling you on what the coffee creamer they were talking about does cbd help menstrual cramps at all um i feel like it, i would only fix minor ones that is actually a good question bean i don't know i've never tried it i did use it for cramps too and it wasn't helpful for me but it's different for everyone yeah i didn't i've never tried it so i don't know i'm not sure i feel like i'm the only person immune to it, it does absolutely nothing for pain or anxiety for me that sucks i'm sorry stinky use it for a lot for anxiety but it um buy it and lived by it but i would also discuss it with a doctor if you're on any meds at all yeah just to be safe just be safe you're on your lady cramps day too nor i'm ending soon so i'm still getting odd little pains here and there no i'm sorry i hope both of your uh your tummy is stop being so stinky and gross to you i'll consider asking my doctor because i do take uh some sort of from a thyroid yeah just talk to him and just make sure that it doesn't have any like side effects with the whatever you're taking. It shouldn't. It shouldn't have anything, but just so they're aware and stuff like that too. Um, that's always a good idea. 
Ranker, hi. I hope you're doing good. Your pupper likes Brussels sprouts. Iconic. How'd you find that out? What a goober. Hi, Red Hood. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. <clears throat> you can always find a smaller container instead of something large. That way it's not a huge waste for you. That's true. You could get one. Yeah. You could get a small one. They probably have like very small, nice jars. That's not super expensive. Mm-hmm. Mmm. A new roof. Jeez. I'm sorry, bestie. That sounds very, very noisy. But we got you. We got you with the good vibes. I hope it's done soon. Gosh, that probably is going to take so long. Yeah, exactly what Duncan said. So, yeah, make sure. Just make sure. Um, but hi, Duncan. How are you? Olivia, hi. Welcome in. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? I hope you're doing absolutely amazing. I gave her one. She tapped on my leg like, hey, mama, one more, please. Oh, what an angel. What a sweet little baby. Smokey really, really likes um, carrots and green beans. He used to actually get like a half a can of green beans every day as a snack when he was a baby. <clears throat> Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you so much. Welcome. Uh, when you said we got you with the good vibes, I was thinking of the Beyonce Becky with the good hair, and I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, that's us. Becky with the good hair and the good vibes. Takes you with the good vibes. Incredible. I'm doing pretty well. Things good. I'm glad you're doing well. <laughs> Becky with the good vibes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> How's going your stream? It's good. It's good. We're vibing. I haven't even drank any of my coffee yet, and it's been like an hour, please. Um, we're vibing, chit-chatting. I'm having my toast. I need to drink my coffee. That is definitely not warm anymore. <clears throat> Hi, Jose. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. <clears throat> Angel, silly. Same with my pepper. Good news. Give your pepper some more carrots. They're good for you. Yeah, yeah. Carrots are good for them, and green beans are too. What did I do this weekend? Oh, a whole bunch of nothing, truly. <laughs> um, I hung out with uh, my wifey yesterday. I'm gonna be hanging out with her tonight because it's her birthday. <gasps> Cats! Cats, thank you so much for the 49 months. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing and wonderful support for so long. I appreciate you. How you doing? How's your day? You're early. You're so heckin' early. So early, bestie. I hope you're doing good. Is that cinnamon toast? It is. Yeah. Are apples, but not apple cores or seeds? Oh, I'm sorry, what? So are apples, but not apple cores or seeds. Oh, for dogs. Okay, I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> good for dogs. Okay, no, no. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you, bestie. Send her happy level up wishes for us. I will. Yeah. Y'all are so sweet. Y'all are so sweet. Yeah, we're going to have a good day today and just play some games later and hang out. I appreciate Olivia, but I don't need anything right now. I appreciate you. Got an early break today. Let's go. I love homemade cinnamon toast. It's such a great snack. Yeah, it's actually like the perfect breakfast for me because I'm not super, super hungry in the morning where like I can eat an actual meal. So having just cinnamon sugar toast is great because it's filling because it's toast, right? Um, so I can get it down and sit in my tummy and I'll be satisfied and held over until lunchtime and be okay without having like not eating anything at all. It's better than nothing, you know? <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Mm. I feel that spoony. <laughs> Listen, if you don't choose violence in Fortnite, you don't win. <laughs> Hi, Megs. Welcome.
welcome in. Finally got a live stream again. I hope you're doing good. Hello. This song means you have to hello, give hello. to the doggos and the cattles that we love with all our hardos. That's fair, Rianne. Same. Oh, those second cravings hit hard. All right. Animal snackies. Let's see if we can get Ollie in here because he hasn't been in here. No wolfies in here. <laughs> wolfies in here hanging out. You got your tears of the kingdom reserved. Let's go. Nice. I still need to reserve mine. <sighs> I keep trying to hold out thinking I can get to the heckin' collector's edition and I'm just not having any luck. So I did give him the snacky from earlier. I gave him the snacky from earlier, but Ollie doesn't have any. So Ollie will get double. <clears throat> you got to be hard to outrun the storm fair. Fair, fair, fair. Well, he's so cute. He's such an angel. And a bag of hot Cheetos. Delicious. Hot Cheetos are amazing. Absolutely amazing. And Takis. Ugh. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I just asked my hubby to get me a box of cookie mix so I can make cookies and brownies. <gasps> cookies and brownies and hot Cheetos. As you should, bestie. I love that for you. Come here, Allie. Here. Eat your snacks. Here you go. Eat your snackies. Yep, you came in for them. So go ahead. <clears throat> go ahead. Do not crunch your snackies onto my toast, please. Pick up my toast. The audacity of him. <laughs> the audacity. There's a crumb way too close to my toast. To be fair, ramen and pho are so good. And they're very soothing for the tummy. So I don't even blame you. <clears throat> Giving your toast some extra flavor. I don't know if I want chicken on my toast. <laughs> I don't know if I want the flavor of chicken on my toast. I might pass on that. Um, but I appreciate his effort, I guess. I think. Maybe. <laughs> I live for blowing up gas pumps. Fair. Standing on the gas station roof and sniping. Fair enough, Spoonie. I like that too. Just like your pop and I left their fur in your coffee last stream. Oh, yeah. They're probably... I'm surprised there isn't anything in there. When are you doing another Breath of the Wild playthrough? Probably the first month, the first week of April, I would say. Probably short. Soon. Because I'm running out of things to do in Disney. So, um, at least... I'm running out of things to do in Disney that I could do for like a whole stream. So we'll play Breath of the Wild soon. Probably in like the next week. Probably next week. Maybe the end of this week. I don't know. It depends on how soon we finish Disney stuff. But probably next week. Just harvest my first pumpkins and didn't get a farming buddy. Nor Sunny. R.I.P. Thank you, Chelsea. I appreciate you. I appreciate you so much. You're sweet. That reminds me, I have Godiva chocolate cookies to make. Do you, cats? Yum. That sounds delicious. Absolutely wonderful. Absolutely incredible. Ugh. Yummy, yummy. Yeah, cats is here. Cats is here early. Because they're breaky. Yeah. Mm-mm-mm. I have so many crumbs on my desk from Ollie. Um, do we know when the update for DLV is? I might have missed that, but no. We don't have a confirmed date, Chelsea, but people are speculating like um, mid-April. We know it's in April because they've told us April, but we're guessing like mid-April. But there's no actual like date. Just April. So it could be like the very end of April. I don't know, but I doubt it. 
Just because the star path is ending today or tomorrow? I know on Friday it was like four days, right? So it's ending soon. So they don't want to leave us without a star path for like a month, but maybe like a couple weeks. It's done. Okay. So I would guess mid because I don't think they want to keep us with a star path without like for a whole entire month, but two weeks sounds pretty average. So yeah. I think it might be the second week of April. Yeah, we'll see. We got, we'll see. It's probably gonna be like early to mid. Um. Anyways, it's ad break time. So I'm gonna take the opportunity to get up and uh, finish this toast, eh? Clean up all the crumbs all I left on my desk. Um, but if you need to use the restroom or um, you can snack or refill water or anything like that or take meds, now is a good time to do so because I'm going to step away for half a second um, and get some stuff done. Now that there's some crumbs all in my hands. February update was after Valentine's, right? Maybe? I don't remember. I love you all. We bye, Cass. We love you so much. We love you so, so, so much. Thank you for being here, being so sweet and cute and wonderful and adorable and precious. Okay, I'll be right back. Hold on. Where's my button? Boop. BRB. Okay, we're good. Um, so you said 43 more hours. Okay. They bring Simone and Pumbaa for the new characters. Is there confirmation anywhere, Jinx? I didn't see anything about it, but I haven't also looked either. Have they posted something somewhere? This is random, but does anyone know the show and book Firefly Lane? I've seen the show Firefly Lane like on Netflix or something or whatever it was on. Um... But I don't think I, I don't know if I watched it. I know I wanted to watch it, but I don't think I did watch it. Yeah, I think I wanted to, but I didn't. Oh wait, no, yes I did. 
No, yeah, I did watch this. I did. I'm reading a page that shows what they are adding in the future to Dreamlight. We know for a fact they are adding Simba and Nala. Yeah, we know that. What is, is it like the roadmap page thing? <clears throat> Hi, Alicia. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. <clears throat> Do. Dexterdo page? Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. I mean, I wouldn't be upset about it, obviously. <laughs> All right. Let me open up Disney. Let me open up the game. Start getting it running in the background. We're going to start our morning with, obviously, chit-chats and vibing and hanging out and uh, um, doing some um, iron farming because I need some iron so we can make lights for the areas we've been decorating you have a discord i can share a screenshot uh i do we do yeah mm -hmm. oh what happened hold on Why did it do that? That was weird. Okay. I was being all staticky for a second on my end. Um, on Tuesday's the Cater release date, how long do you think you'll be able to go before jumping in the game? Um, probably about normal. It'd probably be about an hour. Depending. It, you know. We'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> but probably about that. Apparently, the final part of season two comes out next month, and in between that, um, I in between that read the book, and I think I may have made myself unintentionally one of those. It's not like the book fans. Oh, no. Why would you do that? So, why would you do that? Y'all should know by now that you cannot compare the TV adaptations to books. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Ah, trailers or images. Interesting. Huh. I wish they had a, um, I mean, I don't know if we're going to get Simba and Timon right away, though. They might come in later, but, um, interesting. I didn't know they have been shown in trailers and stuff. Uh, without giving away any spoilers, did anyone finish the second part of season four of You? Did you love it? I tried to watch you and I can't watch it. That show is just way too triggering for me. It's way too much for me. I tried it and no, can't do it. All right, we're Disney. I know Simba and Nala next update. Yeah. Yeah, I'm excited though. <clears throat> what even is you um you is it's a psychological thriller show but like it's got a lot of like stalking-esque premises like that's like the whole kind of thing at least i don't know how it changed later but it has like it deals with the whole like stalking thing and that's just too much for me i can't do it I can't do it. No. <clears throat> Pass. Yeah, I can't watch it because of that. <clears throat> I cannot do it. It's got a lot of like obsession and but like not good obsession. I know I shouldn't. It actually made a huge impact on me, and so did the show. I tried to give it a shot, but not sure, because so many things are different. Yeah. Yeah. That's why you just got to try to separate them, you know? They're not always going to be the same exactly. Mm 
I did and I'm upset. Ooh. I think season four did a good job finally not romanticizing him though. Like the ending is no longer romanticizing this murderer. That's great. That's good. That helps, but I, ugh, I just can't do it. I just can't do it. I'm glad they stopped doing that though, at least. Cause that didn't make it any better either. I just don't like the whole, I don't know. It made me super uncomfortable and just, absolutely not not a vibe for me oh car i couldn't get into it yeah me either me either i tried because uh people kept recommending it and i was just like uh i can't do it i don't know how people watch this show i don't know either it's just not for me i mean it's different everyone has different uh things that upset them and things that don't upset them you know so that's just one of the things that does upset me. Let's see. This one. There we go. Cool. Do, do, do. <clears throat> I watched parts of season four until I lost interest in it. Fair, fair enough. It's raining. Good time to catch fuku fish on Dazzle Beach. That is true. That is true. I could try to catch some. I don't know what I need them for, really, though. Mm -mm. I don't know what I really need them for. Truly. Kuruma, hello. Welcome in. Good evening. I hope you're doing good. Welcome, welcome. All right, let's do, uh, let's look for all our stuff. All the things we got around that we need to break. We're watching Love and Blind again, though. Embarrassed to say how reality TV has become a guilty pleasure. Listen, bestie, I don't even blame you. I love Love is Blind, but also, like, I hate it. Like, it makes me want to rip my eyeballs out, but I also love it. You know what I mean? You know. I didn't know what they were until they showed up in Scar's wish list on gifts. Fair, fair. I'm doing good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you for asking. I'm glad you're doing well. I'm doing good. Brain a little sleepy. So we're just going to do some, uh, some very, uh, slower Disney. What button am I looking for? That one. There we go. <clears throat> Yeah, Love is Blind is good, even though, again, it makes me want to be, like, it's so upsetting. <gasps> Actually, speaking of Love is Blind, um, Shane from Love is Blind is apparently on, like, oh my god, my inventory is so full, um, is apparently on a, like, other, like, dating reality show at, like, the same time that he was supposed to be in a relationship. Listen, there's some tea. There's some tea. I forget which one it was. I forget what other reality show it was, but uh, my bestie sent me a clip of a show and was like laughing at it. And uh, I was like, oh my God, it's Shane. <gasps> I think it's perfect match. Yeah. I hated him. He was horrible. I hate him. He's awful. Yeah, no, he's the worst. Not, uh, not a fan of him. Perfect match was the worst. Is it awful? Like, is it awful, awful? Or is it like watchable awful? You know, there's a difference. Mm -mm. NCIS TV show lover. So NCIS Hawaii and NCIS New Orleans are my favorites. Ooh, it was so bad, but I couldn't stop watching. Oh no, don't tell me that because then I'm going to want to watch it. Gosh, dang it. Yeah, I saw about the new Hunger Games movie. The reason I asked how long you think you'd take to start Sears of Kingdom uh, release days are super horrible day, but we can't really start until 3 p.m., but it's Eastern, so it'd be noon for you. So maybe if you start before 2.30, I might be able to get to see the start, but I also may not be able to make it at stream at all, so who knows. Um, if I started before 2.30, that's like super... Wait, 2.30 for you? I mean, what are you talking about? 
Oh, like 1130? Um, I don't know if I'll start before. Well, maybe. I don't know. Maybe. 2.30 Eastern. I'm so confused. You're confusing me. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It probably will be like an hour, like usual. We usually don't play a game until about an hour into stream, but I don't, I'm not going to be able to know. It depends on how chatty we are that day and like how just like anxious I am. So I don't know. Hi, Shelby Lurking. Thank you for the Lurk Angel. I appreciate you so much. I wouldn't watch, but because I saw that uh, Peter Dinklage is going to be in it, then I will check it out for sure. Fair, fair. Fair, fair. Thank you for the Lurk Angel. You're sweet. I appreciate you so much. I hope you have good Lurkies. It's not my fault the time zone Eastern. Yeah, well, you should just convert it. <laughs> How dare you? Do, 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 do. Okay, get rid of all this. I don't know about the flowers. I feel like I must already have them. Oh. That also feels like a lie. I'm gonna keep them in my pockets though. All right, time for more collecting. Oopsies, didn't mean to pick that up, that's fine. Ah, oh, it's cleanup time. And then we go to Scrooge's, and then we have just gotta do our morning daily things. All the stuff. <clears throat> Casually pick everything up. Just go to Arizona. <laughs> no daylight savings, so always same time all the time. Yeah, that'd be great. That'd be nice. I'm still so upset that we still never got that, like, passed, even though they, like, talked about doing that for our Virgo, getting rid of it. Still so angry. It's just, like, sitting there with no one doing a single thing. Stinky heads. Like, just get rid of it, please. Who really cares about <laughs> the late savings? No one. makes everything more confusing not knowing what time it is having to readjust everything redo all of my routines Ugh. business owners i don't see how that would be a thing though do 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 like, I feel like it's worse for business owners. Because it messes with their employees. <clears throat> do, do. Ew, daylight savings? Yeah. Yeah. It's stinky. It just doesn't make sense in general. All right, do all the cleanups, get all the stuff. It's a block of time where some businesses earn more from it. Eh. Yeah, but it's still not worth it. Hello? Ooh, we actually got a baggie. Okay, but. <gasps> we have another green chest too. Gotta do laundry. Got the... Oh my God, wait, we have another, another green one? Excuse me, what is happening today? Okay, bet. Love to see it. You quit doing dailies, why? Before doing uh, official lurk, what level are you right now? Uh, I've been 40 for like, I don't even know how long. Forever, I've been max level in this game for a long, long time. Like five months or something. I'm capped out forever ago. <clears throat> Honestly, I always forget that like leveling up is a thing in this game because I haven't seen that in so long. It hasn't been like a thing for me in a while. Yeah, 40 is the max. Mm -hmm. 
40 is max. I don't think they plan on increasing that anytime soon. Not that I know of. Hi, Alexito. Do you think they will extend the cap level? Maybe eventually, but I don't see them doing it anytime soon because they have too many other things to focus on than like increasing player cap because no one's really having issues with a... Uh, no one's really having issues with anything involving that, you know? Like they may eventually, but yeah, I don't think it's a priority. They'd rather work on Star Path and like premium shop stuff, so. But maybe one day. I hope you're doing good, like Tito. I adore you. Hope your day's well. Okay. All the cleanup. All the cleanup, and then we gotta do mining and. Good morning. Would anyone like six inches of snow? I just woke up to you. Yes. Yeah. I'll take it. Does anyone know how often the premium shop gets updated? Premium shop is every week. Um, for me, Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning for me is when it does it. <clears throat> oh, interestingly. Yeah, I have no idea. I don't know. <laughs> None of the, I don't know what that means, but... Oh, no, I'm just angry that they didn't do anything. Visual lurk, enjoy your lurkies. <clears throat> but that sounds complicated. Basically, it sounds like they did something they didn't need to do that extended the process. I don't know. Oh, Tava, I'm not shocked. Stinky, though. Mm-mm. <clears throat> 43 hours. Is that for the uh, premium shop too? Does the premium shop and the uh, star path end on the same time? Yeah, there you go. 43 hours. So yeah, for me, that's Wednesday mornings. I don't know what that is uh, for you, but every week it rotates. I finally figured out BTTV and FFZ. Let's go. Nice. They both end at the same time. Okay, perfect. Good to know. So yeah, reminder that Star Path also ends in 43 hours, besties. Let's so make sure you get those Star Path uh, quests done. If you have not done them already, make sure you do them. Because those rewards are going to go away in 43 hours. And you want to make sure you get them all. I mean, or maybe you don't. I don't know. Maybe you don't care, but... <laughs> If you do. <gasps> Nurple! Dixie Heart. Nurple, you're so sweet. Thank you so much for the four months. Uh, I appreciate you so, so, so much. Thank you for the amazing support. I hope you're doing absolutely incredible. Welcome in. I have all the ones I want out of it. Fair enough. Yeah, I was just going to say, I was like, actually, this star path is really not that, like, <laughs> impressive, so... At least get the things you care about. <laughs> There's only one more thing I want on the star pass. So I need to remember to grab it. Yeah, you got this. You got this. Hopefully you'll be able to do it later, maybe. So that you don't have to uh, stress about it. 43 hours. You got it, I believe. How you doing, Nurple? It's nice to see you. Thank you for the amazing support. You're very sweet. We appreciate it so much. I'm super excited about the new star path, though, but I'm also, like, stressed about it. <laughs> I'm stressed about it, but I'm hoping it will be a lot better than this one because they'll have a lot more, like, freedom and can be a little bit more creative with it, hopefully, because the theme is not just, like, Disney 100. It's just going to be, like, theme parks. So hopefully we get a lot of cute items out of it because I really did not. I wasn't impressed with the last star path, and I just... I did it all, and I got everything on it, but also, you know... Eh, you know, it's fine. So I'm hoping the next one is going to be really good, though. Theme parks, I didn't know that. Yeah, it was on their, um, like, 2023, like, uh, roadmap board or whatever. I think it was theme park. It was something, like, in that. I don't know if they called it exactly theme park, but yeah, I think it's called theme park. Oh, <gasps> you got a puppy? Oh, my God, wait, what kind of puppy? What kind of puppy? 
Oh my gosh, congrats. Congrats on the new addition to your family. That's adorable. Hi, Liliana. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Yeah. Let's see. Let me pull up the... um. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Uh. Oh, yeah. It says Disney Parks is what it's called. Sorry. The star path says celebrate the Disney Parks is what it's called. There you go. <clears throat> She's a husky mix and the Humane Society thinks the father might be a German Shepherd. What a little angel. Congrats on the new addition to your family. Do you have a name for the baby yet? The little baby puppy. So many people are getting puppies and kittens and I'm going to freaking fight all of y'all. <laughs> like out of love, but stop it. You're making me want a new baby and I'm not getting a new baby. But everyone is getting a new puppy, a new kitten. Ugh. I see kibbies. I know. Same. I want a puppy. Yeah. Ugh. <laughs> I want a new baby. I know, right? I want a new baby. I have something about a pupper. Who got a pupper and what is the name? <laughs> Nerfle got a pupper. Hello. Nerfle got a pupper. Thank you, party. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. I had a puppy. She's a teen now. Yeah, they grow up so fast. Someone buy me a puppy. My birthday is in June. <laughs> okay, perfect. I will um start the, the plans right now, Ryan. I got you, bestie. Can I please? I just want this piece of wood. Thank you. She had the name Sleepy since there were eight of them born and they named seven of them after the seven dwarves. So I'm thinking of keeping it since she already responds to it. <gasps> That's kind of cute though. That is really precious. That's a good name. And it's a not like super common one either, you know, which is kind of cute. And it has history to it. We love. Start the go the GoFundMe for a puppy. Perfect. Incredible. <laughs> Oh, I got the second bag. I forgot to open it. Oops. Nice. Great. Thanks. I had a doggo who was going to call Doc for the same reason. Really, Ulterius? That's so cute. Oh, I love that. An incredible name. I love that people... I love thinking of, like, um, figuring out all the themes that um, people come up with when naming, like, a litter of puppies. It's just so cute. Or, like, a litter of kittens or whatever. I think it's cute to think of like the theme that they have because usually there's a theme there's not always but usually there's a theme it's an awesome name my pupper is miss disney magic she's a stinker a cute stinker I had a dog that was named nacho cute uh, nacho is adorable too an incredible wonderful name when do you unlock pumpkins um pumpkins you will unlock when you um unlock the forgotten lands so however long it takes you to unlock the Forgotten Lands, it's like 18,000 Dreamlight or something like that to unlock the door, the, um, like area. So it's a while. It's a while. But they're in there. My doggo's name was Vincent. Incredible. Listen, I love dogs with like just uh, a straight up like human name. Like Vincent, Jack, Billy. Love it. It's so cute, I think. 15k okay and 10k for the stall perfect thank you sunny thank you thank you there you go 15k and 10k for the stall <clears throat> 15k dreamlight and 10k the 10k is dollars right like gold and a corgi named french fry cute adorable french fry is a, a precious name 10k gold okay there you go 15k uh, Dreamlight, 10k gold for pumpkins. Gosh, I have a ways to go. You'll get it. You'll get it. You'll get it in no time. I believe in you. You got this. You did not think he was a dog and acted very human. My cats are the same. We love that, though. 
We absolutely love that. That's funny. What a little baby. We got him from my mom's old coworker. He was a golden retriever, half Springer Spaniel. That sounds so cute. Oh, <laughs> I love Spaniels so much. We had a Cocker Spaniel growing up and uh, she was an absolute angel. And we had a golden retriever and golden retrievers are just so sweet. They're so kind. So silly. My friend is so funny. She named her dog, um, Geo, D-O-G? Oh, and I was like, D-O-G. And she said, yep, spell dog. Oh my gosh, that's funny. Incredible. Just named it D-O-G. Love. <laughs> Iconic. Creative, truly. Actually, it was not that bad. If you want, you can convert Dream Shards to Dream Light, then grind Dream Light. It did that a lot, so it's not so bad. You can, just don't um, convert all of your Dream Shards, obviously. Just be um, cautious about it, but you can do that a little bit if you want to. Um, since they have fixed the Dream Light, or the Dream Shards issue in the game. It used to be advised, like, not to do that because getting Dream Shards was so difficult, but now they've fixed it, so it's not as, it's not as bad at all to get them. <clears throat> Which is really nice. You need to save um, at least 10 to 20. Yeah, that's fair. Dream shards, to be fair, like, I don't know. What else do you need dream shards for? I have basically stopped using mine. So, like, what do you use them for? Like, probably some... There's probably some quests that you need to convert them to, like, purified things or whatever. I don't know. I will try to save up my dream shards for when I get close to the amount I need. Fair. Fair, fair. I should start to do that. Yeah, if you have an excess, you might as well. Just again, make sure you keep some. A lot of the quests need purified shards. Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. That makes sense. Because I was like, I don't use them anymore, but I know I used to use them before. Um, but I haven't done quests in a while. So I'm like, it must be something for quests, which is why I haven't used any. Oh, yeah, or gifting to villagers for, like, um, their daily likes or something like that. That's fair. That makes sense, too. Checks out. <clears throat> All right. Put things away again. So much. Yeah, I have so many dream shots. I have a ton. I'm just not doing anything with them. I don't have anything to do with them. Do, do. Now, I don't really need to gift them because Merlin is max level. Fair enough. I did. Okay. Oh, there is some that can go in there. So weird. My smart transfer doesn't like to work for that stuff. It's so odd. All right, the rest of that is all extra again. <clears throat> Lil's! <laughs> Lil's, you're so sweet. I am so happy to have found your little community. Looking forward to more laughs and throbby gold content. Thank you. No. Tixie rave, Tixie rave, Tixie rave, Tixie rave. Lils. Lils, thank you so much for the two months. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for being so sweet and supportive for so long. I adore you. We got you, Bestie, with the uh, laughs and the throbby gold content for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. 110%. Got you, Bestie. Thank you so much for the two months, though. I really do appreciate it. You're sweet. I think Merlin was the main one who needed dream shards. Am I right in that? I believe so. It sounds about right. It does sound right, yeah. I'm just glad you found us and you're enjoying your time here, Lils. <clears throat> and I hope... Um, I know there's a lot of people here who um, obviously found us through Disney and really like Disney Dreamlight Valley. But um, I hope y'all um, will like when we start to play Breath of the Wild, too. And vibe with us. It's the same vibes. It'll just be a different game, you know, in the background, so... But same kind of boy beast. As long as you like the community. Doesn't matter what the heck we play. We always have the same amount of unhinged chaos. 
But yeah, soon we'll be playing Breath of the Wild because uh, this game is... We're going to run dry on what we can do in Dreamlight Valley until the update comes. So we'll take a little break from it and then go back. I found you through Iona. Oh, you're sweet, Megs. Uh, I appreciate you fall coming over from Iona. Iona's so sweet. I love her so much. <clears throat> an absolute angel. And such an inspiration, honestly. I adore her content so much. Unhinged chaos, best chaos. Yep, exactly, exactly. Got so much of that. Oh my gosh, everywhere is just so messy. I haven't, could you tell that I haven't cleaned anywhere over the weekend with all my night shards or my night uh, thorns and... <laughs> I just restarted Breath of the Wild. May needs to hurry up. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. May does need to hurry up. I agree. Um, but yeah, I did uh, just uh, FYI for anyone who didn't know. Um, we got an announcement on Twitter that um, there's going to be 10 minutes of Tears of the Kingdom. Um, like playthrough. They're doing it tomorrow at 7 a.m. PT. So we're going to watch it in the beginning of stream. Because I'm not going to be up at 7. Absolutely not. So we'll watch it um, in the first like hour of stream. And chaos is chaos no matter the content. We wild in 24-7. True. Uh, true actually, yeah. Love chaos. I haven't played um, in Disney, uh, Dreamlight Valley in a month. Logged on today. And what a mess. Yeah. It gets so unmet. It gets so out of control. So quickly. 7 a.m. PT, that's like when I go to bed, even though it's 9 a.m. for me. You know what? Vibe, bestie. As you should. I'm proud of you, truly. <laughs> Listen, you're going to bed at all, so like winning, you know? I haven't played in a couple days. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people right now um, are getting to the point of not playing Dreamlight Valley a lot at the current moment. Only because, like, we're getting to that point where it's like, okay, well, we've all finished the last update stuff. We're waiting for, like, the new update stuff. So everyone's kind of, like, in this lull period. Um, unless you're doing, like, a bunch of decorating or something. Or if you, like, just started the game so you have, like, tons of content and uh, quests and things like that. It's kind of like a lull. I only play to check up on the shops right now and to feed the animals I still need. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that, Liliana. That's basically what I'm coming up on, too, because after we decorate sunlit, like, that's it. <clears throat> that's it. Hi, Hannah. Welcome in. Are we doing good? I usually let it get out of control just before a new star path, because there's usually a quest to get rid of 40 of them. <gasps> that's smart, Luxito, actually. That is smart, but I, I would, like, physically hate looking at that. <laughs> that is a good idea, truly. I still have Winnie and Buzz quest to finish. I'm waiting until I get, um, it gets closer to the new update before I finish them. That's a good idea, yeah. Literally, I only need Woody and Prince Eric. Dang, you're doing so good. I haven't played since a few weeks after it was announced. Really, Nurple? Is, did you just, like, um, like, lose interest in it, or? Or what? Ant Flo came out of nowhere, so we're trying right now. Oh, no! Bestie, there's, like, three of y'all dealing with Ant Flo right now, and I'm so sorry makes you feel any better you got besties going through it with you so <laughs> you can uh cuss her out together okay <laughs> i'm so sorry though you got this i believe in you i played too much and uh didn't keep up with the updates oh fair 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 <laughs> thank you for the luck panda i appreciate you so much thank you for linking and vibing why did you let me download Snack Bar? <laughs> because it's so fun and so amazing and so great. And I'm so glad you're addicted to it too. As you should. 65 hours for DDB. Sadly, me too. I hate when she comes to visit. Yeah, it's always the worst. It's always that kind of worst. But that's fair, Nurple. Do you think you, like, do you see yourself ever coming back to this game like if there was like the right update for you or something like that or do you think at this point you're like overwhelmed with the the stuff that you have missed 
65.9. Let's go. Dang. A lot of hours. Is there any critters here today that I haven't fed? I don't think so. I forgot about the freaking crocodile last night again. It's just 6 p.m. is such a weird time for me. Like, I'm never thinking about opening up Disney at 6 p.m. on Sunday. So I always forget about the crocodile. Me, 1 billion hours. When do I work? I don't know. Sometimes. <laughs> you work sometimes. Currently working, not supposed to be on my phone, but I need something to perk me up again. <laughs> Hi, Cactus. Hello. How you doing? We won't tell. Don't worry. Hey, bestie. <laughs> we got you. We got you. But hi, hello. Legally, I work 40 hours a week. You're definitely logging in all those hours for sure. Probably won't come back since I play Destiny and always leave that game for months, but it's my favorite. Um, I definitely see me coming back at least when I buy Game Pass again, unless I still have it. Oh, fair, 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 fair. Fair. What kind of uh, update would you really want in this game? Like, what would be your uh, your one thing that you super want? Like, character or whatever. Are you interested in Lion King that's coming out soon or not so much? Okay. Most of my biomes are all clean. We have the beach. I think that's it. I think I just have to clean the beach. Did you say Lion King? Yeah, that's what's coming next. Uh, this update in April. Let's turn pet cam off because... Wolfie is not doing a whole bunch of anything. <clears throat> eee. There we go. Are you secretly my boss undercover calling me out? <laughs> yes. Um, I have a question. Have you ever had to do something with the pumpkin carriage and forgotten lands or am I just too early? No, we haven't done anything with it yet. We're thinking, um, in the summer update because in the summer update on the roadmap, they use a picture of the, um, pumpkin house that's up there. But yeah, you can't do anything with it. You never get to interact with it. You can't move it. You can't do a single thing. So no, you're perfectly on par. Ugh, summer, can you imagine? It's snowing and cold. Hey, yeah, that's fair. I know a lot of people are definitely like over the weather right now. Where's spring lost? Spring is just late this year. It's fine. Time to check if I still have game pass. Yeah, you might as well. Might as well. Mm -mm. Ugh. So much stuff. Have I found every orb yet? Yeah, I have. Oh, I have. You know, I really like it. I've done all that stuff. I've done everything that I can do um, outside of uh, Mother Gothel's quest. I'd like to see Belle and Beast have the beast and have the beast turn from human form to beast like Ariel can with mermaid and human. Oh, that'd be kind of cool. That'd be nice. I wish they would give more characters alt forms like that too. Like I really want um, Vanessa for Ursula as well. Just because I want Ursula to be able to walk around on the land, you know? Like it's so hard to interact with her and I feel like I literally never see Ursula at all ever and I never talk to her because like she's always in the water. And I want to be able to interact with her on like a one-off chance. But like I never even see her. I constantly forget that she even exists. <laughs> Which is so terrible. Oh, sorry. You're, uh, well, I have every orb that I can get. You can't get this one yet. This orb is not um, not in the game, like, progression-wise. You can't do anything with this orb. Can we get a couple more princesses? I thought we were going to get Cinderella. Um, Summer. Summer, they said a new princess races into the valley. Same with Ariel. Wish you could hang out with her. You can later. You can later, Archero. You just got to keep progressing stuff. Ariel, at least you can fix. You just got to keep doing story progression. <clears throat> That's why um, only Ursula really 
parcel that we need. But yeah, luckily for her, they did add that, which is nice. Eva. All right, let's go check my shop. Also, good morning, Ajiro. I wasn't sure what the princess is. That is totally my bad. No, you're perfect. You're good. Yeah, but summer, they said there's going to be a new princess racing into the valley. <clears throat> oh, ooh, I finally got the bear chair. Oh, our oh, shop is actually greetings, kind of neighbor. decent today. This flooring is really cute. Greetings, neighbor. <laughs> oh my God, wait. There's actually like a lot of new stuff that I've never seen before. Hello? Hello. What is happening today? Hey. That was like already three new things. And then this is new. I've never had this before either. I mean, it's ugly, but I've never had it before. So it's four new things. Four new things for furniture already. I think that's it. The rest of this, I'm pretty sure I have it all. I don't know if I have this color. Good day to you. I'm going to buy another tingle chair because I think I have two. Bye -bye. There is nothing exciting in my shop. No, I'm sorry. Do we have a hint as to which princess it can be? Um, The only hints that we have is it says a new princess races into the valley. And the picture is of the uh, pumpkin house inside of um, Forgotten Land. So it could be uh, Cinderella because there's Cinderella race against time and the pumpkin house. So it kind of makes sense. People are also thinking because it says race into the valley, they're like, oh, maybe it's Vanellope because Vanellope is a princess. I don't know. I think it's Cinderella. My guess is Cinderella. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Hi, Michelle. Welcome in. How you doing? Nothing exciting in my shop. How rude. Do you need me a fight, Scrooge, for you? I got it. I had a super pretty dress, um, but I'm too broke for it. I guess you got to grind for money. <gasps> Enjoy your food, Liliana. Good day to you. <laughs> I found a cute dark blue dress in Scrooge shop. Oh, nice. <laughs> nice. You got to change your outfit for today. I think I want to wear that blue cami top. It was really cute. <clears throat> it was very cute. This one. Oh, well, you can't. <laughs> Hold on. You can't see it because my jacket. Yeah, this one. It's cute. Please bring Penelope. I love her, but it's probably going to be Cinderella. I'm guessing Cinderella, but I don't know. I don't know. We can, you know, we have no idea. Um, I'm just guessing Cinderella because of the picture. Um, oh, these flats are kind of cute. Just because of the um, picture of the house. But that doesn't mean that it is going to be that. We're just like the regular. Let's see. Where are the regular jeans? Did I pass them? I must have. Oh, yeah, these are too blue. <clears throat> Went to the store to buy some tricks. The cashier looked at me and was like, you know, these are for kids, right? Oh my gosh. Hi, Zig. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing good. Screw the shop is a sparkling ice gown from Frozen, but bad news, 16,000. I have 17. Do I buy it and save up a little more? Asking because I'm tempted to get it. Um, If you have the money, you might as well buy it. You can always get more. Um, You can get more money pretty easily. I guess it depends on what you're doing, though, you know? I would have just, I probably would just buy it if I was in your position, though. That's because I'm weak and I want all the clothes. So I would buy it immediately. Do, 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 do. Hmm. What I really want is like some cute like white shorts or something like that. I think I'm just going to put the black pants back on. I finally figured out my orchard for now. Did you? Ooh, what'd you do? That's true. Plus it's only for a day. I think I might get it. I'm on a personal mission to get all the long ball gown style dresses. Yeah, just get it. You can get money pretty simply. I want white, white, uh, white high-waisted shorts so bad. Yeah, those would be so cute. I uh, most definitely think it's Cinderella. Yeah, I think so. I think it makes sense. 
I would love vanilla pea, but I think like it just um because of the picture they decided to show us, I really just feel like it's gonna be um Cinderella. Unless they're trying to mislead us, but I might go for the short hair today. It's kinda cute. Kinda vibey. I always like this hairstyle. Hi Sawa, how are you? Sawa, I adore you and I love you, and that is all. How's things? How's, um, how's move and stuff? I put all my trees and bushes in the meadow. Oh, nice. Hey, I love you too, and that's all. <laughs> Where'd I get the choker? Just from Scrooges. Just from Scrooge. One of the days. Oh, so you look very cute. Um, you look very cute. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate you. Not the pull string. It's so cursed. I hate it. Be ready for lurkies. Uh, kids are asking for lunch. Okay, have fun. Good luck. Good luck finding lunchies for the babies. I might do this satchel. I do like it. I don't wear it very often. The ghosts are not outside and that's rude. <gasps> How dare they? That is rude of them. I do agree. Very rude. Truly. They need to be outside literally always. So we can see them and give them love and attention and <laughs> live vicariously through them. I even scooted in my chair to go see. Wow. Wow. So they just hate us. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. It's fine. We're not going to cry about it much. <sighs> but also, yes, we will. <laughs> Heckin' rude. The yellow backpack looks good. Yeah, I like that one too. I just really like this artist satchel. Okay. Um, we need to go make some more, uh, some more food. More berry stuff. Let me see how much stuff I have. Like how many sugar cane and milk and everything I got. I gotta do some, oh, oof. oopsies. <laughs> I forgot I moved my, uh, Crafting bench. Oops, let me put it back. Because we got to make some light posts for up there. Is that the right way? No, this way. Moving is so stressful. Uh, Nico has never moved before and he's struggling. He finally ate like 15 treats this morning, which was fine with me because he hadn't eaten anything else. Poor baby. I'm glad he ate something though. That's stressful. Poor little angel. What did I come here for? Oh, I don't know why. I, I'm not. I don't know why I'm looking here. I'm trying to look here. <laughs> Goofy goober. Hmm. Fifteen milk. Okay. Finally got everything I wanted from Star Path. Now I'm stuck on the screen trying to press continue, but the game said nor. Oh no! Rude. Well, I'm glad he ate though, Sarah. I'm glad he's like settling in and vibing and um, I hope you're doing good. <laughs> How's your day? It's good, Archura. How are you? How was your day? I hope well. So I want the broken washer. I brought a broken washer into the shop to get worked on. Now I can smell. It's fabric softener. It's giving me a headache. I'm sorry. That's rough. That is a very powerful smell. I hope it goes away soon, though. Stinky. It's not a pastry cream foods. Yeah, it's going to go by so quickly. Pretty good so far. Good. I'm glad you're having a good day. Doesn't smell bad. It's overwhelming. Yeah, it's just strong. It's just strong. Which makes sense. Mm. 
All right, let's put all the stuff in my pockets away. This valley is so friendly. Like Everything that I have. Now we're gonna go iron farming. Cause I need more. I keep using all of our iron and I'm gonna use all of it again, so our... My office is next to the work area, which doesn't help. Oh, that's fair. That makes sense then, yeah. So all right, the past three days I've thoroughly kicked my booty and I'm all out of whack, but I'm excited to get everything put together and make it cute and cozy and homey. Yeah, it's gonna be so fine. See, there's definitely stressful, but like, and have laundry, best thing ever. Yeah, I listen, bestie, you're making me jealous of your washer and dryer. Like iconic, truly. I thought our new washer was advanced and then you tell me about yours. Pfft. Honestly, I wonder if there is something like that for my washer. There may be, because a lot of it is very much auto. Did I put that ginger? There we go. Okay. My source system is so bad right now. It's a ton of small chests in a line. I really need to upgrade to medium. Excited because I'm starting with pumpkins for more money and money means I get anything I want. True, true. Yeah, you'll get there eventually. More money is always a good thing. <clears throat> hey there. All right, Goofy, get all this out of my pockets. Okay. Then we're gonna move some wells around. So I can use them for teleportation. Because right now I cannot. You know, I really need to put something here. Um I think I'll just put this under here, even though you're never going to see it. I want it there specifically so, like, when I move my well, um, things don't, like, grow in while I'm doing my, uh, my route, you know? It's the only main reason, the only th reason I care about putting something there. Okay. Okay. Um, I need buzz. Night thorns are a pain in the backside. And going around and finding him and picking him up. Mm -mm. Oh, he isn't here. Thank gosh. All right, Buzz, let's go. Mm -mm. I'm really proud of their names. Their names are really good, Sarah. I'm proud of you too. Truly. They are iconic. Oh, you know what? We never pay changed our companion today. <gasps> Let's use Pua. We haven't had Pua out in a long time. And I do love Pua so much. It's been a while. Um, oops. What am I trying to go to? I wanted to go here. Just double check that there's no critters out today that I can see. Nope. Is it Wednesdays for the blue raccoon? <sighs> I forget. I know the crocodile is like is sun Sunday night. Uh, I think the raccoon was Wednesdays. After four? Is that what it was? Wednesdays after four and the brown raven is like Tuesdays after six? I think. Something like that. It's also so nice having an office just for myself that is really just an office and not an office bedroom and cat room all in one. Yeah. I can just walk out the door instead of trying to squish over in between the cat tree and the wall. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, that's super helpful. It's really nice to also just be able to separate your work and uh, like bedroom spaces. You know what I mean? That's something that I eventually want to do for myself, obviously, is like get my workspace out of my bedroom space because I constantly like I always feel like I'm at work <laughs> because I'm always in my workspace. My workspace is also my gaming space. So like, ugh, you know, it's also just like my lounging space too. So it's really easy to just start working. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. I have not finished my coffee, so I'm gonna finish my coffee. I'm gonna 
go heat it up in the microwave on this break actually because it's not warm at all anymore and i need to i i have not drinking like literally any of it so um can my hands please cooperate with me and not drop my phone i need a caffeine boost oh no tell it not to drop your phone i got you i'm sorry it's doing that though hi dragon hello you could do what i did and forget to put the coffee in the coffee machine oh no is the coffee also the same as your work coffee yeah unfortunately frazzo unfortunately it is the same as my work coffee yeah so like <laughs> um it is ad break time so if y'all need to get up and stretch your legs or use the restroom or get food or water or coffee or anything like that now is a really good time to do that because you will not miss a single thing i'm gonna get up and reheat my coffee that i have not drinking this morning and i've been neglecting so if you need to step away for any reason whatsoever now is a good time and then when we come back we'll do some um iron grinding because i have no iron and i need it very badly oh i need iron so bad we got to make some lights for Frosted Heights because we have no lights up there and that area is not done yet. So um, I will be back. Enjoy breakies. Thank you, Sawa. Nurple, I saw the picture of Sleepy in Discord. It's really cute. What a baby. A little angel, truly. Like, so sweet. I adore them so much. Mm -mm. Also, I told wifey that y'all said happy birthday. <laughs> 
probably gonna be mad at me. <laughs> now this is a great day to play outside. Hi, witchy. Hello. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Happy birthday, wifey. So well, you're sweet. Yeah, it's our birthday today, and we're gonna hang out later and play some games and vibe. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, Witchy, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. We're sending you all of the love and all of the best energy. I'm so sorry, though. You're so tough and strong. This community truly brightens my mood, and I love watching you. You're so sweet. I'm glad we can be here for you, Brendo. But you got this. I had the stream tabbed up when you went on break, and then you randomly started talking and scared me because I didn't expect you to randomly <laughs> start talking. <laughs> I'm sorry, nature. Oopsie poopsie. <laughs> How are you? How's your day? Are we doing good? Welcome, welcome. Can we get a shout out for nature, by the way? Nature is so sweet and wonderful and precious, and um, I love them so much. I hope you're doing absolutely incredible. How's things? How's life? How's drums? All of it. <clears throat> Evil laughter seems to say something other than sorry, ma'am. Listen, uh, I'm chaos, okay? It's fine. <laughs> like, I love and adore you, but also it's fine. I think the biggest hug went through and going through that since last year, so I understand. Oh, Miss Marika, thank you for the loves for, uh, the love for witchy. Now I'm good. Might start opening mini commissions to make some side money. I'm stream as well. Ooh, what kind of commissions, bestie? And I'm glad streams are good. Just like, um, you can do like emotes, or like overlays, or what kind of stuff you want to do. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Ooh, parlor beans, like key change. Ooh, that's kind of cute. Love that. That's absolutely precious. I would 110% get one. I had my interview. I think I did well, but I was super nervous. You did absolutely amazing. You crushed it. You crushed it. I'm proud of you regardless of the results. Because you did amazing for sitting down and doing it. Back. Thank you, Maui. Appreciate it. And thank you, Buzz. <clears throat> oh. Hello? Oh, that is the right way. Okay. Swear. In form of injections. Oh. I'm sorry you have to deal with that, though. I'm so sorry. It's heckin' rough. I can only imagine. Do, do, do. Hi, Olaf. Love sunny days. Thank you, Olaf. Ah! Olaf, low. I am blocking me. It's an immovable wall. Thank you for the huggies. For witchy. That looks sweet. And Xenox, can we get a shout out for nature? I don't know if we got one or not. And I missed it. Maybe I missed it. Just in case. I know you're also working, obviously. Schwa! <clears throat> Thank you. Wait. <laughs> okay, and Witchy too. The shout out for Witchy too. Do you stream bestie? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> you too. You can have one also. 
Why is uh, pit sweat a sim uh, symptom of being nervous? Not vibing with that. Oh, yeah, I hate that. I hate that. So wholesome, I love it. Don't you shout me out unnecessary, I will bop. <laughs> I will, how dare you, I'm gonna. Well, suck it. Mm. Suck it, nature. Um, I just realized how much iron I need to craft. Time to iron farm too, you got this. It's honestly not too bad. It's very like casual. I love just doing iron farming and like chit chatting with y'all because I can like very like simply just autopilot doing iron farming and uh, reading and conversing with chat because like I do it so much now. It's just kind of like muscle memory um, in the background. Gives me something to do. So. And we talk about how I almost dropped all my items on the ground while we were filling my med minder nor. Why am I the way that I am? Oh, bestie. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You're doing great. Also, you just reminded me I need to get a med. Um, I need to get one of those things specifically for like all my vitamins because I'm tired of opening three jars every day. <laughs> I'm tired of opening three heckin' uh, pill bottles every day for my vitamins, probiotics, and iron. I need to just get something where I can just open one thing and just take all three of them out for the day because I'm just tired of it. But I haven't done it yet. Hi, Milk. Hello. I need to do that for meds too. Yeah, it's just easier. It'd just be so much nicer to have them all in like one spot. But I want something cute. Time to go dance while being sick. Good luck, Sunny. I wish you the best of luck. I'm sorry you're not feeling good. It's annoying to have four and be like, wait, did I get that one or that one? Yeah, that too. That too. <clears throat> Hi, all good. Welcome in. Hi, Alex. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're both doing good. Hello, hello. Right now, it's Fudge and Night Thorn removal for me, but taking a break so I can pick up real quick. You got this. I believe in you. I have a cute little container that has morning and evening spots and you can leave them in the week or you can pop individual days out if you're traveling or whatever and it's blue and green. Wait, do you have a link for it, Sawa? I used to use one, but now all my pills are too large to fit and I haven't spent the spoons to replace it with a bigger one. Ah, fair. See, that's kind of where I am too, Ulterious. It's like, I don't have the spoons to get one. <laughs> I haven't like sat down and actually just like bought one, but um, I need to, I need to for those. Because it's going to get to the point where, like, I just don't want to open the three bottles a day and then I just won't take them and I need to take them because they're vitamins. Like, it's not going to be as detrimental as me not taking, like, my SSRIs or anything like that, but I still need to do it, so. Gotta get it. Then the spoons to fill it once a week. Yeah, that too. That's the thing that I'm, like, worried about is making sure I keep it full, you know? And, like, fill it every week. Ugh. Then I feel like I'm just going to be back in the same space of opening all the bottles every week again. I would do that when my pumps have some pot issues. And I'm like, uh, if that's funkle, I don't want that in my mouth. Fair. Fair, fair. You reminded me that I have a cat now. Oh my gosh. She has not been upstairs, but I have been upstairs. Please. What is happening? Oh no. I dropped 10 of them and... I'm like, it's fine because three second rule. Oh yeah, bestie. Ooh, you got those little, those little kitty pizzas with litter. <gasps> Rip bestie. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sure she wasn't in that exact spot that you dropped it in. It only happened today. It's fine. You're good. A new way to become cat woman question mark. <gasps> oh my God. You're going to get cat superpowers. Hi Krug. Welcome back. No, she wasn't. Sure. Yeah, we'll go with that. That she just wasn't in that area. It's Chili Wonka already, besties. Super early today. Cat superpowers. So basically, your superpower is going to be knocking cups off of uh, counters. <laughs> you are a sight for sore eyes. If Elsa's here, then I'm here. What kind of a... Your imagination. Back just in time. You crushed it. 
This is why I adore this community. We go on tangents about the most random stuff and we're all for it. Absolutely. That's why I love it here too. Like the game that we're playing doesn't even matter. I know a lot of people obviously found us through Disney Dreamlight Valley and probably are very obviously interested in Disney Dreamlight Valley, but the community vibes, like if you love the community vibes, it's like this regardless of what we play every single time. It's always like this. <laughs> that never changes. The game is just like kind of our backgrounds. Something for my brain to preoccupy on while I'm also having conversation because I need something going on. Since I apparently can't make the decision for myself, um, uh, what do I want to eat, besties? Um, pizza. Nuggies, ooh. Jumping from very high places. For cat powers? I mean, I guess that's true, that's true. So I shared a link to one I looked at but didn't buy, but this is one that's a monthly one. So you only have to fill it once a month. I was listening to what you were saying about doing it every week, feeling similar, too similar uh, to opening the bottles. It's in self-care. <gasps> Sarah, you are iconic. You are absolutely iconic. I appreciate you so much. A monthly one would be so much better. Yeah, because I don't want to fill it every week because then I'm just going to not do it. I will absolutely forget to do it. <gasps> Thank you, Link. I appreciate you so much. This is the med minder I have. Hold on, let me let me open it. Hold on, hold on. Your imagination. The week pops out, so if you do go somewhere for a week, you can just take a week with you. Ooh. Oh, that one's re wee! Stop it. Ugh. Lil's, this one is so cute. Wait, these are so cute. Yeah, these are really cute. You can just fill them, like, I'd honestly probably just fill each one with, like, whatever med I need and then just open up the three containers a day. I don't know. These are cute, though. I like them. I like that they're nice and small. And they're pink. Is that going to help me with the issue of having to fill it um, often? No, but are they cute? Yes. <laughs> Let me see the one Sarah put. Hold on. Uh, wait. Is Discord lying to me? I don't see it in self-care. I don't see anything in Discord. Discord's lying to me. Maybe it's still loading. Discord lighting. Oh, there it went. There it's there now. Oh, it's there now. Yeah, I was probably still sending. Not me forgetting to post. Oh, it was... <laughs> Listen, we'll just blame Discord. Discord didn't send it. Discord wasn't sending the message. It's fine. Oh, these are cute. Oh, these are cute too. These are more like standard, but. Um, I'm questing a lurking state. Finally finished my last quest and the game is sort of glitched where the floor sort of no longer exists. Does that happen to anyone else? I'll post a picture in Discord. Oh no. Yeah, post a picture. I don't think so, but I don't know. That's awful though, Duncan. I'm sorry. At least you didn't use my high school nickname. Mm-hmm. Don't think I don't remember. <laughs> Soup is a no-go for me. Oh, fair. Well, the nuggies or pizza sound good, Cobra? Got a lurky while I put together a digital flyer for opening my commissions because I'm just going to jump in and not care and yellow it. <laughs> As you should, nature. Have fun. Good luck. Good luck making a little flyer. You're going to do amazing and incredible and wonderful. And um, I adore you so much. You're doing great. They will definitely not help you fill them because I'm useless. Really? Great. It's fine. Nuggies do sound good. Nuggies do sound really good. Yeah, true. True, true. Well, there you go. What's that pig thing following you? That's Pua. It's Pua. From Moana. Pua what? Pua. P-U-A. Pua. <clears throat> oh, I haven't seen it yet. Oh! You need to watch Moana. Moana's really good. Lils, please. <laughs> Hi, Faye. Me to my cat. <laughs> Stop it. What's that pink thing falling for? Stop it. No, she's a baby. 
I'm looking really mean. <laughs> I adore you, Faye. <gasps> Faye! Faye, wait. Okay, I know you're lurking. I know you're lurking, but I have exciting news and it might be that I might actually be able to play FF14 again soon because I'm officially on anxiety medication. So like, maybe I won't have anxiety and maybe I'll actually be able to play that game again. So, that was kinda cool. I can join you now too. Yay! That'd be so fun! Yeah, I think I think it's gonna be a lot better. I bought um, the latest expansion when it was on sale on Steam. Because uh, Endwalker was half off on the Steam sale, so I bought it. <clears throat> so now I have to. <laughs> now I have to play it. Because I already bought the expansion. Even though I haven't finished the last one. Her tummy is so big. She's 90% tummy. Oh, a baby. Hi, hideaway. Welcome in. Uh, time to nap, because why not? Enjoy your nap, cat girl. I hope it's satisfying. Tried it for 14. I couldn't get into it, so I gave up. Oh, really? Really made the character on like seven servers and give up. Did you just not like like the class? Or what was it exactly that you couldn't get into? Do you know? Do you remember? Hi, Casey. I hope you're having a great stream. Going to lurk for a bit. I appreciate you. Thank you for the lurky. Stream's going good. Stream is going absolutely amazing. I appreciate you so much. Can you imagine her little run? It's just tummy. Yeah, just little tummies. Do your flats have a design on them or are they just super shiny? They're both. They're both. Um, There is um little roses on the front. They got little roses on the toes. Um, I'm so tired. I don't want to work anymore. I'm sorry, beastie. How much longer do you have? I played MMO like games, but never fully, uh, full on immerse myself. Um, I don't know. I really like FF14. I mean, there's no reason not to try it, Cobra, because, um, it's free up until level 60. So if you don't like it, then you don't have to commit to anything. But also, no, also go into it with a mindset that, like, if you do end up liking the game, do, like, keep in mind that the game is a monthly subscription after that. So, like, you know. But you can always try the free trial and see if you even like it. But also just remember that, like, eventually you will have to have a monthly sub for it. So keep that in mind. <clears throat> so you don't get yourself addicted to something that you can't afford to keep up with later <clears throat> that's what is keeping me kind of cautious i will say it's 110 percent worth it in my opinion the game is just so fun so um i think i like to like it but i mean i couldn't get into a server to play because of the queue gotcha yeah it's um it shouldn't be as much of an issue right now there shouldn't be an issue with that right now specifically nala did you all know that y'all are amazing did you know that you're amazing stuff did you know that you're amazing and wonderful and incredible? Also, hi. That's what's keeping me kind of cautious. Fair, fair. No snacks left. Get more. It requires me to leave the house. DoorDash, I'm broke. <laughs> you're having a crisis. I'm so sorry, Lils. Um, two hours, which doesn't seem long, but time's going slow today. Well, hopefully, maybe it'll go by quicker now that you're here hanging out with us. Maybe, possibly. It's already been like two hours. Have you noticed that it's been two hours since you've been here? So maybe that, maybe it'll go by quickly. My God, it's been two and a half hours. Do you see what I mean? Like maybe time will go by quickly now that you're hanging out with us, beastie. Possibly. I've never even considered an FF game. Really? Do you just not think that you would like them hideaway or you just haven't gotten around to it? I agree too, but we know that. Yeah, yeah, fair. We know that fair. I'm glad you really like FF14. I'm super excited though, because I do really want to play the game again, so uh me and wifey might try to play now not now now but like soon since uh i'm on anxiety meds ff14 is cheaper than genshin not wrong <laughs> you're not wrong you're amazing wonderful incredible no you are Thanks for dealing with me and my outlandish com comments. What? Your outlandish comments? What are you talking about, Lils? You are absolutely wonderful. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, no, because now I'm just going to keep looking at the time. That's going to make things worse. No, you're not. It's fine. Don't look at the clock. <laughs> we, I just will tell you all the time to not look at it. No, that's going to make it worse. 
I ordered a sandwich for lunch. Please tell me why my DoorDash driver plugged that he's a rapper with my sandwich. Bestie, you gotta be on that grind 24-7, you know what I mean? Trying to promote that SoundCloud. <laughs> like, respect the hustle, truly. <laughs> if I was a DoorDash driver, I'd just be like, hey, watch my stream, by the way. He does have a SoundCloud! Stop it! Did he give you the SoundCloud link? That's hilarious. That's funny. Uh, SoundClouds are like the new demo tapes. No one gives out demo tapes anymore. It's just their SoundCloud link. <laughs> I gotta go. I'll still be listening and hanging out. What's your thing, Chelsea? I appreciate you. I've never played an MMO game. I've never even played... Never played Elder Scrolls either. Gotcha. Well, FF14 and FF11 are the only ones that are MMOs. The other ones are story-based, like action. Um turn-based uh, RPGs. <clears throat> but FF14 is really fun. I like it a lot. They're just trying to bring you a sandwich and good music. Exactly! Sandwich and vibes. Thank you for the lurk, Zara. You're so sweet. You're so sweet. Thank you for being, uh, being here and lurking and vibing. I hope whatever you're doing is going good. It was literally a picture of a QR code with his link tree. Oh my God, incredible. And you scanned the code as you should. Me not playing in five months despite putting 2000 into it. Listen, bestie, I feel that. I haven't played that game in so long and I put so much money into Genshin. I haven't touched Genshin since right before COVID started. I feel that, yeah, it's been a while for me too. Switch updated chat. I see someone who mentions me in pink and I see Xenox talking in purple. It's very weird when you have black theme. Um, go into, um, if you go into your settings stuff and, um, click like chat highlights, you should, the chat highlight settings, you should be able to change that. Possibly. I'm assuming you're talking about how it like has like a little border box around it. Um, when people, like certain people. It might be your chat highlight. If it's a border, like here, hold on. Does it look like, um, if I turn them on? Oh gosh. Is it like a border box like that? Or is it like highlighted, like the whole background of it? Or is it like this, where it's like a box? Oh, it's worse? Okay, then it might be FFC or BTTV. Because that would be the chat highlight for Switch. I don't know where my print screen button is. <laughs> oh, no. And do Genshin BP only? Fair. Why is the first song like someone rapping as SpongeBob? They knew. SpongeBob is out to get to you. Right of F12, hopefully. Um, well, I think Steph also has a 65% keyboard. Um, my print screen button, if I don't know if it's gonna be the same for you, bestie. My print screen button is function P. So maybe try function P. That's what mine is. The one thing I do really appreciate about this keyboard is uh, it has like everything. It's not it, nor uh, you might have to look for your, might have to look up your manual for your keyboard. Um. Oh yeah, you can do Windows Shift S. Windows Shift S should still work. That's true. Just do Windows Shift S. new 65 keyboard that I'm going to build arrives in May. Let's go. That's super exciting. Could be FFC or BTTV. Go into highlight options and you can customize colors when you edit the item. Yeah, that's true. It sounds like it's one of those for sure. That works. There you go. Yeah, you can do that. That's my preferred way to screenshot anyways because you can select a little area. Mm -mm. 
Um, but yeah, the one thing I like about the keycaps on my keyboard is it tells me what like the function, uh, the uh, like function button will change the key to, which is really nice. So I know where like my play and pause button is, where my print screen is and all that. One song literally features Andrew Tate this word. Ew, disgusting. Uh, we hate that. Hate, hate, hate. I prefer snipping because I did something to make it auto save in my uh, photos folder. And also because it doesn't take a picture of both monitors. Mm, true, true, true. Yeah, that's why I hate the uh, print screen button is because it takes a picture of like all three of my monitors. Yeah. Learn about function to take a screenshot of only one monitor, but I couldn't figure out how to make it save in photos. I need to figure out how to make the snipping tool thing to save in photos, because I don't know how to do that. I need to set that up, because honestly, it's really annoying that it doesn't. I need to. I have a fancy smancy third party tool that I set to F2. This one has better options and like even a little zoom on where you put your mouse so you can get a more accurate grabbies. Oh, that's kind of cool. And that as well, but not for everything like home and print screen. Mm, gotcha. Got it. That makes sense. Hi, Justin and Laura. How are you? Where is it save the screenshot? Um, I don't think it saves it anywhere by default. It's on your clipboard though. As long as it's the last thing you've copied, it just should be on your clipboard. If you go like paste something, it should be on your clipboard automatically. But I don't know how to get it to save somewhere. I don't think it's on by default. But clipboard automatically, you might have to set up something to get it to like save to a folder. But it'll be automatically clipboard. <clears throat> For me, I just open paint or Photoshop and hit paste. Yeah, I would do that too, but I want to just have it saved to a folder. But yeah, just paste it in Discord. You're doing good. Good. I'm glad you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. If you're sending in Discord, you never have to open it up and save. Yeah, luckily. Because Discord just lets you copy paste right in there. Just lets you paste photos from your clipboard. So that's nice. It's only if you want to like drag and drop it into like a Google Drive or something like that, then you're going to have to obviously like actually save it. El Toro, please, not marriage counseling. I hate it here. You're a goober. I hope you're doing good. Welcome in. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Love you too. Mm -hmm. Hey, my computer sent me a notif when I uh, snip stuff too, so I can click the notif to find it. Oh, that's nice. Dang, you have all the secrets. Love it here. Sent finally. <gasps> okay. Um, I actually have to use the restroom, so I'm gonna uh I'll check it and use the restroom at the same time. Uh so give me one second. I don't know how to do it anymore though. <laughs> we'll figure it out. I'll have to look into it. Yeah, give me one second. Hold on. Bear beat.
Okay. Hi. Um, yeah, Steph, I don't know what it is. It might be BTV. It looks like FFZ or like, um, uh, uh, BTTV. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, Alexa or no? Wait, what's happening? Hold on. <laughs> I don't know if I like that or hate that stuff. Yeah, I don't. Mine looks like that usually. I just like, I mean, I don't mind the like mentions you and replying to you thingy. Music for your mama? And it's totally not just me, just my own thing I did five ever ago. Why are you this way? Why? Why? <laughs> Minus quest for fiber Skrillex. What's happening? I saw the quote right after about the butthole. So I was like, why not? Because did he just butthole us? Oh, that's why I was like, why not? Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Gotcha. I see. Got it. It's fine. We all were just a little confused. It's one of those Mondays. <laughs> it's just one of those Mondays. It's fine. Uh, we're vibing. Everything's fine. So confused because English is hard. Fair bestie. Mood. Messy brain Monday. Valid. We love that. Yeah, what Lexa said. Nor Lanky. <clears throat> I missed all this here on Friday, but I was just lurking. I appreciate you. We miss you too. But now you're here. Now you're here and vibing. I think Burger King fries are superior. I agree. Love BK fries. love BK fries. They also don't make me sick. McDonald's makes me very sick. Really? I disagree on the fries. <gasps> How dare you? Army's curly fries are the best and biz don't at me. Okay, but curly fries are separate. I don't compare curly fries and regular fries because that's just, I mean, one's a seasoned fry and one's not a seasoned fry. Wendy's fries? Wendy's fries are good. And I just like the thickness of BK fries. <clears throat> or Jack in the Box fries? Fair. Crushing a granola bar and clementine right now so my stomach stops eating itself. But planning to eat my weight in sweet potato sushi rolls tonight? Ooh, yum. I hope you enjoy. He was coming to say hi to me. That was rude. Mean. Anthony's bullying me. Waffle fries, the best ones. Waffle fries are good. Waffle fries are good, but I can only get them at homophobic chicken place. Small pass. Fair. You can also get waffle fries, seasoned waffle fries at Carl's Jr. They're my favorite. They're called Chris Cut Fries. They're the best. I love them a lot. But yeah, outside of that, that's really good. I didn't know that. Yeah, Carl's Jr. has uh, their seasoned waffle fries. They're just called Chris Cut, and they're great. Their chicken tendies are superior too, to be honest. Yeah, I like their chicken stars. The chicken stars slap and they give me so much like brain serotonin because they're shaped in stars. 
Like they just make, I don't know, that heals my inner child eating chicken stars and eating like every little point of the star off individually and then eating like the rest of the star. <sighs> Love chicken stars. They're a vibe, honestly. I need veggie dino nuggets in my life and my life will be set. You do, you do need them. Rallies or checkers fries are delicious too. I don't think we have either of those, unfortunately. New York fries are good. What are New York fries? You can't come here curly and regular. I see. I'm glad you agree, MB. Thank you. Because they're totally different. Sometimes I want like seasoned fries. And sometimes I don't. <clears throat> Paleo cakes at Arby's were way better. And then they, and they said here, have some crickly fries that are not good instead and took them away. Mm. I don't know why they did that. Why would they do that? Stinky of them. The sea people could season a non-season, non-curly fry. will no longer accept the laziness from the no seasoning room. What? Oh gosh. Sure people could season a non-curly fry. Yeah, but why though? Like, I don't always want seasoning on my fries. There are seasoned regular fries, but I don't always want those. Like, sometimes I just want a plain fry. Morningstar did Mickey Mouse shaped nuggies, but I couldn't get my hands on them. Oh no, that's upsetting. So it sounds like they were limited. Yeah, Five Guys Cajun fries. Five Guys Cajun fries are really good, true. They're really yummy. And they give you way too many fries, like a good way too many. I hate when y'all talk about yum American food or food restaurants and I have no idea what y'all talking about and I'm jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, you just have to move to, uh, just move here, sorry. My notes were so short this week and I started yesterday, so I'm already done. Oh, <gasps> let's go! Nice, Nala! Nice! Uh, I'm proud of you, bestie, you crushed it. Sweet potato fries? I just don't like sweet potatoes, but I know a lot of people like sweet potato fries. I need to do a poll, which is the superior french fry. Oh, that's gonna be too much. There's too many options. Five Guys fries are so salty, I can't. Their portions are huge, though. Oh, they're too salty for you. I guess that's fair. I love you. That's fair. Five Guys fries are too greasy. Five Guys is very greasy. That's valid. My stomach doesn't have an uh, issue with it necessarily, but I know a lot of people obviously will. Thank you, Ollie. Just great because I have some notes from last week to make up and then notes from my other class this week left. Oh, nice. Well, good. Then you got extra time to do all that. We love. Hi, Dean. I hope you're doing good. Fast food fries rank from worst to best. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're party. I feel like we did this before, haven't we? We must have done this at some point before that list. There's no way we haven't. Hi, Dean. I hope you're doing good. Love you, adore you. Ollie, come here. You want some snacks? Hey, uh, that was unnecessary and rude of you. Uh, that was unnecessarily rude of you. Why did you throw that on the floor? Huh? Why did you throw that on the floor? <laughs> it's updated. Give us the top five. I'm curious. You're a rude boy. He said, I'm sorry, mom. No, you're not. Greasy stuff makes my belly hurt. That's valid. What a burger is five. Okay. I've never had it. My mom always orders her fries with no salt. So they cook them fresh. So yeah, that's a smart thing to do. Even though my anxiety tells me that I could never do that. Um, but yeah, no, that is a, that is a way to get fresher fries. Check Nikolai. <clears throat> burger King four. Okay. I saw you post before the bot even acknowledged it. Wait, for what? Wingstop? Five guys is two. Okay. Wingstop. Interesting. I'm so sorry. Whataburger was so nasty to me. Pfft. McDonald's? Okay. Interesting list. I mean, I do like McDonald's fries, but interesting. These are an interesting top five. Hi, 40. Welcome in. 
How are we doing good? Wait, but Pizza Hut fries are so underrated, are they? I didn't even know they had fries. Wingstop wings. I'm a Hooters person, personally. I like Hooters more. I'm doing okay. What about you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, Dean. I'm glad you're well. That was the top five. There were 23 overall. Got it. Got it. Got it. So you're not supposed to the word thing right at the same time as me, but like right before the bot even said I won like that quick. Oh, interesting. Wendy's fries are like C tier, but Wendy's fries dipped in frosty S tier. Valid. Valid, valid. I got slide tackled at full velocity today. <gasps> I'm so sorry. I hope you're okay. I hope you're feeling all right. I'm good though. Thank you for asking. Fries are mad. Not as good as Wendy's BK or Five Guys for sure. McDonald's? Eh, I created a screen. I like McDonald's better than um, most of those. Wendy's fries to me are just, eh. I'm not a fan of Wendy's fries. <clears throat> I know a lot of people are. I'm not a fan of them, though. To me, I pretty much only like McDonald's fries. Uh, the rest have always been mid. Valid, bestie. Valid. I agree. A full flip? My guy, that was that fast. Jeez. Uh, goodness gracious. We know you like Hooters, but what kind of fries do you like? Groog, please. Their fries, actually. Their curly fries and cheese sauce is really good. Um, the hot honey rub wings at Wingstop make me weak. Ooh. I have never had those Danger Panda. No. Hot honey rub. I might have to try getting them. I haven't gone to Wingstop a lot, but I know a lot of people like it. I've only really ever tried to get like their hot wings and their hot wings are not as good as Hooters. Their hot like buffalo is not good to, for me. <clears throat> Gotta go get a little bit BRB. Have fun. Good luck. Drive safe. Travel safe. Restaurant near me that sells sweet potato fries and maple syrup. Ooh, sounds like a good combo. I'm not um, a sweet potato person, but that sounds like a good combo for him. Not going to lie. <gasps> wait, that sounds really good, Sarah. Oh, wait. A taco pizza. Refried beans and salsa as a base and taco meat and cheese. And then after it's baked, lettuce, tomato, crushed up on dor uh, Doritos are added. Mine's on flatbread because I prefer it that way, but you can do regular crust. Oh, interesting. Wait, that sounds really good. Not going to lie. Sounds really, really yummy. I got a new name for you, Cattail Tixie. For why? I met Ryan today. Who was Ryan? Hooters Eel. By Judy. <laughs> um, meeting time and then go. time to go home and make tacos. Have fun, Krug. Good luck in your meeting. Didn't talk about selling Mexican pizza for a while. They did. Yeah, I think they still... Did they bring it back? I thought they brought it back. Unless they took it away again. But I know recently they brought it back. They do have it back. Okay. Hi, princess. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If they had a hooter, a boy hooters, I'd go. Ugh, we need fun boy hooters. Thank you. I would love. That is still my favorite place that I ever saw advertised in FF14 is fun boy hooters. And I'm so sad that I didn't go. Sounds like a journey, truly. So you have slaps and it's apparently very common in Iowa and not elsewhere, but taco sauce and sour cream are mine. That sounds really yummy though. That does sound really, really good. I'm jealous. Oh, well, nice, 40. That's cool. Yeah, they did bring back the Mexican pizza. Okay, because I knew for a while they had it and then they got rid of it, but then they brought it back. My mom used to get it before she was gluten-free. Fair. Fair, fair. Mm -mm. Can't wait for the Taco Bell volcano menu to come back. Wait, volcano menu? They have a volcano menu? What is that? Is that just like super spicy stuff? I didn't know that was a thing. I mean, it sounds like it's going to be like spicier things. The volcano sauce is my favorite. Yeah, what's the volcano menu? Ah, 
I don't know what a volcano sauce is either. I feel like I missed out a whole generation of uh, Taco Bell. Just spicy stuff? Ah. I got back. Um, My back fan is on my PC and I'm staring at it because it's so pretty. Nice, Nala. I'm proud of you, bestie. Proud of you for getting it installed. Menu is so hot we can't keep her cool. Established back in 1995. Returning up the heat for the third time with the perfect encore to satisfy your spice cravings through the return of the fan favorite volcano menu. Return reintroduces the volcano burrito, volcano taco, and the option to add lava sauce on any item. Product will be available first with early access for Taco Bell Rewards members on June 27th and general availability beginning on June 29th. Not them having a Taco Bell Rewards, like not them having a beta for their food. <laughs> That's so funny. That is so funny to me. Like, hey, if you're part of our rewards program, you can try it early. <laughs> Please, early access on food is so funny. Hi, baby. I haven't seen you all day. Your dad came in and stole you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sweet angel. Came back while I was in middle school and left again. I was heartbroken. <gasps> well, it's coming back in June. Let's go. Hey, baby. You're so sweet. <gasps> I just realized I never unmuted my microphone since I came back from pottying. Oops. Love you so much. You gonna sit here with me for a little bit? You're just sitting in the box, leaning on that PC for a month. Listen, you did it though. Proud of you. <laughs> you got there. Hey, man, little one. I haven't seen you all morning because your dad was rude. Hiding you from me all day. We're getting new iPhone emojis, by the way. Are we? When? When are we getting those? Play with kitten overwork. Always. Yes, clearly. Was that even a question? <laughs> I could have told you that, Lils. You looked through your BTTV settings. Did you fix it? I think the update is out now. Oh, is it? What are we getting? Do you know? Can I just delete Frank or Face Z or do I really need it? Um, you could get rid of it. Ah! I forget exactly all the... I forget the... Well, FFZ is what I have for um, the pronoun extension. To be honest. That's how I have my pronoun extension installed. So if that's how you have yours, or if you have the pronoun extension separate, then... I liked it for making Twitch have pink buttons. Yeah, I prefer a lot of the customization options of FFZ compared to BTTV, but it also has a lot of customization options, so I can see it being overwhelming. But I like all the options of FFZ, so it's really a personal preference, truly. FFZ feels like it can just do more. I love that BCTV will give a sound when highlighted words pop up. Oh, will it? Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of nice. I didn't know it had sound stuff. Well, actually, I think I did. I just never use it because I think FFZ is what's causing the stuff to look like what it looks like now. Well, you should be able to change it. All right, turn it off. Oh, my God. Uh, so, uh, not 87% chaos and spicy and then 64% daddy. Jeez, bestie. Pop off, I guess. 
You're just really high percentages on everything. Shaking face, pink heart, light blue heart. Oh my God, we're finally getting a pink heart. <gasps> Gray heart, donkey, moose, goose, wing, jellyfish, hyacinth, pea pod, ginger. Wow, there's a lot. Goodness, there's a lot. Love that. You said it's out now? Should be. I have to check my phone, see if it has an update. Dang. Got a lot of chaos except for not, except for Dane. <laughs> a lot of chaos, a lot of daddies, a lot of spoys. Okay. Rip Steph. Steph is nothing. Steph is oh, Steph's spicy. JK, but not chaotic. I do feel pretty chill today. We love playing pink hearts. Yeah, I like a play I'm, I'm so happy we're doing a playing pink heart. And the light blue would be really cute. But I'm super happy about the uh, plain pink heart. Because, like, I want to use a pink heart for a lot of things. But I don't want to use the, like, double heart or, like, the, um, like, the pulsing one or whatever. I'm supposed to be the most chaotic in chat? Apparently not. You're the least chaotic in chat. <laughs> <laughs> So R.I.P. It's not your day today. Mm, 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 mm. A little angel pop. I love you so much. I'm gonna put you on the ground soon, okay? I love you. I'll give you a big old snuggle. Big ol' snugglies. It's fine. It's just a, an off chaos day. It'll be chaotic again later or tomorrow. Who knows? It's fine. Do 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 do. Okay. How much do I have? Almost 200. Okay. That's not bad. <laughs> I'm an angel. Yeah. It's your boy. W. The sweet baby. <laughs> He's so cute. You're lucky we have a little ad break coming. I'm going to use that whole entire break to just snuggle you. I just give you all the pets. All the love. I need to get some topaz today, too. Um... Luckily, I should have enough iron. I do want to make some more fencing, though, and that's going to take a lot. Hey, baby. You slipping? Oh, you want to sit? Yeah? Can you sit up? Say hi. <laughs> oh, sleepy. Mwah. Thank you. I love you so much. <laughs> You're such a happy boy. He's the cutest boy. He's very sweet. Yeah. I can see three boys on the camera right now. 
It's just smoking. I love him so much. He's so sweet and cute. He just wants all the love. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Um, we have our ad break besties. So if you need to get up and get water or use the restroom or get food or anything like that, now's a good time to do so. I'm just gonna be sitting here petting the boy, giving him love because he wants uh, so much love right now. But if you need to do, uh, do anything away from your computer, now's a good time. Because you won't be missing a single thing. A oh, boo-boo. Hi, Manza. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. What? <laughs> Only in the back. Yep. He's sitting by the light. <laughs> He's so floofy, the floofiest. The floofiest. Mm. Yeah. You need to be brushed a little. You're <laughs> so sleepy. I'm going to put you down and give you a snack in a second, okay? Yeah. His little face, I cannot, I know. Wow. What, 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 what? I'm trying to support you so you don't have to hold yourself up. There you go. There you go. I got you. Yep. Yeah. You don't have to hold your own little leggies up. I got you. <laughs> Just a floofy baby. He, um, he is a Pomeranian, but he's a throwback Pom. Which is why he is the size that he is. But he is a Pomeranian. How dare you make him hold his own leggies up? I was trying to get him to let me hold his leggies up. And he didn't want me to. He wanted to hold his own leggies up. He was being an independent boy. And I said, stop it. And stop being independent. What? What is that? What are you pawing for? Hmm? See? Look at him. He wants to hold up his own leggies. Best one. You are cute and fluffy like Stitch. See, even Stitch agrees. I see the other two best boys too. Yeah, they're vibing. Everyone's in here. For some reason. Well, I should say, I say for some reason, but it's not like Wolfie and Ollie aren't always in here. Smokey's just in here late because his dad kept you captive all day. Mm -hmm. You came in to say hi like an hour ago and your dad stole you and made you come out of the room. <laughs> He coerced you from the hallway to go back with him. And he stole you. Because he's a meanie. Oh, that was a big, a big shakies. How stream is good. It's good. All right, Mr. Baby. I'll put, you, <laughs> I'll put you on the ground, give you a snack, okay? All right.
Hi, hamster girl. Welcome. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. Don't. Don't bully that cat. <laughs> Watching him. Watching that boy. <laughs> you better be leaving Ollie alone. Much love to you. Um, excuse me. Much love to you, Archer. How dare you? Might catch you in 4K. Hey. There you go. Just because I know if I don't give it to you, you're going to hurt yourself trying to get to it. <laughs> You've returned and made a poster. Let's go, nature. Proud of you, bestie. You're heckin' crushing it. As you should. <clears throat> I have no friendos in my office today. Wow. How dare they? Where are all of them? Ollie, really? Also, also, I just realized um, it was your verbal med reminder like 19 minutes ago, but I accidentally snoozed my alarm. Oops. Um, so if you need to take medication of any sort, now is your time to do that because it is the time. I need to take mine. Actually, If you need meds or just need water refill or anything, anything self-care related, now is a good time to get all that done. Um, you could put it in creative, probably, nature. Creative is always a good spot. <clears throat> Absolutely. All right, let's do, um, let's do one more run of, uh, one more run around of iron. We might do a couple more. We'll see. We're going to make some iron bars and kind of see where that puts us at, because I might need more iron than this. I do want to make some more iron fencing for that area, and I also do want to, um... I also want to um, make lights and stuff, so. And I wanna have extra, so yeah, we're probably gonna do some more iron running. Today might be a really big like resource kind of haul mood um, before I kind of like, and then at the very end, we'll kind of like start figuring out what we wanna do for sunlit. Oh, you know what? I actually need to look into sunlit. What do I need to make the floor? I need to see what the recipe is. I don't know how much material I have to make all the flooring for sunlit. I want to use that, um, that red, uh, whatever it's called. I hit wall, very sleepy, many things to do on list, but, um, now when eyes closing brain, how when eyes closing brain drifting all lils, I'm sorry. Energy drink time or coffee time or something like that. Something caffeinated if you can, maybe. If that's an option for you or, um... I don't know. Clay and soil. Oh, I actually don't know how my clay is. We might have to dig for some clay. My clay might be okay, but I've also been using it pretty much to like make a lot of these bricks. So thank you. It's posted. You're welcome. You're welcome, bestie. I'll take a look in a second. Nope. Mm -mm. I'm here, but I'm going through my FFZ settings. I'm changing a lot of things. I haven't run into the settings that causes the stuff though. Ah, uh, gotcha. You'll find it. You'll find it, you'll find it. I believe. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's really cute. It's, uh... Oh, I really like it. It's really cute and simple. Mm 
Um, <clears throat> the only thing, well, never mind. I was going to say the only thing I might suggest is putting like a price on there, but since you're doing custom ones, it probably is a range. Um, and the price will probably like vary, but maybe you could do like a, like a kind of like a range. Just so people are a little bit more aware and the price is very a lot yeah that's fair you could put like starting at blah 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 or something maybe i don't know yeah maybe not just because they vary so much it's kind of hard to do it without people being stinky about it does that make sense do 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 Fair, fair. Noise. Boom, 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 boom. Um, actually, since I'm right here, I'm gonna see how much clay I have. Because I've been using a lot of it for the fences, so I might not have a lot for that floor. But I also might have made a lot of that floor ahead of time. I don't know. I need to check in here. I do have 300 of it already. Okay, that's actually really good. I did make it ahead of time. That's helpful of me. Okay, yeah, because I'm running kind of low on it. Um... Oh my god. This is like hardly any fencing. Lord have mercy, it's 12. Well, I can make a little bit more than that, but dang. I hate it here. These fences are so much. 15, all of that iron I've done, I can only make 15 more of it, lordy. Yeah. We're probably not going to have a lot of that fencing. That's okay. It'll be like very slow. Slow uh, race for that. It's fine. <clears throat> I still need more iron in general. So we're going to keep going. I should have iron farmed over the weekend. I just didn't even think about it. I wish those heckin' potions worked for iron. But they do no more. That would make life super easy, though. We'll do a couple more rounds. We'll go to like two or something like that. Um, like 30 ish more minutes of doing this and then we'll do some. Uh, I'll try to get into some decorating. It's going to take me a while to decorate anyways, because I need to figure out the color palette and stuff that I want to use for sunlit and all of it, so. I'll just keep vibing and iron farming for now. Because I'm going to need all this resource. I should actually look into other resources that I might need as well, though. Just because, um... I don't know what else I'm going to need. I don't know what fencing I'm going to want to use over there. What kind of fencing would I want to use in sunlight? Maybe just regular picket fencing. Should have a decent amount of softwood again. Or the brick fencing, but brick fencing is also going to be a lot of iron. But less than the other fencing that I'm using, so. Probably brick. <laughs> Which means I need even more iron. Oh, I should actually go to Christoph's stall today too. I didn't go do that yet. Maybe he'll, maybe I'll get lucky and maybe he'll have iron bars. That would be nice. Because I have not looked. 
go do that after I get these last two. <clears throat> Hi, Caroline. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. All right, Buzz. Chop, chop. Thank you. All right, let's go check um, Christoph's stall. Let's see. Nope, doesn't look like it. Oh, he's got heckin' bottles today. He does have softwood, though, so... I will take that, and I will take the clay yes. and pebbles. Uh, and the fabric, right. actually. I'm just gonna buy everything except those vials. I have a ton of those vials. I don't need them. But I will buy the rest. Keep going until we have like a hundred iron again. Just about. I'm gonna try going a little bit faster today. Or this route. I'm just gonna come back for all that stuff. I couldn't find it in there either. Yeah, that I don't know. I don't know, because mine doesn't look like that, and I also have FFC. So I don't know what changed it. That's really odd. I have no idea. Hey, you just have FFZ and BTTV, right? I'm assuming just those two. Yeah, I don't know, that's so odd. I'm not positive then. What a quote. It's iconic, truly. Failing to present in a meeting, but I'll be back. Have fun. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. I hope it goes well. That quote really was random. Listen. It's fine. My digital footprint is cursed. It is, bestie. It is. It's fine. No one knows. Try turning off the highlighting in BTTV and then messing with FFZ? Yeah, maybe. Maybe try that. Just so you're confident, like, which one is doing what. Yeah, I don't know, because mine doesn't look like that, and I have both of them. I mean, mine has, like, that background like that, but it doesn't look exactly like how yours is looking. So. All my accounts are private, though, so future employees can't hate me. Nice. Incredible. Smart. Also, because I can't see the changes if both are doing stuff, that's fair. That's absolutely fair. Did you get it posted? What does it look like? Oh, yeah. You posted it in, uh... Mods. It's normal again. Oh, nice. Poggies. Well, there you go. I changed something, but didn't refresh. Oh, that makes sense. Hi, Monty. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. Oh my god, hello. I'm getting stuck on things. How you doing? I hope you're good. I'm human. I'm not gonna wait for Buzz to drop his stuff. I'm gonna do so fast. You're happy now? Good. I'm glad you fixed it. To where you're more happy with it. Doing all right, thank you. How are you? Did you have a nice weekend? I did, thank you. Yeah. It was very mellow. Very vibey. I didn't do a whole bunch of, like, anything, truly. Just kind of, like, relaxed, which was nice. Relaxed and... Vibed uh, away from PC stuff, mainly. But I'm glad you're doing good. How was your weekend? Was it good? 
Hi, Rose. Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Ugh. Okay. Going so fast, so furious, besties. I'll come back and pick up all the stuff Buzz is leaving on the floor later. We're speed running this course. Cause I'm trying to get the most amount of iron. <laughs> need so much. Great, and you. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Glad you're doing well. I'm doing good. Just doing some iron farming because your girl's trying to heckin' craft soon, and I know I'm gonna need an atrocious amount, so. Here we are. <laughs> trying to get so much iron. It's also giving me gold, too, which is nice, so. And collecting rock is hard. Oh, yeah. Stones. Ugh. It's a nightmare, too. Same kind of thing. You just do, uh... Just for that, you want to do, like, the other three biomes. Basically. But, yeah, it's a... Heckin' journey. I want to make the snowy path fair. The snowy path is really cute. You got this. I believe in you. You'll crush it. Meadow and Plaza are best for stone. Mm-hmm. Meadow Plaza and um, Dazzle Beach is the route that I usually do. Because I do those three biomes. <clears throat> Glad you had a good weekend. Mine was also all right. Just chilled out and watched Supernatural. I'm on season six now. Bestie, didn't you just start that like a couple weeks ago? I'm so proud of you. You're doing incredible. I'm so glad you're liking it, though. I've always thought about getting into that show, but, like, I just okay, can't. Don't take on too much. I just can't. It's just too much. It's too long. Um, I asked that question in Discord the other day, and that's what I was told. Yeah. Yeah, Meadow and Plaza are best, but you might as well loot from Dazzle Beach, too, because by the time, like, there's just not enough mining nodes in Meadow and Plaza that if you finish Meadow and then you finish the Plaza, like, you're just waiting for them to respawn. So you might as well go hit the ones in Dazzle Beach, too. And then by the time you get back up to the Plaza, everything will be respawning just right that second. So you might as well do all of the biomes because you can still get it from Dazzle Beach. <clears throat> Because there's a five minute respawn timer in each mining node, so it doesn't take you usually five minutes to um, loot Plaza and Meadow since there's not a lot. Do y'all see my new color? I do. It's really cute, Steph. Oh gosh, it's really cute. I like it. You match Lunar now. <clears throat> Social, thank you so much for the 42 minds. Uh, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing support for so long. How are you? <gasps> Social, did you see that they're going to do 10 minutes of Tears of the Kingdom gameplay tomorrow? <laughs> did you see? Did you see? I'm so excited. How you doing? How's your day? Thank you so much for the 42 months. It's a big number, a big number, a very large number. I'm torn. I don't know if I want to spoil myself with the gameplay video or not. Oh, that's valid, bestie. That is valid. It's pretty intense, so I understand that. Yeah, it's just super long, you know? It's just a really long series, and that's the only reason. I know I like it, though. I took Twitch Turbo. Oh, you got Turbo? As you should. I've been thinking about buying Turbo, honestly. I have no Amazon Prime stuff. There's another option, and I can choose every hex code now. Fair. I've thought about getting Turbo, just so I don't have ads anywhere. 
but also it supports the streamer like I'm watching ads. Um, during my morning meeting, which is rude. Listen, it's fine, Sewa, because I'm not going to be up to watch the um, Tears of the Kingdom uh, video because it's going to be like 7 a.m. and I'm definitely going to be asleep or busy getting ready for stream anyways. So um, we're going to watch it tomorrow at the beginning of stream instead. So don't worry, you can just watch it with us instead. It's fine. It's even better. It's difficult to not be pink anymore because I wanted to stay the same color as white. But oh, well, it's okay. But that one's really pretty. I like that color a lot. Um, like when I first played Breath of the Wild, I was so out of the video game loop for so long and my brother-in-law was like, yo, wanna play this game? And then the opening cutscene blew my mind. Aw, oh, fair, fair, fair. That's valid. Oh wait, I can't watch it live anyways. I'm booked all day training a new hire. Oh, well, you can watch when you get home if you want. I did have a couple good things at Scrooge today. Yeah, I did, Rose, actually. <clears throat> a couple things. Um, I got like a cute new floor. I got a cute little bear chair. I got a new um, bookcase that I've never seen before. Um, I got this top actually, which I really like. So yeah, it was actually a good Scrooge day. I'd rather watch it with my friends anyways. Yeah, we're gonna have such a good time tomorrow. <gasps> nice, Dane. Congrats, bestie. A lot of repeats today, stinky. Like I may turn off my Discord tomorrow because every server I'm in is going to be blowing up with, uh, yeah, you probably are gonna want to, honestly. Yeah, turn off Discord, ignore Twitter. <laughs> Don't go on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Oh no, I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to get that. Um, I'm so glad that I can avoid the spoilers because I'll be at work and when I get home, I'm watching it immediately. Fair. Fair, fair. Yeah, we're going to watch it tomorrow. It'll be really good. Pua is following me. Yeah, Pua is my companion that I chose for today. Did I tell you that when Cuphead DLC came out, I was downloading it um, in the morning of and already there was a YouTube recommendation of someone beating all the DLC boss fights. Nice, great. Jeez. Already, that's wild. They must have, I wonder if they got like, they must have gotten like a review copy or something. There's no way. It's always wild to me that like people will have full on guides for the entire game, like literally release day. Lord. Like, I just know that Austin John is going to be going wild during Tears of the Kingdom. He's going to be going ham, truly. Like, it's going to be nonstop. Every single day, it's going to be like day one of the game release. And he's like, here's how to beat the first dungeon. You're like, bestie, I haven't even thought about that yet. What? <laughs> Please. Content creators are all in the push for first to publish true... True. Yesterday I was struggling so much. I wanted to be the crocodiles in the glade. It took me a while, but I did it. I'm proud of you. You did it. That's good. They're hard. They can be stinky. Especially if they, um... Especially if they, like, start, like, hiding behind trees and stuff around. And you can't even find them. And I think I'm going to get FOMO for To the Kingdom. I haven't even finished Breath of the Wild. You probably are, yeah. You probably are, but it's fine because you're going to be here and you're going to be playing it. Well, you're going to be watching it and like playing it through me. So it's fine. Maybe that will be enough, you know? Maybe. <clears throat> Hopefully. Well, we'll see. <clears throat> um, if you have you seen the story of Breath of the Wild, because if you have, then there's no reason to put off consuming. She's the king or playing it. 
Um. You may have. Well, I actually don't know. I mean, I don't know if anybody else you've watched have gone through it and you like paid attention to it, but you might have seen it via here, but I don't know if we ever... I was doing such like modded stuff. I don't know if we fully did all the story things. Three takes, I've seen so much. That's fair. That's fair. I guess that's true. You have. I've seen a lot of you, but I don't know how much we actually finished. Yeah, I'm not sure either because... I'm not sure how much of the story I actually did. I think, I mean, I think I did a lot of it, but I think we beat the game and stuff. And I think we watched all the cutscenes. I don't usually skip the cutscenes. I think I let them all play. I need to wait until the week of to buy the online voucher and use that to get it. But I'm also not sure if there's going to be another $60 game less than a year that I would want. Mm. Fair. Actually, what about, um, what about, what about, what about, um, 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 uh, Story of Seasons of Wonderful Life. What about that? That comes out in June. That's probably going to be 60, I'd imagine. I don't see why it wouldn't be. So that could be an option. Um... I don't think of other games that are coming out this year. Actually, never actually wanted to play Story of Seasons or Harvest Moon games. Oh, really? That's kind of interesting to me, actually. Considering, like, the types of games that you usually like. I don't know if it's the graphics, the schedules of people. I don't know. That's odd. Anyone getting to the Kingdom Digital, check your IC storage. It's clocking in over at 18. 18 gigabytes. Dang. To be fair, I put off Stardew for years because of graphics. That's fair. That's fair. 18 gigs. That's wild. I mean, that's not like that big considerably, but like that is big for a Switch game. Got a new SD card at 512 gigs. Sound good for a while. Okay, good, good, good. I actually need to check how big. Um, I'm definitely getting physical, so... Plus probable DLC. Yeah, there's probably going to be DLC in the future. Um, I'm definitely getting physical for Tears of the Kingdom, but I need to... Uh... I need to see how much the memory card in my Switch is. How big it is. I actually don't remember. I feel like it's 128, probably. Now, if I need more, that's going to take years to transfer since you can only have one in at once. Yeah, yeah. I like physical, but I don't want to go out and get it day of, and I don't want to hope to get it delivered on time. That's fair. I'm probably, to be fair, I'm probably going to end up having both. <laughs> so I don't really care. I'm going to be buying it physically and also digitally, because I'm going to buy it digital so I can play it day of. And I'm going to buy it physical, A, so that I can have a physical copy, but also so that my mom can play it. So I'm probably going to end up buying the game twice. But yeah, I'm definitely buying it digital for me to play on day of because I don't want to, again, like you said, I don't want to have to wait for it to come in and I don't want to have to try to go out to the... Though I could try to just pick it up from Target in the morning, like do a pickup order on it and then go get it. Like a curbside pickup, you know? I only have Animal Crossing, the rest I download online. Oh, fair. I don't know how much the memory card is. Should probably check just in case. In the scene of things, it's not that much of an increase, but the wild need of 14. Oh, really? That's actually not. That's. I kind of expected it to increase more. Four extra gigs. Do a react video right there at the Target parking lot. Perfect. Okay. You do stream late enough that it shouldn't be an issue. What shouldn't? Oh, like going to Target to pick it up for curbside? Yeah, it shouldn't be because I think they open at like eight. I just have to make sure that I get up like earlier that day um so that i'm like ready and then can also still go to target and do the pickup and then you know it should be target opens early it'd only be an issue with gamestop because gamestop doesn't open till like 10 but target pickup should be fine because i think they open at eight i just tried to pick up on violent and they said that it would be pulled wouldn't be pulled and running till the next day so i would double check i mean worst case scenario i guess i could like go inside and get it i guess 
Target. I wish we had this store in Europe. Oh, y'all don't. Stinky. Like, either way, I'll be coming home with that day, that game that day. And if I have to stream a little bit later, um, like 10 minutes later, I will do that. And I'll just, like, stream. Because I'm probably going to overstream that day anyways. You know what I mean? Like, I'm probably going to stream way past 4.30 that day. There's no shot that I'm not going to. I'm going to get so wrapped up in that game and obsessed with it that I'm probably going to have a really, really long stream. Um, especially since it's going to be a Friday uh -huh. and I won't be able to play it for like the next two days. So I'm probably going to, it's probably going to be a long day. I'd imagine. What day is it? May 12th. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. I remember I pre-ordered Animal Crossing and it was released when the UK um, went into lockdown. The first day it was delivered by post, but they couldn't find the flat. Delivered it to the shop underneath the... Which was closed because of lockdown. Had to message the owner and say a very important parcel had been delivered to her. And then I needed it today. Oh my god, that's funny. It is very important. You're right. It was very important. Heckin' stinky. That's so far away and almost her birthday. Yeah, it is far away, I know. It's a yeah. Friday, right? Yeah, it is. It is. It is, it is. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Uh, what game are you talking about coming out in May? Uh, Tears of the Kingdom, which is the sequel to Breath of the Wild. That's what we're talking about. Which, Breath of the Wild is one of my all-time favorite games, so... I'm super stoked. <clears throat> tips for small streamers playing the valley? Um, I don't know if I would have tips specifically for streamers. I don't know. Just have fun and play your game. I don't know that I would have specific tips for that. Well, welcome in. I hope you're doing good. I don't know. That specifically? Hmm. Um, I've been waiting for it for so long. I was so excited. I absolutely got it. The idea of not being able to play it on release day. So I had to pull out the very important package. Listen, as you should, there's no way you can't play a game like that. Like, you have to play that game on release day for sure. It's such a bad feeling when, like, you're waiting for a game for months and months and months and months and months, and, months, and then you can't play it the day that it comes out. Like, if that's something, obviously, um, that you were planning on doing. Like, you know what I mean? Obviously, everyone has different financial situations, but, like, if you ordered it in um, hopes to play it on release day, like, you better be playing it on release day. All of this Animal Crossing talk is making me want to restart my island. Do it. Have fun. It'd be, um... Good luck, good luck. Do it. Restart. <laughs> this be my third island, Ants. I'm seriously considering renting cabin for the week of the release. You should. Why a cabin, though? Just so no one talks to you? <laughs> Secluded. My ex pre-ordered it as my birthday present, so I've been waiting since December. Oh god, that's so long. Download a switch, drive out, touch grass during the day, and zone out um on Tears of Kingdom at night. Fair. Sounds like a great time, truly. What game are you talking about? Tears of the Kingdom. Um, it's the sequel to Breath of the Wild, which is a Zelda game. I have all my koala babies though. Mm, so basically what you're saying is you just need to buy another switch. Oh, I beat it. Did I skip a biome? No, I'm just really speedy. Forget touching grass, just play 24 seven. Perfect. Incredible. Let me do that then, yes. Okay, good. Make sure the cabin has a porch and just play it from there. Ooh. That does sound very cozy. Playing some games on the porch. I pre-ordered Tears today. It comes out shortly after my birthday. Let's go! Ooh, shortly after your birthday. Okay, okay. I see you almost birthday twin. I'll get the boy a switch and play Animal Crossing on it because I don't think he won't play it, I don't think. That's literally exactly what I did, Lexa. That's so funny. I definitely have a second island on the switch that Anthony uses. <laughs> so I was like, the console gets used, but then I also know you're never gonna play Animal Crossing. So like, thank you, yoink. 
but then you get a switch so you can play Smash Brothers or whatever the heck you want to play. The music, don't you like it? Isn't it so vibey? And the heck in Disney lo-fi is just incredible. So big brained, we're so smart. So smart and beautiful and talented and incredible. <laughs> Icons. I used to borrow my sister's switch and play on her um, island whenever I got bored and I ran out of stuff to do on mine. Fair, fair, fair. Mm -mm. Yeah, you can kind of run out of stuff to do on Animal Crossing pretty easily. Once you finish decorating and stuff, this is kind of the same for like Disney, you know, once you're done with your valley, like decorating and doing all the quests and stuff, you're like, uh, well, what now? You're like, I still want to play, but like, what do I do? <laughs> you know, she got mad at me a lot. Why? Not pulsing. What? Pulsing. Oh, biggest brains pulsating out there with great ideas. I see. Why did you put pulsing? Why pulsating? I hate that. You could have just said throbbing, God. <laughs> Pulsing, throbbing, all the same. Mm, perfect. Unless my sister switch gets lost in the move, Lexa, please, uh, bestie. Not the getting lost in the move. I hate it here. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome. Sorry, throbbing would have been better. Throbbing with great ideas. Thank you. Thanks. It was her switch, and even though she mainly played it, she still hated me using it. Love, love siblings. Siblings are so they're they're interesting. Sibling dynamics are always so interesting to me. <laughs> I'm not using it, but you can't use it. <laughs> Come on, Buzz. Okay, you're just gonna vibe down there, I guess. Live your best life. I beat him again. To be fair, I did buy it for her. Get it back, please. <laughs> Was a gift, how dare you? At least for me, if I did that, it's because it stems from my sister taking my things and losing it, valid. See, if there's a valid reason, then yeah, obviously. I don't mind, but. No, I was just about to play it. Yeah, it's always that. I was just gonna use it. No, you weren't. You just don't want me to use it. She doesn't take care of it or play it. So see, she won't even know. I heard throbbing, I'm here now. Magsy, please. Uh. <laughs> please. She doesn't play it at all or once in a blue moon. She plays it for 30 minutes. So see, she won't miss it. It's yours, just take it. It's fine. Like, wow, you must have misplaced it somewhere. <laughs> We both got music boxes one year and years later, I realized she switched ours and by then she forgot she did it. So we fought. Oh my gosh. Uh, I hate that for you. I haven't seen the mining spots pop up. Yeah. If you beat the respawn timer, you can see them pop in. <laughs> and we're going real speedy with it right now. Your girl honed in on this iron route and I'm going speedy. Cause I'm just trying to get the most amount of iron. Wolfie's being cooked out. <laughs> Wolfie's being kicked out of my room. <laughs> Are you collecting to build something specific? Yeah, I need to make more. Um, I want to make more of the like um, iron fencing and I want to make more of the brick fencing. And I need to make some more light posts and stuff and all of that uses iron. So I'm just trying to get like a lot of iron bars at the moment. Because the fencing that I want to use, one of them uses three iron bars per one singular post of fence, and one of them uses two per post of fence, and the lights use like two per post, and I'm just, ugh, it's so much. I need so much iron. So, yeah. A lot of things, truly. Hi, Hina. I see you again. So we're going to do like two more runs, and then we're going to... And we should get into the building. 
we'll go until the ad break comes up because it's coming up in like 14 minutes so we'll do 14 more minutes of uh iron runs and then we'll do uh decorating <clears throat> hi marshmallows how are you welcome in i hope you're doing good hello lore once stole my brother's ds wait and took it to school to show my friends and then the fire alarm went off we all had to wait outside in the playground and i was panicking thinking this is it is this because i stole the ds this is my punishment stop it the ds in school were fine that's so funny you. that's so funny we love the world just giving you a panic attack for no reason thanks bestie appreciate that so much lordy why isn't Kristoff sell fences I don't know i wish they would rebalance i don't know if anyone's complained about the fence recipes because like my lord have mercy they are so expensive please tell me why it's five softwood for one singular piece of fencing post when five softwood also makes a full bench like excuse me i feel like it should be a one-to-one -one, okay or even like a two-to-one maybe maybe two-to-one would be fine but like five to one is ridiculous it's atrocious don't even get me started on the iron bars. Three iron bars per one. Does it craft five at once? No, it crafts one fence. Five softwood makes one post of fence. Three iron bars and like two bricks make one post of fence. Three iron bars is 15 iron ore for a singular post of fence. Like, I'm sorry, who made these ratios? Because they're atrocious. Hi, Krabby. How are you? How you doing? I'm lurking for a second just to say I literally refuse to put fencing because it's such a waste of material. Yeah, right, Casey? Ugh, it's a constant struggle because, like, I want to put fencing because they're so cute. But, yeah, it literally is a waste of materials. And the only reason I'm doing it is because, like, I'm farther in the game, so I don't need those materials for quests and stuff. But, my gosh. Uh, my goodness. I do not want to spend two hours grinding for three friends fence post it's just so sad yeah truly i hope they rebalance it i don't know if anyone's even like complained about that though in their discord server i don't know if anyone's like specifically called out the fencing recipes i'm not sure because they're really bad doesn't look like there's a mod to change the ratio but there's a mod to change how much loot you gain when you do pick up wood that's kind of cool there's also a mod that gets rid of the item limit mm. And it's been very tempting. <laughs> I haven't done it. I haven't downloaded mods for this game, obviously, but there is one that gets under the item limit, just so you're aware. <clears throat> I just want them to fix the ratios on their end, though. You know? I'm okay. I'm tired today. It's one of those sleepy Monday kind of vibes. I get you. But you got this. You're doing amazing. Incredible and wonderful. Hopefully your day is, uh, your, uh, like, what am I trying to say? Your responsibilities type of moment of the day is hopefully almost over <laughs> you can just vibe and do whatever the heck you want there's also some kind of a hack for screw to shop are you talking about the one where you like are you talking about the one where you gift him things or are you talking about the one where you like try to reset his shop because neither of those have worked for me unfortunately I feel that from the moment I opened my eyes this morning I was just like nope no thanks not today yeah it's really been a Monday type of Monday huh for whatever reason 
What are the Moonies rewards? Are they emojis? Um, the Moonies are, um, they're channel points. So you get them every uh, X amount of time just for being here. Um, and you can use them to, um, you can use them to turn in for like a pronoun check or a hydrate reminder or a, um, I love you sound effect with some little hearts that pop up on screen or, um, various different things in there. So you just get them for being like in the stream, whether you're chatting or whether you're lurking, you still get them. And they all do something different depending on which one you click on. There's also some like sound alert ones when you start to get more of them. Mm -mm. Um, there are one, there is one reward in there where you can like temporary unlock, temporarily unlock one of the sub emotes for a day with Moonies. I didn't know there were mods for this. Yeah, yeah, there are, there are mods for this. People are wild and are on it. It's on Nexus mods, just like a uh, Stardew mods are. This game worth buying. I've been debating it for a couple of days now. Um, I really, really like it. I definitely do not regret buying it. Um, but I guess my question to you would be, what is um, like your, what are you usually interested in game wise? So they allow that. I actually do not know. I don't know their stance on mods, so take that with a grain of salt. I, not sure. I'm not familiar enough with like Gameloft as a company, so I don't know what their view on that kind of stuff is. Or if they frown upon it like Nintendo does. I'm also dealing with trying to cut back on my caffeine intake, so this week and the next few weeks are gonna suck. Oh, bestie, I wish you the best of luck. You got this. Um, but yeah, I would guess I would ask uh Muggles like what your general interest is for games. Um, just because if you like games in the genres of like Stardew or Animal Crossing or Sims and stuff like that, um, you probably would like this, especially if you also like Disney stuff. It is a really fun game, but, um, it also has to be like in your realm of something that captures your interest. If you've already been thinking about it, I feel like you probably would like it. I assume no, mod, no to mods because it's an online game that has in-game purchases. Probably, probably. They probably do frown upon it because of that. You're right. I like Animal Crossing, so I'm assuming that should be similar. I haven't watched much on it until I find your stream. If you like Animal Crossing, then yeah, you'll probably like it. It's obviously not exactly the same, but it has the design aspects. It has a lot more questing than Animal Crossing. Um, it has a lot more questing. Animal Crossing doesn't really have quests. It has a few, like, couple missions that you do, but... This has a lot of questing in it. Um, you have like the characters that you interact with, like villagers. So if you like Animal Crossing, you probably will enjoy the vibes of this. Especially if you also like Disney. Is anyone doing Sunhaven? I haven't played it yet. I got a code for Sunhaven. I do want to play it. I know um, Nala has played Sunhaven and liked it a lot. And other people in here probably have as well. Um, but I need to try it. I need to actually try it. Hello. Thank you so much. Of course. Yeah. Glad to help. Oh my God. If you have any questions um, regarding the game in general or anything, let me know. I'm more than happy to answer. Just a generalized question on like if it has a certain feature or or anything. It's on my list to play. It's definitely fun. I need to play the new updates, but I love the plot and the magic. I need to try it. Um, the, again, my only like speculation for that game is like the character design is not my favorite. Like the character um, graphic style is not my favorite, but um, everything else like graphically is really, really beautiful and pretty. It's just specifically like the character that I'm not a huge fan of, but I might be able to get past that, especially if the game is like really... The story and everything is really amazing and just play style wise it's really good and they gave me a code so i'm gonna play the heck out of it i just have to decide when it's definitely on my list as well i just haven't decided when i'm actually gonna sit down and do it 
I haven't played it, played it forever ago, but I know there's a new update, so I re-downloaded it to play. Ooh, there you go. There you go. Nice. Yeah, I know they have a lot of updates on it that people like. I heard good things about it. Um, like Genshin does, but I doubt they can allow only certain mods to better span them all. So yeah, that's fair. So people don't cheat. Yeah. I'd assume they don't like it. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Suniva is good. Art is a little off for me, but it's really fun. Suddenly, an ex-friend kind of ruined it for me now. Oh, I associate with him. Oh, that's stinky. I'm sorry. I hate that. I hate when that happens. <gasps> Hello? Ba -ba -da -ba. <gasps> Colorfully minded. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate you so much. I hope you had a wonderful stream. Thank you so much for sending your friendos over here. Welcome, welcome. We are currently just doing some iron grind because your girl needs so much iron for crafting. <laughs> so we're doing some iron routes that we're going to be wrapping up somewhat soon here. But I hope you had an amazing stream. Rogue Legacy. I don't actually think I know what that is, but I hope you had a good time. I really want this. Oh, there we go. I got it. I got it. I got it. I have a lot of Steam Early Access games that I played and then forgot about. And then years later, I'll get an alert that says out of early access. I need to figure out if I want to play it again. Oh, fair, fair, fair. Oh, yeah, because Sunhaven, is it officially out of early access? Because I know I saw that the release date on Steam changed to like March 10th or something like that. It was good. Went for a challenging achievement, but no dice. Oh, no. You got it next time. I believe in you. I'm glad you had a good stream, though, regardless. I accidentally fall asleep in my chair. Aw, oh, Lils. Listen, it sounds like you needed it. Hi, Haley. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> if you have issue with Discord or anything, let me know. Because the verification bot is being stinky recently. That's okay. I did something small until the polls came in for what people want me to play next. Fair. <laughs> <laughs> fair fair that's that makes sense i get ya but i'm glad you had a good stream though sounds like it was a good time that's what matters is that you got a vibe with everybody all right we got ads coming up in a second so we're gonna do this last probably this last run of iron and then we'll do ads and then we'll go craft some stuff and then um actually like decorate can I please have that? Can I please have that? Can I please have that? I hate here. <laughs> I hate here. Whatever. I don't want it. Um, I'm being productive. So goodbye for a bit to go work out. Hope I don't die, GK. <laughs> good luck. Good luck. You got this, Nala. I believe in you. You're going to do amazing. I requested access. I don't know if it worked or not. Um, oh, the verification thing. I think so. I'm not sure. Sometimes the verification thingy is not working. Um, but yeah, did you go to the channel and then click the, um, click the, um, little verify button? Did it give you an error or anything like that? Because it's been a little stinky recently. Oh, it did now? Oh, okay. Pog. Nice. Good. I'm glad it worked. <laughs> I just want to make sure because it's been so stinky recently and, like, has been giving people an error message when they try to verify. So I just want to make sure that no one's having that issue again. Um, JK, as in I know I won't die. Not that I hope I do. No, no, no. I get what you mean. I get what you mean. It. <laughs> You're sweet. You got this, I believe. About 20 minutes left of work. Let's go. See, I told you it would go by quickly, bestie. You're doing incredible. Absolutely wonderful. Look good. I'm glad you got it. If you need help navigating anything, let me know. Um, we have the ad break coming, so I'm just gonna finish as much of this as I can. Um, but yeah, if y'all need to get up and stretch your legs or get food or water, or you still haven't taken meds and you need to, um, now is a good time to do that because we're gonna have a little bit of an ad break here. We do an ad break every hour um, where we all kind of like step away and stretch and uh, 
get away from the computer for a second, do anything that we need to do, and then we don't have any more ads for an hour. So it gets us through it and also forces us to stretch our backs or leggies or refill water bottles, anything that we might need to do. Because if you're anything like me, I definitely neglect to do that when I'm sitting and playing games. I'll just sit here for 12 hours and play and I just won't even think about doing any of that self-care stuff. So forces me to actually think about it. Oh, you got the game. Let's go. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you have the best time. It's really, really fun. I'm just going to finish the mining nodes and frosted heights and then I'm going to get them. So you don't miss anything other than just me hitting these like last four spots. That's it. These areas don't give me any iron anyway, so. This one and then the other one. And I'm gonna get. Okay. Oh, Kerr besties. Um, I will be right back. Stretch your leggies, do the things. I'm going to use the restroom and I will be back and we'll do some crafting. Bear me. Okay. We're good. Um, yeah, if you have any questions about Discord Halo, just let me know. Let me know, bestie. Um, we got you. But yeah, like Steph said, um, you can check the, uh, the Help I'm New section and look through everything in there um, for anything that you might be looking for, possibly. How do I get floof? I think it might be the opposite, like give the username and then the amount. Possibly. 
possibly. <clears throat> yeah, there you go. That was it. You're welcome. Okay. You want one more piece of snack? Okay. There you go. Also, I saw your picture, Duncan. That's terrifying. I hate that. I hate that about what happened to your game. <laughs> that your floor is just gone. Okay. Actually, I'm not going to mine here. Wait it here. I'm going to do one more run in Glade of Trust, and that's it. That's all I'm going to do. The only reason I'm going to do Glade of Trust is because it has a really high iron drop, so... I'm just going to do one more run through of here, but then we're done with iron. I'm just not going to waste my time doing sunlit because it's only going to give me gold, but I'll try to get a little bit more iron from here at least. I can probably leave with like 20 more. Watching my characters just go about um, life above me. Yeah, it's a, that's a heckin' trip. A heckin' trip. Wild. Did a restart fix it? I'm assuming is that what you had to do is restart. And you just randomly like fall through or were you doing something specific? Restart worked? Gotcha. That's fair. I'm like really sad about this piece of iron right here. I also cannot be bothered to try to move the second arch. The second emote. Why did you... <laughs> Why are you this way? Please. What even is that? I'm upset about him. Accept our love. Oh, it's Mika's face. Aha. Uh -huh. Gotcha. Iconic. I finished Buzz's quest with the group photo. It shot me into outer space. Please. Oh, I see. Heckin' group photos. Hate when that happens after me. Hate when that happens. Take a group photo with someone, you just can launch into outer space. <laughs> but like underground outer space, you know? <laughs> Buzz? Wait, what? Oh, there he is. Bestie, what happened to you? How did you get so lost? Lordy. Okay, let's go to my crafting bench. Oh, and let's move my wells all back because everything is all out of place right now. And I hate where they are. And I don't really want to be teleported here. So let's move all my wells back. Let's craft some things that I can craft. And then we're going to start decorating in sunlit um, after I do make some um, light posts and we put them down up in Frosted Heights. I know you can't see any of that pathing, but that actually works out really well. I don't want you to be able to see it. I just want it there so that things don't spawn. <laughs> When I try to move my well back, because that would be very annoying. Imagine I try to move my spot, my well back, and there's just like a heckin' herb there, and then I have to go pick it up, and bleh, it's fine. I'd rather something not be able to spawn when I'm just moving them temporarily. Um, stuck on making the arch on Buzz's last quest. Yeah, it's a lot. You got this. I, I believe in you. Have any of our besties played RE4? And if so, do they think, uh, do they think it'll be too spoopy? Oh, I don't know. That's a good question. That is a good question. I have not played it. Definitely on the weird side. What does that mean? You played it. You love it so far. What is your... Do you have a rating as far as like creepiness factor? Because I know that people say, like, I'm not a huge RE fan. I've never played them before. But I know that people say, like, 7 and 8 are, like, the creepiest and the scariest. Big into horror, but I'm scared to be too much for me. I definitely couldn't do Dead Space, so it's way too much. Ah. Yeah, I wonder. How's the stream going? It's going good, Arturo. How are you? It's going good. It's going good. Thank you for asking. 
it's not scary per se, but kind of like Stranger Things where it's weird, but it's not like Stranger Things in concept or what is happening, of course. Interesting. Not me having no idea what Ari was. Oh yeah, Resident Evil. Well, all Resident Evils are creepy, but I'd say maybe five on creepy level. It's not too bad. Okay. Okay. And what would you put on, as far as that, what would you put like seven and eight on? Because I know that those are notorious. Like, would you put them like at nine? Like RE Village, yeah. PT, still the scariest game for me. PT, what's PT? Why can't I think of it? Did you play the quarry? And what would you rate that compared to? Ooh, that's a good question. If you did play the quarry. I figured it out after hearing you'll talk about it more. That makes sense. What is PT? Oh, okay. Well, it might be different now though, like, because they like breathe, they brought it out. So yeah, like they remade it. So I don't know if that's going to be entirely valid because it's probably going to be creepier uh, in the remake since the graphics and everything are super updated and defined. Um, it was going to be a, a Silent Hill game in the PS4 era, but it got canceled. Oh, got it. Physical therapy. Lils, please. I played the quarry. That wasn't bad either, but I love scary stuff. I would say that game was probably four to five. There was only a couple of jump scares. Okay, so you're giving quarry four to five and you're giving Resident Evil five. Okay, so maybe it'd be fine then, bestie. Maybe it'd be fine. I mean, you might be able to do it, Alexa. Maybe. If they're giving quarry four to five... The game seemed to be a bit much, so it seems doable. Fair, fair, fair. I will see. Lil's what? Why are you humming? Huh, interesting. I actually am curious too, so I'm glad you asked that, Lexa, because I have been thinking about maybe playing it. I also really wanted to play Resident Evil Village, but that's because Dommy Mommy, all right? <laughs> it's because Dommy Mommy, but I know Resident Evil Village is like very scary, very creepy very awful like i don't think you know like i don't think i should play re village like it's very much on the higher end of horror um so at the same time i'm really a fan of horror so i might be lowering it a bit fair enough resident evil village isn't scary at all is it not okay because i've been looking at like i've been thinking about maybe trying it but people keep telling me the opposite i don't know I'm a big horror person, but Tix also did play the quarry and enjoyed it. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I did like the quarry. Goodbye, weirdo. Mm -hmm. I loved watching people play Resident Evil Village. I feel like if the game just has enough story, I feel like I could do it. You know what I mean? Um, bye, Light. Drive safe. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for hanging out. All right, we have a lot of iron bars now. We have a lot of iron bars. Since you reminded me of that command, I'm gonna use it unless you delete it, which is fine. <laughs> Until you forget about it again tomorrow. Have you played Hellblade before? No, mm -mm. I have not played Hellblade. Okay, let's make 20 fences. That will leave me with 37 iron to make lights and stuff. I think that's enough. Actually, maybe not. I'm going to make the lights first. Cassidy, hi. Welcome in. Hello, hello. I hope you're doing good. Resident Evil Village wasn't scary for me because there wasn't um, creepy things. It's just about an old lady named Miranda. Valid. Valid, fair. Yeah, I don't know. I'll have to try it. Um, Let's make... Oh, yeah. See, I need to not spend it. Oh, my God. They take five each one. <gasps> Do others take less? Oh, my God. These take three. Oh, shoot. Maybe I shouldn't use those. Maybe I shouldn't use the fancier ones. That's wild. Oh, my God.
Yeah, besties, I think we're switching to these lampposts because that's atrocious. I can make six of these for 30 iron, which is 10 of these instead. And I need more than like six more lights. It's the whole biome. So I think we're going to do these ones. Because 10 more of these would be 50. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's so much. Hi, Starbrew. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. How are you? Happy Monday. I hope you're doing amazing. Man, I really want to use these, though. Oh, I'm torn. Uh, I mean, like, technically, I could make nine of them. That's just a lot of iron. But technically, I have it. Let's make seven. Ugh, ow. Okay. I do like these lights better. Ugh, it hurts, though. Oh, my God. It hurts. It hurts. It's painful. Uh, finally off work and running to my car. Let's go, Nia. Love that for you, bestie. Vibe. <laughs> Proud of you. Run away from work. Okay. Put two like that. I gotta be careful. Will you be live in three hours? That's for my sub ends and Silly Prime has to wait for a sub to completely end before you can use it. Three hours? I don't know about three hours. <laughs> three hours might be a little long. I don't know about three more whole hours. Definitely like two. Can you uh, just tell it to increase to uh, be ready in two? I think I might leave the yellow lights over here. I don't know though. I'm going to have to put down more lights around here first and like see and play it by ear. You know what I mean? It's only 530. <laughs> well, Liliana, please. Not only 530, bestie. I hate to hear. But that's true. <laughs> do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Hi, CT. How are you? Welcome in. Um, I'll just hope that they're rounding and it's only two hours and one minute left. Let's hope so. That'd be great. That'd be actually iconic, truly, of them. I want to put a light here, but it doesn't, like, fit right. Maybe I'll just put it there. Okay. Now I'll keep the ones over by the sauna <laughs> yellow. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about my lights mismatching. Honestly, the mismatching lights could be a vibe, maybe. Like, what if I mismatch them on purpose? Is it a vibe? I don't know. Let me put one down. Because I have all of these. So, like, aww. what if it's cute? I really don't know where I'd put another one, though. <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it. um, Maybe, like, over here. I have mismatching ones, my Glade, purple, and green. Yeah, that seems like it'd be pretty. Uh, see? I'm wondering if it'd be pretty for extra lights. Hmm. The yellow could be, like, a cute accent into the blue. And I have them anyways. So. Fudge it, you know? 
Let's see. They are a vibe. I think it might be. Caesar salad in a dream. Oh, no, I'm going to want a Caesar salad. Stop it. <gasps> I love the blue so much, though. Oh, but yeah, the yellow is kind of cute. So. I do like the random yellow ones because they kind of give the illusion of like, um, like they give like they're giving star vibes, you know? It's giving like star in the sky kind of vibes. They're kind of cute. I like them. It gives me more light to this area as well. That doesn't really have a ton. I think I do want to do this though. I think I'm going to move some around now that I can like see them. It's giving pixie hollow lamps. Ooh, love that. Love that truly. This seems so smooth compared to Switch. I want to like it, but I just can't make myself play anymore. Yeah, it's so much better on PC which is super unfortunate. Oh, that light's not gonna fit there. Okay, so what if I do this one? I want the Pixie Hollow game back. I would love that. That would be iconic, truly. Yeah, I think I'm gonna like purposefully mis mismatch them. like on each side i have to go to bed had bad sleep last night so i got some catching up to do good night steph i hope you get some good rest thank you for being here i appreciate you so much i might move this light i have the switch oled and so far the game is really smooth on it oh is it okay good good i'm glad because yeah some people have issues on the switch but um not everybody and um it's really like a case-by-case -case basis, you know? So I'm glad you're not having issues on it. OLED makes sense though, yeah. I want the Pixie Hollow game back and build a Bearville. Build a Bearville? What is build a Bearville? Bye, love y'all. Bye, Steph. We love you too. Also, Lils, I am in get you. You're going to make me want a Caesar salad. <sighs> Playing RE4 Remake. Nice. Uh, nice CT. I'm glad you're having a good time. That sounds absolutely wonderful, bestie. Okay. Uh, did you know on console you can apparently play this with multiple profiles? But it would be a new valley for each one, so I could totally start over. <gasps> Don't tell me that, looks Tato. Don't tell me that. So you're telling me that I can play a new village whenever I want to without having to lose mine? I'm having one right now. I'm sorry. How dare you? How dare you, bestie? It sounds delicious. Bilderbergville was an online area for Bilderberg Workshop for any first time. Any bear you bought IRL would give you a code so they could be added to the game. You could follow you around. Wait, that's so cute. That's so cute. Wait, what? Uh, Lux Tato, I think you just blew everybody's minds with the Switch profiles because I assumed that, like, I don't know. I just, I guess Animal Crossing has scarred me and I didn't figure, like, each profile would have their own, but it makes sense because you can't have more than one villager in a thing, so. You also got a room for them in your house and could decorate. That is so cute. That's adorable and precious. Excuse me, how dare. Yeah, it kind of is giving, like, Webkin's vibes, huh? But Build-A-Bear, love. Uh, love, love, love. I miss it so much. That sounds adorable. I went and they said it um, on their Discord. Ooh, cool. You want Club Penguin back? Club Penguin has a uh, unofficial server, doesn't it? That you can technically play Club, Club Penguin right now. It's just not the official server. I'm pretty sure you can play Club Penguin. You can play Toontown. And I do. I had a webkins then forgot my username and password so i didn't play for long oh no that's rough i'm so sorry what about moshi monsters that sounds vaguely familiar but i'm not super familiar with it i'd have to look it up i probably could look it up and see don't tell me that sorry bestie 
I have no time? Well, that sucks. Fine time. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Mochi <laughs> Monsters Club Penguin and Bear Bowl. Fairville were my life. Interesting. I feel like I know Moshi Monsters, but... If you purchase Dreamlight Valley on a console, Nintendo Switch, Xbox, PlayStation, and other accounts on that console will be able to play the game with their own save file. That said, only the primary account will be able to claim the benefits provided by the Founders Pack. Got it. That makes... You know what? I should have put that together because, like, my mom played... Um, my mom... I put my Switch profile onto my mom's Switch, and she played Disney Dreamlight Valley on her Switch. And I should have thought about that. Like, she literally did that played and she started her own save file and obviously like mine's fine so i don't know why i didn't put that together like mentally that that's exactly what she did and what happened i'm a heckin goober is what it is okay I'm moving scar's house because there's so much stuff back here and i just never get to pick it up They would still be my life if they hadn't been murdered. Murdered! Bestie, dang, not murdered. Okay, all right. Don't talk about murder when we're by Scar's house. It's a sensitive subject for him, all right? Gosh. <laughs> you mean the murderer? Yeah, it's a sensitive subject for him, uh. Gosh, uh, he's reformed. Exactly. <laughs> I think we should do it because he deserves to be scarred. Wow. I'm just saying that because his name is Scar. Rude. I love the Tixie. Well, I love you more. Are y'all just saying that because you're into the cartoon line? into the cart no the only cartoon line i'm into is kovu okay get it right excuse me god <laughs> if there's any that exists it's kovu and not scar excuse you lexa the audacity everyone knows it's kovu <sighs> imagine <laughs> Oh, don't get me started on Twisted Wonderlands. I'm still so sad about that game. I tried to get into it. I just could not. I could not. Like, I tried so bad. I saved a little bunny, baby bunny, and I'm going to cry. Wait, what happened? Give us the details. Give us all the details, bestie. About the baby bunny. I need to know. I need to know. Her. Tell me, baby girl, because I need to know. All right, let's figure this out, shall we? How are we going to do the pathing? He's very pretty, I'm upset. <laughs> let's see. You know Scar's OG name before he named himself Scar literally translates to trash? He was probably, probably was a murderer by design. His parents wanted it for him. Wait, his parents wanted it for him. Wait, really? Wait, actually, that's kind of funny. Not his parents putting him on blast. This is definitely not going to be enough flooring. Which is fine. Man, I overestimated how much flooring I'm actually going to need for like a biome. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. Oops. I used like literally half of the floor just to make this. I had 300 pieces of flooring and I'm probably going to use 150 just to make this one little like main section. That is atrocious. I'm going to use more than that, actually. 
please. Um, I went outside with some towels and hopped down. Wait, I was switching the laundry and happened to look up and see something in my window. It was a baby bunny. He let me get all up close to him and followed my finger through my window. We have um, Icarus windows down here and there was no way he could climb out himself. So I went outside with some towels and hopped down in the hole and scooped him up. The bunny nest was like two feet away from where he fell down. So I watched him hop on home. He was scared baby, but he didn't try to bite me or anything. Oh, an angel. A little angel. Thank you for saving such a cute little baby. What are you doing? Why are you barking? You never bark. What are you doing? What's going on? Pup is also confused. What's happening? Excuse me? Be my friend so I can talk about it with someone and I'll set up any card I can for support for you. Oh, Dana. I tried to get into that game. I just couldn't. I don't know why. I wanted to like it a lot. Gosh, I need so much more of this flooring. Lord have mercy. That's all I've done. I don't even know if that's how I want it, to be honest. I might want it to curve more like this. I don't know. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Fake friend. Can't even believe twisted. I just, it didn't grasp me. I don't know why. There's something that I'm just like not vibing with about this pathway. I think it's like the sharpness. It's really boring. I just like the art and story. Yeah, it's it's not. It wasn't a. Uh, it was that. <gasps> you posted a photo. <gasps> what a little baby. Oh, what poor little angel. You're so tiny. Is this already cute? Thank you. I think it's too straight. That's what gets me. I think that's what it is too. But I don't know how to make it like too much more rounds. Make it gayer, please. <laughs> Stop it. I think it's like this part specifically. Let's cut it like this. Really glad I turned uh, that away that way and noticed I'm sitting in the window. I'm not sure. The last junk just seems too straight. Yeah, I don't know how to like. I don't know if I should like. You know. Maybe. Colony comes with a pet cat. Bad news. It's a black cat. <gasps> um. Well, we need it. So. It's also female. Well, then it has to be Mira. How's that bad news? Because it doesn't match either of my cats. I think it's also not spent. <laughs> not anything wrong with black cats. I think it just meant that like it doesn't, it's not Mira or Ollie. It doesn't look like them. Um, I think that's it. Oh, I was like, no, 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 no black cat shame. No, no. I think Xenox just meant for like, um, it doesn't look like either of my kitties for the uh, community colony. We were about to fight. No, no, no black cat slander. Xenox loves all kitties. <laughs> Xenox loves all kitties. It's just because it doesn't look like my kitty since it's a community thing. You know, that's all. Bye. <laughs> I hope you're doing good, Ezekiel. Welcome in. Yeah, Smokey is, I don't know. Besties, I don't know how to make this. Curvy enough. Oh my God, please. Gonna, please. There we go. Should I start with like an outline and then we'll have to like. Oh, 
Obviously, we're going to mess with it a lot. Because <laughs> the design is not quite there. Colin's supposed to start Tixie, Lily, Steph, uh, Tiffany, Dragonlight. Let's go. Let's go. We're going to crush it. What am I? What did you make me? Oops. Oh my god. This is so much pathing. And also, it looks awful, but it's fine. I'm gonna, like, fix the curviness to it. Like, this is just a very rough idea, but, like, this is very... <laughs> this looks awful. You know, it's fine. We're gonna fix it. We're gonna fix it. It's really rough right now. This is the rough draft. The shape is not perfect. Uh, Um, check miscellaneous games in Discord. Okay. I will. This area needs like a lot of. TLC. See, now I hate this part. Oh my God. Uh, adventuring child, adult. I'm a warship captain. Traits pretty and bisexual, <laughs> physically sensitive. <laughs> that sounds like me. That sounds like me. Thank you. Um, good at planting, good at animals, as I should be. As I should be. Nice. Love that for me. Incapable of nothing. <laughs> Winning. <laughs> you hear that, besties? I'm incapable of nothing. It's confirmed. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. And before chat, is like, we already knew that. Me, 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 me. Listen. I don't want to hear it. Y'all are too sweet. Dragon just tried to woo stuff. Shocking. <laughs> Hi, Miss Reindeer. I hope you're doing good. Oh my god. Is that zigzaggy better or is it still awful? I feel like it needs to be a little straighter here. Shockingly, I feel like it needs to be straighter there. This curve is still bugging me, but I don't know how to make it like less intense. I guess I could go this way. Maybe. And not have it like dip out like that. Also, what is happening up here? This looks wrong. Yeah, maybe have it like... Like this instead. Oh, ew. Why is that so wide? Oopsies. <sighs> I 
I think I need to just not look at it and work on somewhere else because it's stressing me out. And I don't even know why. I think I just need to work it somewhere else. Uh, all I'm thinking is making two paths and merge into one. So you have a middle section because I really like the curved. And wouldn't it be cute to have a merging path with something in the middle of the two? Mm. Yeah. We could have like this downward path that goes towards like all of the houses and comes back up. And then this one. I'm just going to. Okay, hold on. I'm going to bring my crafting bench over because I need to bring my crafting bench anyways. So let me get that. We're going to make more pathing because I have like nearly not enough at all whatsoever and not enough. So um, I'm also going to get Scar and have him hang out with me because uh, I need a digging buddy because I'm probably going to have to dig for some clay. So where is Scar? Um, He's over there. We'll get the boy. Hi, Ren. How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Oh, you know what? Actually, let's go to my house, too. We're going to empty out my pockets and stuff. Then we're going to craft some floor, get scar, because I'm probably going to have to dig. And then, yeah, yeah, we're going to do some things real quick. <clears throat> I didn't realize my pockets were so full. It makes sense because I just picked up a bunch of flowers in that area. And I haven't sold all the um, gems that I picked up from mining. How you doing, Ren? I hope you're having a good day. And Miss Reindeer, hope you're doing good too. Yeah, I do like the double path kind of vibe. Sounds really cute. Ooh. God, I have a lot of gold. Lordy. I have no topaz right and everything else is full. Okay. So many gems to sell. Do I have any shiny gems actually to put away? I didn't even look at them. Um, yeah. Okay, we'll do that. There we go. And all the rest of this is sold. Doing okay. My first day back at work post surgery. So glad about that. Um, but also means back to stream hangouts. Oh, let's go. Well, we love that. We do love that part at least. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hope the day is going okay. And that you're getting through it pretty good. Mm -mm. But at least you get a vibe with us. We can make it a little bit better, hopefully. Nice. Oh. Bet. Okay. Scar. We'll grab him on the way to Sunlit. Should be walking right past him. There he is. Like my tia Peppa says, a drizzle will lead to a sprinkle. Oh, hello. Let's hang out. Let's go. Let's go, Scar. We're working in your area. Hey, Alexa, do you have it liked already? Asking for a friend, just curious. No. <gasps> oh my god. Wait, I'm kind of shocked. Uh, what? It's actually kind of wild. Not gonna lie. Hmm. Well, let's make our last one. I can't make any more after this because I haven't don't have any more Vitalis crystals, but that's okay. I might as well make this one then. I need to see um, how many like songs I have now, that now though, because you should. Oh God, I was so scared I wasn't getting. Okay, we're good. I saw pebbles and I was like, oh my God, I'm not getting any clay. I'm not getting as much as I would if I just went to the glade, but I need a little bit of everything. So this actually works out fine for me. A 
we'll take it. I don't want to say how many I have. Oh, like total like songs? Why not? So Oh no. It's a lot. How many is a lot? <laughs> like thousands or thousand? No. Um, over a thousand? Oh. Bestie, please. Mine is also over a thousand. I thought you were going to say like 10K or something. Oh. Mine's also over a thousand. So that's fine. Imagine that's what I thought you were going to say. <laughs> okay. Oh God, I'm going to have to go collect things again, aren't I? Um, looks like just a couple flowers actually. So that's okay. Oh, and a weed. Imagine just chilling and some human shows up and um, is being like, hey, I'm working in your area. So you're coming to you. Yep. Pretty much. <laughs> that's funny. Listen, I didn't even think about it that way. Okay. All right, well, we're gonna do 200 more pieces of uh, this pad. That's not gonna be enough, but it should get us closer to the amount that I need, so we'll take it. Um, I'm gonna go gather the flowers that are around and then go back to this path. God, I need so much of this flooring, Lord. Cause I haven't even taken the path to Donald's house or Casita or Wally, oh my gosh. And we're going to add a double path. Whew. Besties, we're going to need to dig up some clay, which means I'm going to need to get Vitalis crystals so that I can make potions to dig up clay. 2,245. Ah, uh, gotcha. That's not too bad. Considering you've probably had your Spotify for like forever. You know what I mean? I'd imagine you're like me, which is why mine has the amount that it does. Not the only reason why, but I've had my Spotify for a long time, which is why it has a lot of... Uh, like songs and stuff because <clears throat> i've had it for like 10 years i don't even know it's been a long time had it since high school yeah me too i believe so it's been a while okay so we were thinking two paths so what bring this one like this and then this one like this or something Or maybe leave this one like this, but then have this one. Two hundred and sixty-eight like songs. Jeez. I only used Spotify for like six months. Okay, then yeah, that makes sense. That checks out. Oh, besties. Guess what time it is? back over here how dare you you can see an angry wolfie in the background because he had a bath <laughs> my dad came in and stole him from a bath no it's the christmas song stop it Here, it's gone. Oh, holy Nira. Listen, that's exactly what it was doing. I need to make it so that when I make the pet cam big, it gets rid of the pet cam text because we don't need it there. Probably don't need it in general, but when I make it big, I want to get the text out of there. I need to edit the button. Do 
Cat, yeah, this is Mira. She is a tortie. They told me that she was a tortoiseshell calico mix. She gives torty. She's very sassy. A very sassy girl. How will I know what the camera is for? <laughs> Lils, please. Instant follow. You're sweet. Thank you for the follow. Is gorgeous. Yeah, she's very sweet. She's a sassy girl. But she's very pretty and very soft. Like, look at how shiny her fur is. You can see it in the camera because the sun's like hitting her back. I've lost my hand. At the start of COVID, I wrote a ton of parody songs using Disney songs, but now I want to write a mirror song. You should. You should. Also, I'm proud of you. Shiny like her soul, bright and beautiful. True. True. You're not wrong. You gonna leave me now? You want nothing to do with me anymore, huh? Why are you sniffing the curtain for? Yep, nothing to do with me anymore. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. Gosh, how are we going to do this? Like, how do I want to do this? Mm. Oh gosh, I hate that I can't really see the path there. I want to do maybe I should start with the front of Mirabelle's house before I make the pathway that's like in front of it because I don't know where we're going to put her house it's going to be in this area but I don't think it's going to be exactly right there I'm probably like Maybe like that. Or maybe over even more. And maybe there. Well, kind of there anyways. We'll have to see for the <laughs> pathway up to the door, but actually I think that's, yeah, that actually works out right. But what do we want in front of her house? What kind of vibes would be? Hi, Ollie. Hey, baby boy. You want snacks, too? <laughs> come here. Can you come over here and eat them? Can you come over here and eat them? Is that okay? Can, can you come over here and eat them? Ollie. Can you... I'm putting them over there. 
This song haunts your dreams. Why? Oh, it's so good and so so cute and so good, but please. Oh. What, just like hearing it a lot or? Come here. Oh, because this is the mishmashy song. That's right. That's right. That's fair. That's right. That's fair. There you go. You got one more caddo. One more baby boy. <laughs> Though. Oh. He's mad at me for kicking him out to eat over there. Repetitive whistle tones make me feel icky. No. Fluffy like a cloud. Yeah, that's Ollie. He's very sweet. He's very lovey. Like aggressively lovey. Um, he will absolutely nuzzle me to death to get pets. So. Mm -mm. He's a very sweet boy though. We love Ollie in this household. Um, let me see. Let me open a Pinteresty. Let me look at my Pinterest board. Um, I want to see what I want to do outside of Mirabelle's house. Like, what is the vibe I want? Like, do I want like a little courtyard kind of? I don't know. I don't know. Um, let's see. Oh, see, they put. Um, I might move Mirabelle. Yeah, I might move Mirabelle's house, actually. Oh. Wait, where the heck is that? Oh, that's here. We have beds now. Let's go. Mm. Yeah, it's not anymore. But if they muted, they won't be able to hear me. Huh. Tough decisions. Um. I really did like. I saw someone put Mirabelle's house. I'm trying to figure out where to put Mirabelle's house. One person put Mirabelle's house like here. Like across from the bridge. And honestly, it is really cute. I just don't know. If I'm personally okay with it. Maybe if I put it like that so I can still have a pathway behind it. I don't know. Like, I like it with the bridge. I just don't know if that's enough space for me um, without making everything feel like cluttered. Could also put it. It feels too boring, though. Hmm. I do like the idea of walking into sunlit though and seeing Casita in the background over there instead of having to like turn right to see Casita. Maybe we'll try it. <laughs> he keeps flirting with everyone and is getting rejected. What did you make him? Why is he trying to flirt with everyone? Um, it is ad break time, besties. So, uh, we're gonna do a little pausey pause on the decorating and do an ad break moment, and then we'll figure it out when we come back. See if we can do some brain cell magic and figure out how we want this pathing to be, um, <laughs> and what we want where. Because I don't know yet. I really do like Mirabelle here, but then I don't like Donald. 
where he is. So now I don't know. I could try to move him. Like at least rotate him maybe. To this side. And then maybe I won't have as much issue with it. Yeah. If I rotate him, it probably will be okay. Anyways, um, ad break time. So if you need to get up and stretch your legs or get food or refill your water or anything like that, now is the perfect time to do so um, because I'm going to do exactly the same. Stretch my leggies and all of that. Anything that I might need to get done. And then we'll hopefully um, come back and figure out what the heck we're doing in this plateau. The hardest part is figuring out where everything wants, where I want everyone to go. And then obviously like the main roads, figure those out too. But having double pathing will actually be really cute because we need to go to this bridge as well. So um, how has it been an hour? I don't know, bestie. I wish I knew. <laughs> I don't know. Time has been flying. It's been five hours of stream already. Please explain to me how. I don't know. I don't get it. No idea. Not the Felicity bestie, please. I hate it here. <laughs> Are you wrong? No, but please. Lordy. <laughs> you goober. But true. Do be a good soundtrack. Oh, car. Uh, a rat went mad. Lily got bit on the leg before it got. Oh, no. RIP Lily's like. Takes and dragon are lovers now. Why are we always lovers in RimWorld? What is that game? <laughs> Why? It also happened when I put me and dragon in the game. What is that floating rock? It's just a little floating rock. 
There's floating rocks all over the place, actually, if you, like, look up in the sky. They're everywhere. There's, like, little floating islands all over. Kelly, thank you so much for the three months. I appreciate you so much. Thank you for the amazing and wonderful support for so long. I appreciate it. Look, there's one right here. Um, I appreciate you. Thank you. I didn't realize my gift sub ran out midstream. I was wondering why I had ads. Oh, no. <laughs> yep, that makes sense. That makes sense. Well, there you go. You figured it out. So, I'm proud of you, bestie. You got it. No, you? Excuse you? Excuse me? How dare you know me? What's that cat doing? <laughs> He's causing chaos. Ollie. What are you doing? Hey. Hey. Stop it. <sighs> He's pawing at my curtain. Oh my god, there's a dig spot in the way. I hate it here. Well. I have to get up and go fix that. I'm just trying to figure out like the rest of the area. I don't know. Maybe Casita could look really cute with this here. But then I also have to make sure there's enough like pathing room. I don't know. I don't know if I can fit Casita here. I feel like I might be able to. But is it going to be annoying? Well, I guess I can go behind Casita to get up here. I just don't know, like, how annoying it's going to be to, like, run around Casita all the time. That's my biggest concern. But I think from, like, this view, it's really cute. So I don't know. Now I'm torn. I wish I could put Casita like more back. Like if I could put Casita on the right of the pond, like I can on the left, I think I'd like it a lot more, you know? But I don't know if I like Casita in this corner. It's kind of like a drab corner, but I could dress it up with bushes and things. But I kind of like it here. I also don't know if I do, because this is just going to be a straight path then to the Forgotten Lands. I can't really, like, curve it because there's not enough room to do that. So maybe I do put Casita here. I don't know. If I put Casita there, obviously Donald has to go in this side. I could put this like here. Like maybe that's still cute. I move it back a little. Uh, I'm back and oh no, my arms are too sore to do more homework. Oh no! Oof, darn. That really sucks, bestie. Oh man. I feel for you. That's that's awful, honestly. <laughs> Hi, Lee. Hello, hello. Yeah, I might move Casita here just because I can kind of see myself getting upset with like having to walk around Casita all the time to get to the Forgotten Lands. Because I think it'd be cute to have like a little Y in the road right here where it splits off from here and goes this way or like goes this way. So. You say today was my fee's birthday? Mm-hmm. Okay. 
Okay. Um. Workout was nice. Pushed myself a bit. Uh, but the ADHD executive discussion is so annoying. I'll do 10 reps and pause. And then I'm fighting to get started again. I feel that. Yeah, I understand. Gotcha, bestie. It's so difficult. I think I might move Casita back though. Um, of course, it's gonna be called Floof Faction. What should the colony location be called? Floofington, Floof Puddle, Valley Floof. Oh, those are all good. Hey, Nala, not you popping off immediately? Jeez. Immediately 15 options, love. And to be honest, I have no idea where to put my casita. I feel that, bestie. I'm struggling with it. Like, I know I want to put it in sunlit because I like the color palette of casita up here, but I, like, don't know... if I like this spot fully and, like... Like, I think I'm coming to terms with it. I think I'm starting to like it. Especially with that there. Hmm. I think I do like it. It's just too bright compared to every other house, so I can't exactly put it with anything, but it's not a singular house either because it's meant to have neighbors in mind. So yeah, no idea. Yeah, I feel you. I feel ya. I get it. It's very, very colorful. It was like, I, that's why I put it up here is because I felt like the color palette of it fit Sunlit Plateau really well. Is like, it's still very vibrant and colorful, but it's not like overly because I feel like when I put it in like the meadow, it just stood out way, 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 way too much. Like it didn't look good because the meadow was so cool toned and Casita is so warm in color that I was like, ah. Uh. So I put it here because I think it looks better with like the just general palette of Sunlit Plateau. But I also get that not everyone obviously wants to put it in Sunlit Plateau. I just thought it would look really cute with the, the volumes. Tried putting it in the forest. Wrong decision. Oh, yeah, that would be really jarring in the forest. Yeah, that makes sense. Doesn't look as contrasty here. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> Classy. Dixie rave, Dixie rave, Dixie rave, Dixie rave, oh, no. Dixie rave, Dixie rave, Dixie rave. Not all the Dixie raves. Classy, thank you so much for the 12 months. Uh, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for being so sweet and wonderful and cute and adorable. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're vibing. It's fine. It's not your fault. Justin decides to read every single one of them out. Um, I hope you're doing absolutely wonderfully. Thank you so much for the 12 months. I appreciate you so, so, so much. Thank you for being so sweet and kind. Appreciate you. No, you stop. No. It's also a bit too big for the forest. That's valid. Yeah, that's fair. I can see that as well. One can see that as well. How you been? How's your day? How's things? How's life? You. Is everything going good or am I going to fist fight somebody? I just need to know. Oops. Um, tried fixing my car's AC only to have other software issues with the programming. Uh, the program I'm using to program the computer. Oh, gross. You want to fist fight my car. I mean, if that's what it will take, bestie, yes. Do you need me to fist fight your car? I don't know if it'll help. Maybe it will. You, you I mean, like, sometimes you got to give electronics a little bit of a smack, you know? So, like, maybe. It 
it's fine. How do you figure out what to do with the paths? Because I want the paths to be two colored. Um, but they don't connect to different path types, which is rude. Um, honestly, I kind of just like wing it. I figure out like a kind of like base shape in my head and then um, try to figure it out from there, like how to replicate it on the floor in a grid system. And then I go in and I kind of like fine tune it. Um, but as far as using like two different types of flooring, um... I've done it in other areas, but I've kind of was like really, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? It was really, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Hold on, let me show you. <laughs> I've used different flooring in different areas and I kind of just did it like this, where I made like a different section, a different path, and then just connected it with like bushes and things. Cause I did that here. So like, as long as it's sectioned off in a way, it doesn't look jarring and it still looks like a vibe. Um, it just depends on how you're kind of handling it. You know what I mean? At the moment I have it as the main path and then a border um, path slash garden border. Oh, that's kind of cute though. That is kind of a cute idea. But yeah, I've used multiple different like sections of pathing around in my builds and you can make it work for sure without it being annoying to look at. But as far as like pathing shapes, yeah, I kind of just like wing it. I don't know. I figure it out as I go. Kitty. Is there a kitty? Or are you talking about um in the room world game maybe? Or was it the song? I don't know. I'm not paying attention. Did you make interiors? Do you make interiors in this game too? Um, you can decorate your house, yes, but I haven't done that yet because I just haven't. <laughs> but you can decorate inside if you want to. Lunar and her big belly. She looks so happy. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Look in Discord. I see. I see. I see. Let me see. Hold on. I'm so bad with interiors and MC. Only reason I asked was for inspo. That's fair. I'm really bad at interiors too. You can. Wish you could decorate villagers' houses. Characters' houses really change the tone. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, look at her belly. Oh my God. She's got the biggest belly. The biggest, chonkiest belly. What a little angel. She's so cute. The color for the outside of her house just looks sad. Yeah, like, I know that's what Minnie's house like actually looks like, but man, I don't like it. Not a vibe with it. Okay, I need to change this pathing. There's something about it I don't like. She was being so sweet. Um, when is she not sweet? She's a perfect angel. <gasps> Bye, Duncan. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you so much. I hope you have a good rest of your evening. Feels too thick. She has a little collar now, so I can find her when she's running around. Oh, cause she jingle. <laughs> she do a little jingly. I could have sworn that the color was bright. Um, then what is it? What it is? Wait, brighter than what it is? Is that what you mean? 
Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It feels pretty bright to me. Is it not bright? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. It feels really bright to me, but also that's just because I like her color palette in general feels bright. So maybe it's just. It's very dram. Yeah, I guess I could see that. I don't know. It feels bright, but maybe it's just because of where I have it. Like it feels very neon y. I don't know. I guess I could see what you're talking about, though. It's like both neon, but also a little muted, I guess. Maybe. They did Goofy's house really well in Mini Summer's Drop. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. Tekken odd, though. Okay, I think I... Maybe I want the curve to be the opposite. Here. Or maybe that's fine. There's something about the curve I'm not liking. Maybe I need it to go the opposite way. Instead of like that, maybe like that. You know? Possibly. Not even the right. Did I even just do that right? I don't think I did. Figure out the shapes of paths is so stressful. I just want to get the base down though, because. And help me determine where I put everything else. Okay, I think that is better. Even though it's kind of just like a curve like that, it's fine, I think. Valley and I was clearing my sunlit plateau to organize it. When I removed the ribcage in the middle to put it near Scar's home, it disappeared. Can you help me find it? Um, you're probably talking about, oh gosh, where is it? Um, maybe it's an underbrush. Mm. I think I know what you're talking about. Hmm. Well, I don't know, actually. Is that one of those things that you can't put back down? I actually don't know. I know exactly what you're talking about. But now that you mention it, is that an item you cannot? I don't see it in any of the things, unless I'm looking too quickly. Maybe it's something they need to add. I would assume it'd be under rocks, but I don't think I saw it under there. I don't see it on yours either. Yeah, maybe once you get rid of it, you can't get it back. I know I've heard people say that there's things like that in this game. Oh. Well, there's this. I don't think that's it, though. Is this the right thing that you're looking for? Or is it different? Maybe it's disguised. Oh, that is it? 
Okay, well then there you go. It's the it's disguised. I was gonna say maybe it's disguised as the other rocks. So it's the large sunlit plateau rock. Now I want to look at all the other sunlit rocks and see if they're the same as the picture. Large mossy sunlit plateau rock. Okay, this one is the okay. So it's specifically the plateau rock on the bottom. Ah, secret. The uh, image for it is just not telling. Dope. Well, there you go. We found it. We found it together. Pog. <laughs> Love that. Nice. Good. Because I'd probably want that too. So that actually works out really well. Mm -mm. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Okay. You're the best. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm glad we could find it. Glad we could figure it out. I was going to do like this. Where do you get the carousel? The carousel is um, Woody's house. The carousel is Woody's house. We got injured by a mutant bug. Gross. Oh, <laughs> do you not want Woody? <laughs> Is Woody somebody you don't want? I wouldn't blame you. How do I want to put Donald's house now? I can put him back this way, I guess, now. Great. Where am I going to put that now? Yeah. Yeah, bestie. I had the same issue. I have no idea. I put him up here because I didn't know where else I was going to put him. I had originally thought, like, maybe putting him in the forest but then I changed the entire vibe of my forest and he's just not gonna fit in here anymore like I could make his house fit in here but like he's not gonna fit my aesthetic I thought about putting him on the beach to make like a cute little boardwalk with a carousel and I'm like he's just not gonna fit on the beach anywhere so I don't know he got I guess I could put him in like this empty area in my meadow I don't know he got exported to sunlit plateau because I simply have no idea <laughs> I don't know. His house, like, his color scheming of his house looks good here. And he has the bushes that come from here. So, or, like, the little plants around it. So, like, or, like, they at least work in here. I think those are technically the bushes from the meadow. But they work in here. So, like, it's fine. It's fine. I don't know. He's coming up here. <laughs> He's just going to have to deal with it. Um, I think I will put Donald like that. I may haps put the well here. Could be cute. I don't know what to do with all of this space. I have Wally and his garden and <laughs> freaking Woody. Maybe I'll put Woody there. I don't know. I'm turning my plaza into a fancy shopping area and half in a marketplace. So I might, it might fit there. Oh yeah, that could work. That could work. That could work. I think I'm going to keep Scar up here. I could move him out. If I needed space. But he fits so well in here. We'll see. Did I win yet? Absolutely. Of course. Yes. Do, 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 do. I hope you're doing good, new kid. Um, I might turn an area of Silent Plateau into a recycling center for Wally, because otherwise I have nowhere to put him. Oh, that'd be really cute. Yeah. That'd be adorable. Be a moment. All right, let's just work with this side of the plateau, yeah? I'm not going to worry about this side because it's stressing me out and I don't know what I want to do with it. So <laughs> we're just going to work with this side of the plateau and we're going to start putting down like trees and stuff and trying to make it look decent um, and not like a complete and total mess. So that's all.
I think the wall could be cute here, but I also kind of want to make it so the pathing is even on each side. I wish they gave a grass path. That'd be cute. That would have been nice. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. I wonder if we do this. I know I don't have much of the pathing left, but it's fine because I'm going to delete some here. Mainly use it to cover up spots that aren't grass, though. Valid. I'd probably do the same. Because I just hate having spaces like this that are like, they feel like they ruin the... <clears throat> Not me restarting a whole new file. Oh, bestie. Oh, God. Luxato, do you see what you did? <laughs> oh, no. Ay, ay, ay. Gosh dang it, Lils. As you should, though. But also, bestie, please. I don't like that. This is my third because I kind of broke my game twice. Rip. Uh, I hate that. I'm sorry you broke your game. Don't like that at all. I read that as a mutant bang. <laughs> mutant bang. Incredible. doesn't need to be perfect on the other sides. I just want it to be symmetrical here at the very least. Oops. I still hate how the path doesn't go underneath the bridge or the stairs and just stops right before them. Takes away from the whole connectedness. Yeah, I also hate that it doesn't go under Kistita specifically, which is so odd. I don't know why they decided to do that. Um, I just like to be annoying and start over because now we know all the secrets. Yeah, no, that's fair. Listen, that's not being annoying. Live your best life, bestie. You're thriving as far as I'm concerned. What path do I want to use? Stop. Maybe it's just mud. Mm, I don't like how purple it is. Oh, don't have any of that. Uh, me in the middle of my journey to get stitched for the third time. Oh, God. Not third time. Getting stitched one time is already draining enough. Because it takes so long for the game to just let you do it. I'm going to just do this one. It's fine. I'm just putting it here so my well can go on it. So I'm not overly attached to, like... The aesthetic of it. You know what I mean? I just want somewhere to put my well on. Okay. I actually might move the well back. The second sock. Nice. I just have to remember to, where to go and get it. Um, I want to see the meadow. I think the second is the meadow. Because I think the first is Dazzle Beach, second is Meadow, and third is Forest. If it's not the Meadow, then it's Dazzle Beach. I know it's Dazzle Beach, Meadow, and Forest. I remember where the first one was. Oh, no. The first one might be Meadow. I know the last one's Forest. <laughs> meadow is second. Okay, there you go. <laughs> there you go. I was like, I know all the places. I just don't remember exactly the order. Oops. Um, also, hi, Iron. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Thank you for the likes. 
Then there's me, Lils, please. You're doing great, is what you mean. Okay. Let's pick out trees and all that. Um, soar. Definitely this tree. Definitely this tree. We're going to have a lot of options up here, truly. Like, a lot of tree options up here. Probably acacia trees, too, because they're pretty and they fit the color scheme as well. So, acacias, too. And then, um, these trees. We could even do the dragon trees. There's so many trees for this area. Lord. Yeah, and palm trees. Wow. I'm going to be like overwhelmed with trees for this space. Jeez. Because there's all those. Probably not going to use that. I also don't like the color of it. Why is it very vibrant? Don't like that. Not a vibe for me. You know, if you don't pick up the first song, it just keeps appearing near you in the area it spawns. That's not shocking. Not too surprising. How rude all those trees. I know. And then when we're decorating in freaking, um, other places, it's like, oh, I just don't have enough tree options and I don't know what I want to use. But now we come here and it's like, oh, I have 15,000 tree options. Yeah, that's what I was thinking is Frosted Heights. I'm like, ugh. Even this tree, honestly, I don't think I'm going to use a lot of it. But, like, the maple fits the color in here. So, if I need, like, a tall, bushy heckin' tree to, like, fill a space so it doesn't look so drab back here, I can use a maple. So, that's actually nice to know. Because color palette-wise, it fits. And I could just put it, like, back here so that it doesn't, you don't just see nothingness. You know what I mean? Probably will do that, truly. Just so it looks fuller. Yeah. Um, Jubby, hi! How you doing? I hope you're doing well. It's nice to see you. I hope you're good. Okay. So we have all that, and then we have underbrush. We have the Sunlit Plateau Grass, which is... These options are wild, not going to lie. <laughs> these options are wild. I think I like these the most, but like, what is happening? There's so many. Okay. I didn't even know these existed. I thought it was only like this yellowy thing. Interesting. I like these better. They feel more accurate. Oh, goodness gracious. I need a, uh, I need to put down a bush. Okay, so there's that. They have the snake plants, obviously. We have the Sunlit Plateau bushies and this bushy. And this one and this one. All the different colors of yellow and oranges. And what's the other color we want to use? Um, probably just like... Whatever matches the trees the best for the green. Thank you for the lyric. I appreciate you. Those ferns. That's not going to work. Probably Glade of Trust fern could work. I see that fitting. Okay. Yeah, what color bush do we want? No. Maybe, um, the Glade of Trust? Ooh, probably. Establishing a color palette I love. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to. I think Glade of Trust and Sunlit is our vibe. I think that's our vibe. I think they match the trees the best. As far as, like, the color of green it is. Because the other greens are too, like... Like, Frosted Heights is too... Ugh. 
too pale. This is too blue green. This is too like vibrant green. Plaza is even more vibrant green. So I think Glade of Trust is our best bet. Everything else is too much. Or like too little, you know. Specifically the other Glade of Trust bushes though, not these ones. What about in this palette? Is there anything like... I wanted to mix some plaza ones in, I could. Because at least these kind of time we're in with those yellowier toned ones, but I have the yellow bushes too, so I think we're fine. I think this is the right colors. That should give us enough. Oh, uh, well, I wish I had a... Maybe I'll do that bush. Which one was that? The meadow? No plaza. Yeah, maybe we'll also do the plaza bush. I know it sticks out a little bit, but... I think it still works. Ooh. Actually. Oh, maybe all of them. Oh, gosh. Now I don't know. I was like, oh, maybe the Forest of Valor one, because it actually looks really good next to that yellow. But then I'm like, well, now I kind of like all of them. <laughs> Sunlit Plateau is really going to be our cluster area, and I'm just going to put everything up here. I'm like, I don't know, 15 different options of trees and bushes galore. Go. <laughs> Love that, though. It's going to be very colorful. Shockingly. I think that palette's a vibe. We'll work with it. Um. Okay, so let's see. Let's start messing with... um. What I actually want to put in front of Casita. Um, where's the, uh, oh, it's not going to fit actually. Oh, we have these wildebeest remains. Right about those. I can never find anything this game. I swear. Mm -mm. As far as like decor stuff goes, I never know what anything is categorized as. Too big. I have a feeling this is going to be too big too. Well, it technically fits, but I'm not going to put that there. But it technically fits. If I moved that, would it fit? There. Oh, it does fit there. Maybe I swap them sides. So I can put this cute little pool. It'd be so cool if you could put the statue inside the little moon pool. Yeah, that'd be cool. I agree. I think I might like that. Because I want to use this here. somewhere. Yes. I feel like using it here might be really cute in front of their house. But I don't know. I also don't know if I like it here simply because like I'm not going to be able to put like a lot of anything next to it because of how the pathing and stuff is. So I might have to change up the path a little bit. Which is fine. I 
can give me the water. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> I think that helps with the path. <clears throat> Trying to be better about hydrating because I've had Diet Coke and coffee today and I'm not about to give myself a migraine. Yeah, you need some hydration. I feel that. I have been really bad about hydrating today too, so I appreciate it. <clears throat> Appreciate you keeping us hydrated as well. All right, let's start with trees, maybe. I don't know. I don't know how I want to do this. Um, I don't... Do we like this? Do we like the pool? I think I do, but I'm just trying to, like, figure out how to make it look nicer, you know? But I think I like it. And I think I like this here and I'll put like little rocks or something in like bushes and things and it would look really cute once I get through it. I love the little tiny one. So cute. Little precious baby. <laughs> it's so teeny. Gosh, I don't even know where to put it because it's so small. <laughs> it's just a little babe. It's a tiny little baby tree. <laughs> I love it though. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Where are those big ones? These trees. Maybe I need to put that back there. And not this. Hmm. I think that helps. Did I even move that? Oh, I moved it back one. Okay, it's giving magical vibes. It's giving like magical forest vibes because of all the trees and I'm kind of loving it so far. With all the trees around it, it's starting to come together, actually. Um, I don't know if I want that one. I don't know what all my options are for this tree. I need another maple. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Uh, with waterborne houses, you can put them in the middle of water with no land of sight and still access them through their NPCs by saying go to house and talking to them. Oh, that's nice. That's good that there's a loophole. I still want to be able to like personally walk up to them and enter it that way, but it is nice that you can do that. I will say. Just so you're not fully trapped, you know? <sighs> okay, it's kind of giving. It's kind of giving. Listen, I'm hating their house over here more. I really wanted it to feel like very full and in depth, you know? And I think all the extra trees and things are making it better. Um, I love the classic hit Disney movie, Super Mario Odyssey. Me too. Me too, truly. I'm glad we found um, somebody else who can like appreciate the classics. <laughs> Lordy. <laughs> do 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 do. Okay, so how many different types of trees are there? And there's this one and this one. Is that it? That might be it. Things got bad and we're starting the colony. Oh, no. <laughs> no. That's not what you like to hear. 
Oh, I forgot about this tree. This shaped one. I think I'm going to put that there instead. That one there. Okay, it's coming along. It's coming along. <gasps> How dare it? Uh, I'm choosing a different location. That's so mean. I'm suing the game. Thanks. Cute. Okay, I love. I know it's supposed to be like a desert, okay? I know this is like, you know, it's suddenly blends out, but I'm kind of loving the like jungly desert vibe. I'm kind of living for it, not gonna lie. It's giving me everything that I ever wanted. So, jungly desert it is. I don't want that there because I don't want to block Casita. I won't put it here. Do, 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 do. And do, do, do. do for that i don't know all right let's put bushes not that one maybe this one put that there no Hi, fans. How are you? Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing good. Do, do, do. No. 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 <laughs> nope. No, give me the other one. Thank you. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Stress about taxes. Trying not to think about it. That's valid, bestie. That's a heckin' mood. I believe in you. You got this. The cat for this colony is Ollie, Ollie, even though it's orange. Ollie gives orange cat vibes, so I think this fits. Honestly, valid. Fair and valid. And true and real. <laughs> Which ones did I say I was going to use? Peaceful? No. Force of Valor. Okay. Hello. And then we'll use Sunlit Bush there. Okay, it's kind of giving. It's kind of giving. It's kind of giving. I do wonder if I should move the pool like this, though. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Should I move the entrance so the pool is like that? Wait, why does it all of a sudden have a problem with that? It's so confusing. Because right now I have it so the entrance is here. But should I do it this way? I kind of like it this way because you see the waterfall more. No, I'm going to leave it the way that it was, I think. I think that's cute. 
I got an email from someone in all Comic Sans. Oh God, immediately delete. <laughs> Do I have any favorite custom outfits? Not really, because I don't really dive into custom outfits very much. I haven't really done any, truly, so. Not truly, unfortunately. There's a lot online that are like super cute and I wish I could have them. Wish I could just like download them from the creators. Patiently waiting for the day that I can do that. The day that Game Loft lets us, cause I need. Mm -mm. Gonna go ahead and not answer, please, uh, savage. <laughs> the savagery we stand for truly where are the clusters I'm looking for here it is cute okay listen it's turning out it's coming along I'm not angry about it Not mad about it at all. I couldn't even process the email. It was a lot. That's valid. Makes sense. Makes sense. Very jarring to look at, I'd imagine. Yeah, we're going to add a lot of rocks back there. Oh gosh. Okay, wait. Maybe like a... This moment? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> okay, okay. What if I do a, uh, no, not that one. No, not that one. Not that one. No. <laughs> no. No. Please. Why do you hate me? There we go. Goodness. Okay. Maybe like that. Feels nice and full back there. We'll take it. We'll take it. And then we'll add a teeny bit of bushes. I don't want to go overboard because you're never going to see them anyways. But I want to add like a tiny bit of like the yellow ones. Not purple. I want to add some yellow ones around so you can like see a little splash of color back there. You know, not a lot. I don't know if you see him in the distance. Okay. Hi, Lola. How are you? <clears throat> Welcome in. Um, we're going to go ahead and actually do this ad break because I'm finally on a roll. Okay. So I'm not ending in like two minutes. So we're going to go ahead and let this one go through. So we'll do a little bit of a pause. I'm great. I got so much done today. Nice. Good. Uh, how do you, bestie? You're crushing it. Absolutely crushing it. <clears throat> oh, Once I sent an email to a lecturer at uni and started it uh, out with hi, and he sent me an email 
So they were in class about how he didn't like people using hi in emails and talked about email etiquette. <gasps> how dare they? That feels like a personal attack. I am so sorry, Monty. Excuse me. <gasps> nice, Lola. I'm glad they're helping out, bestie. That's amazing news. Excuse me. I'm glad. We love that. Um, if y'all need to stretch your legs or get food or water, now's a good second to do that because we're going to do a little teeny break. The last one of the day. It was 100% a personal attack and I'll never forgive him. Honestly, I wouldn't either. That's so mean. That's so mean. I'm so sorry. What a bully. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. Hold on. Okay, they're over. <laughs> they're good. Um, I went back to the pharmacy and demanded they use the coupon they said they couldn't use. It got $60 refunded. <gasps> I'm proud of you. Proud of myself because I haven't had the energy to advocate for myself at all in the past two years. You're doing amazing, Lola. You're absolutely crushing it. I'm very proud of you too, bestie. You're doing amazing. Um, and it's, it's really hard to advocate for yourself, honestly. It can definitely feel that way. So I'm proud of you for doing it. As tough as it might have been. Mm -mm. I really want to use this. Maybe. I think I might move that one. I think I'm going to remove this tree. Put that there. This year, but I did the compassion because we had this conversation last week about new meds. I was afraid to try them. Well, I'm glad they're working out. They're helping me so far. Good, uh, good. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad it turned out for the better. And that they are helping. And how nerve-wracking it can be starting new meds because you just never know. You know, 
You don't know how your body specifically is going to react to it. You don't know if it's going to be a change that you like or not. It's, uh, it's tough. But I'm glad it's all going really well. That's good. Oops. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. They should have decorations you can put in water. Um, you mean outside of like the uh um outside of the uh like reeds and stuff like that like actual decor pieces like furniture type items Did I actually make that four wide? I think I did. Yeah. Okay. That's better. But yeah, I agree. I wish we had decor that we could put in the... In the wall. So I agree. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting about the ferns. Gosh dang it. Whoops. Okay, I can delete all these now. Oops, not that. No! Well, that's not what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> it's fine. We can do that too. Probably is a good idea, so. You gonna do it? You gonna save? You gonna do it? You did it. Nice. You didn't though. It's fine. We'll fix it. Lord have mercy. Oh god. Um, okay. That's fine. This goes like back here. Pretty sure it went back here. These weren't even here anymore. I was wrong because of the lining. Ollie is not orange. He's white. Oh, perfect. Well, then there you go. It works out wonderfully. Mm, I think that was a different tree, actually. Yeah, I, I see. Okay. I do my pathing like you. I don't know how you get your curves so clean. Um, honestly, just like putting it down and like moving it around a ton. <laughs> Truly, that's really it. I move it a lot before I think that it looks good. So that's really it. Hi, Dragon. How are you? Taco Bell, delicious. Taco Bell, yeah, besties. I guess we're all eating Taco Bell. Love that for us. Delicious. Do, 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 do,
Hi, Sardine. Got an adult tonight. I just wanted to say hi. Hi, Sardine. I hope you're doing good. I hope adulting goes good, bestie. You got this. We're rooting for you. You're going to crush it. You're doing amazing. Um, you moving around makes it look like you know what you're doing and effortless. I'm literally struggling. I promise it's, uh, it's literally just me sitting in there and getting like way too in my head about it and like trying to figure it out. Like mentally, I'm having like mental gymnastics over here in my head. Y'all are seeing it as flawless and like, like I'm just getting it right the first time, but I promise I'm sitting here like overthinking every single teeny tiny move and... Just trying to work with my brain and knowing like what my brain kind of likes and then working off of that, you know? Same thing with all the bushes and stuff. I hate adulting. You finish one thing and another thing comes up either during that first thing at the end or five million things just appear out of nowhere. Yeah, it's awful. You're not wrong. You are not wrong. Gosh dang it, Dragon. Now I really want Taco Bell. Stinker. And tree do I want to put here? No. Probably this one. Yeah. You're welcome. No. No, you're welcome. I just go back to a uh, childhood as a child and stay there was much easier true but also i like at the same point i don't you know what i mean like yes it's easier because like no bills and stuff like that and all that and no adulting but also like i don't think i would want to go back to being a child and having someone dictate my every anything that i ever wanted to do you know like it comes with its benefits but it also comes with its downsides and then homework. Oh, my God. Heck no. I'm not going back to homework in high school. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, less free will. Homework. Oh, my God. Pass. Lying on transportation. Yeah, having to ask permission to go, like, literally everywhere. Mm-mm. Oh, God. Dragon. I mean, like, technically in high school. <laughs> Having to eat peas? Stop it. Not the peas. <laughs> Rephrase illegal alcohol. Thanks. I would never go back to my childhood. Yeah, pass. Pass. But the less responsibility is great. But everything else that comes with it. Um. No. Please, I'm paying so much therapy to remove my childhood. Valid, bestie, valid. I thought Dixie was going to say paste for a second. I was going to say I think that one is a choice. No, no, paste. That's not a choice. Mm -mm. <laughs> Y'all didn't indulge in paste? What? Wow. Okay. <laughs> there 
there's literally two things I want to change from when I was a child and I didn't even do them. And please do it too. I don't know. Parents just... Parenting is hard. Like, I get that, obviously. But yeah, it's just... Uh, uh, you know oh we love that that's really fun lola i'm so sorry bestie that you have to deal with that that's disgusting hate that for you so much okay you know what I honestly think that that half of the this half of sunlit is actually like I'm like I'm vibing with it, which is great because we're at two hundred and eight hundred two thousand eight hundred ninety nine. So we have a hundred item spaces to decorate the rest of this, which is actually a good amount. Um, and I'm probably not going to make it as lush as this. I just wanted this side to be like extra lush and full. So I really like this side, though. It's really pretty vibing with it i just have to figure out this section like what exactly i want to do um now they tell me they're proud of me for doing something about my problems and wish my brother was doing would get their act together ew gross i'm sorry mine didn't believe in adhd when both me and my twin got diagnosed with it didn't tell us or get us help yay Nice, uh, cool. So they just let you suffer at their own expense. Nice, cool bit. Dope. Love that, truly. what my dad told me he was depressed once he prayed and it went away i told my dad i'm sorry he was sad once right so they know okay you know that's not depression but that's fine um <laughs> everything's great everything's fine i love that for you so much i hope you no longer really have to deal with that bestie because that is mighty toxic and problematic in so many ways one of my besties had uh, has ADHD and she was diagnosed with it in college. After her diagnosis, her parents were like, yeah, we thought you had it, but you were doing fine without a diagnosis. So we didn't think we needed one. Okay. <laughs> All right, sure, cool. I hate, like, oh, God. Uh, parenting just... <sighs> Listen. Parenting just, like... I don't know. It's obviously tough to be a parent, but some of the choices that parents decide to make for their children is... It, like, baffles me. Like, yeah, just because they're a child and you are their parent and you do make choices for them doesn't mean, like... There's, there's certain things like you shouldn't make that decision. Um, you know what I mean? Like if your child needs a diagnosis, you should get that for their benefit later. At the very least. I love what you done with the place. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I was doing fine until I, I barely passed high school. My parents has lost the diagnosis, so I can't get help for it now. No. It's tough to being a parent, but like every child that I work with has family dysfunction. Yeah, it's not the child's fault ever. It's always family issues. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying is like, I get like, I know it's a sensitive subject though. You know what I mean? Like, so I'm trying to choose my words very carefully. Um, but yeah, no, there are certain times where like, yes, obviously you are a parent and you do have to make decisions for your child because they are a child, especially at like certain ages and whatnot. But like, there's also certain choices that you should not make for them. Um... Like, I don't know. It's tough. It's heckin' tough. Like, if your kid needs a diagnosis and they're struggling or whatever is happening, like, you owe them that, you know? Like, it's in their best interest to figure out what possibly may be going on in their head. 
because they don't know. They can't tell you. They can't show you the signs, but you can pick up on them. Right? So it's like, eh. I don't know. Ah, I can stinky. Um, honestly, I might keep the berry bushes kind of like that, but differently. This is why I never go back to childhood fair. I guess because I'm pretty sure no one knows how to raise children really now. Like, there's so much misinformation. Even if you find the correct information, you're not sure if it's correct for what you need for it. Well, raising a child is difficult because even, like, if you have all the right information, that doesn't mean you're going to do it right. You know what I mean? Like, because you can't... Like, parenting is not by the book. Parenting directly reflects like based off of the person who is the parent and like I don't know just their ability to parent and think about somebody else and their needs above their own needs that's really what it boils down to because parenting is something you always will have there will always be a scenario where you have to think on your toes because you can't learn everything about parenting from a book. That's just not possible. You can't learn it from research. You can't learn it from this there X, Y, Z. It's really just like your, again, your ability to put someone's interests and needs fully above your own at any point in time. Adult children of emotionally immature parents. Yeah. If you're curious as to what happens to you or how you're impacted. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just like, it really, again, it just boils down to the parent themselves and like, their emotional maturity, um, emotional maturity and uh, their traits and all that. And, uh, you know, it's really that because parenting is different for everybody, obviously. Oh, that does sound like a good book, though. I think I've heard about it before. Sounds vaguely familiar. I think... Maybe my waifu might have posted about it on Twitter or something. Or maybe my wifey. I don't know. One of them, I think, told me about it. Sounds about right. Culture and generation, generational projection. Yeah. 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 For sure. Okay, I kind of like that with the bushes there. Kind of vibing it with, with them in this section. Uh, my favorite is when someone else who has a kid thinks they know how to raise your kids, even though everyone's different. Yeah, yeah, that too. <clears throat> I would agree with that. Because yeah, every kid, every human, every person needs has different needs. Like, I don't care if you've raised five children. <laughs> it doesn't know, mean you know how to raise my child, you know? I can talk about this all day because it's my whole life. That's valid. This is exactly one of the reasons why I'm going uh, to go see a therapist and, um, in May, so. <laughs> um, ooh. So I want to put Goofy's stall here. That could be a cute little spot. Right next to the berry bush, right before the cave. I'm happy for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're sweet. It's going to be good. I'm nervous about it, but it's going to be good. Mm -hmm. Another, um, like another thing that I just love about living where I live is like, I just am... Um, I'm able to get like all of this stuff um, and everything is covered, which is incredible, truly. Um, Cause I know not everyone obviously has that luxury, but California has got a really nice, um, really nice coverage for that stuff. So I haven't had to pay a cent. Um, I don't mean a little bit of timing all the time. Oh, when parents expect their family members to handle children and not them, yeah. Yeah, that's you. 
Like, that's your baby. It's not our family baby. <laughs> as much as you may want to think it is. Okay, I like this spot. Let's save. Let's see if it saves. And let's do a walk. To make sure everything... Mm -hmm. Make sure everything looks right. This definitely was not there. I don't exactly know how this was. I think it was just... A Glade of Trust one and then a Fern. I think that's what it was. No. Quest Jam. Uh-huh. Cute. So I love TikTok because some people cannot get a diagnosis or get therapy. YouTube is also an awesome resource if you cannot get access to services. Absolutely. Absolutely. Do you want to put today's VOD up today or wait a day? Um, seek therapy. Woo hoos! <laughs> Iconic, truly. Um, I don't know. I don't really have a preference. I guess I could go update like day of. I don't care. I just need to um, make the playlist, like you said. Some people do like hoes instead of therapy. We don't judge in here. Do what you gotta do, bestie. Anyway, back to my lurky lurk. <laughs> Lexa, please. Okay, I think I like it. It's turning out cute. I do like it. It looks nice. I do like where Casita is. I like all the bushes and stuff in front of Donald's. I like where the well is. I like this little area with Goofy. I do like, I just like him being nooked in right there. It's kind of cute. This is a vibe. This angle is a vibe. Looking at the back of Sunlit Plateau. Yeah, that's probably me, Lex Tato. It's probably me keeping the um, stream title the same. <laughs> I don't always change it all the time because I always, like sometimes I get lazy. So it's probably the uh, me not changing the title. <gasps> Kate! Hi, Kate! Me seeing Scar Chase after you made me instantly think he was hunting you. Oh, oops. Sorry. That's my fault. That's my bad. Um, I forgot that he was following me because I asked him to be my digging buddy earlier. Hi, Kate. How was your day? I hope it was absolutely amazing. Kate, look. Look what we did. We did uh, a lot of sunlit, actually. I'm actually kind of, like, impressed that we did so much of it today. Um, we, I, I don't know if we're going to make it to the end of the week with this game. We might. I mean, we have that area, too, and we have this whole side, but we finished, like, half of sunlit, which is kind of wild. So we have our well here. We have the path up to the Forgotten Lands here. Then we have um, Donald's house right here. And then Casita I decided to put here, which I think looks really cute with the orb, which I thought was really nice. Where are we on item limit? We're actually doing good. Oh. Never mind. Okay, well, we were doing good before everything spawned in, okay? It was at like 2,900, but then all the items spawned in. So now we're at 2,946. That's because all the flowers spawned in. It's fine. We're doing fine. We're doing great. There's an item limit. Yeah, this number right here. We were fine before I exited the menu and all the flowers and all the biomes and stuff spawned back. <clears throat> it's fine. I can go through some places and delete more things. It's okay. Um, the other half of Sunlit isn't going to be as, like, packed, so. Yeah, it's because of console limitations, Roro. Because, um, like, unfortunately, people on Switch don't have the same capabilities as, um, like, PC gamers or um, Xbox or PlayStation or anything like that because the console is just less powerful, you know? So they can only do so much regarding the item limit um, so that they don't break the game for Switch players. So I'll have to like play by ear. ADHD tips for productivity. Also, your man, woman, non various symptoms can support can look a little different. You don't have to answer, but just keep in mind, you can always add that in the search. Yeah, yeah, because I've heard a lot um, that... Uh, Women with ADHD get mixed diagnosed a lot because it presents itself differently. 
I think it's better now, and that doesn't happen as much now, but it used to happen a lot. It's misdiagnoses because it's not like exactly the same <clears throat> from the surface level. So yeah. Or I should say with the uterus havers in general. Um, I know a fact, did you know that if one identical twin has ADHD, autism, or anything similar, then this one has 73% chance of also having it? That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. Honestly, I'm surprised it's only 73%. Cause you know, the whole identical thing. But that checks out. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're chilling. You can literally look up anything on TikTok. Not wrong. Yeah, TikTok's a very good resource. Very good resource. Okay, besties. I think we're good. It is uh 445. So we're gonna wrap up because I don't want to start like a whole new section of this. So um we're gonna wrap up and we're gonna mosey out and then um we'll be back tomorrow. Cause I need to get like a probably a little snack um i had a uh toast this morning but i should probably get a little snack before dinner dinner because it's probably gonna be a while so um let's do that we'll quit doing good 54 items yeah we're getting a little rough on the item limit it's fine it's fine it's fine i'll figure it out i don't know i'm probably gonna have to go through later tonight maybe and uh get rid of some things we'll figure it out tomorrow uh we're a little close i'll probably have to delete some bushes from places but that's fine um let's see let's see what we have and who we have um do 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 hold on hold on yeah I'll see you in discord Thank y'all for being here and being so sweet and wonderful. You're more than welcome to hang out in Discord with us if you want to, obviously. Um, it's always a good time in there. I had a less awful work day. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm glad we could be here for you. Um, let's see. Your sub ends in 30 minutes. Nor! <laughs> Someone stall. <laughs> not 30 minutes it's fine you'll just have to be here right in the beginning of the morning tomorrow um and uh race up it's fine it's fine it's fine <laughs> okay we're gonna um gotta get zinned into you love you all best cc tomorrow in discord stay safe and please snack bar magazine yeah, not you not you promoting snack bars stop it enjoy your dinner thank you all so much for being here and being sweet and adorable and kind and wonderful let's start a hype train besties that's all no you're not starting one the raid is already going too bad um <laughs> too bad the raid is going uh we're gonna go say hi to louie because they are absolutely amazing and so sweet and wonderful so um they're playing breath of the wild though breath of the wild I'm obsessed with snack bar, as you should be. There's a direct link if for some reason it's not taking you with the raid and you want to go with us, or you can also try to refresh and see if it works that way too. Um, reminder, you can join Discord if you haven't already. It's a very fun time to hang out. Um, we're on there all the time. So we have movie nights every Saturday and we will be watching uh, the second Puss in Boots movie this weekend on Saturday. It's gonna be really good. I love that movie so much. It's a uh, absolutely amazing and then also um don't forget to copy a read message whichever applies to you whether you're subbed or not subbed show our friend louie a little bit of love um but yeah i appreciate y'all thank you for being here being so cute and sweet and wonderful tomorrow we'll continue working on sunlit plateau um and we'll see what happens the rest of this week honestly we might start breath of the wild this week i don't know i don't know uh i was thinking we were gonna do it next week but honestly we kind of decorated sunlit plateau a lot quicker than i thought we were going to so we might start it at some point this week tbd but i love you all so much i'll see you in discord and i will see you uh tomorrow for more stream have a good rest of your night do all the self-care and i'll see you then <gasps> bye 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 bye